Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, my name is Mengs, uh, and it's time to check out the new re released Wargroove 2. Uh, if I sound a little weird, it's because I'm sick, so do bear with me, I might cough a little bit. So, uh, yeah, it's time to check out Wargroove 2. Uh, I played the first one on my channel many years ago when it launched. Was it back in 2018? I don't remember. I was very surprised to see that this game got a sequel. I actually didn't expect that, but uh, it did. And uh, I, I checked out the trailer and I was like, hmm, all right, this might be worth looking into. You know, uh, the first Advanced Wars game isn't necessarily what made Advanced Wars great, it was the second one. So maybe Wargroove 2 will be able to do what Wargroove 1 could not and improve the game in a big way and actually be a banger. We will see. Now, full disclosure, before the stream, I did jump into the multiplayer and I played a single quick match just to see, and what I actually saw, I really liked. But in this stream, I'm going to be doing the story, I'm going to be trying to beat the campaign in one go. I don't know if that's feasible, I don't know how long it is, the last campaign was like 25 missions or so, which isn't actually that much, because some of them you really breeze through. So, uh, I am going to be going through the campaign, and we'll be seeing what, what it's going to be. So. Um, I do think that the art style of Wargroove is very charming. I'm not always very big on the humor, I'm gonna be honest, the humor can be a little Reddit sometimes. It's like, oh, the heckin' cute doggerino, whoa! Uh, but I do think it has its charming moments, so. And apparently we have some new factions. We have, like, Ratmen, which I think is really cool. Memorial Isle. Auron Mission, Day Zero. This is Arania? Hmm, a disappointment. Our mountains are larger. And greener. Hey, think they have libraries here? Libraries? I doubt they even heard of books. Do not underestimate Aronia, friends. I have heard horrifying accounts of these lands. They say Aronia has tree people. <laughs> Is that sad? Sea people. Humans! <laughs> well, I've read the humans here don't have souls. When they die, their skeletons walk around forever. Wanna know what I've read? I've read they kiss dogs. On the mouth. Disgusting! So yeah, you, dogs you are kinda cute. Right? The humor is a little hereditary, but, uh, you know, it does have its moments. Dogs are kind of cute, though, right? Of course, Litra thinks that. Isn't this the girl who can't keep her lunch down on the ship? She makes those obnoxious humming noises during meditation. It helps me think. Is there a problem? No, Madame Prisdil. Just making observations. Fantastic. Then why don't you go observe the seas to watch for other ships? They are late enough as it is. Yeah, madame. Oh. Wait, not you. You are a magic user, yes? Come with me. There's something important I need your help with. She needs me? So yeah, these are like the Skavens, I guess, they're inspired by. Uh... Except that they're, you know, nicer. Thanks for saving me. Mm hmm? Hmm? Did you say something? Sorry. Sorry, I'm just curious. Why are we here? Never apologize oh, dear for curiosity. <laughs> Especially not while we seek the most precious thing of all. Knowledge! Okay, so they're, they're nerds, basically. They're Skaven, but instead of being cool, they're nerds. Why are the cutscenes in such small frames? I don't actually know. This is how the original Wargroup did it too, I think. Three years ago, a magic weapon form form a long forgotten war. Three years ago, a magic weapon from lo the long forgotten war co caused quite the stir. Oh, I remember this. A weapon known as Requiem. <laughs> I'm told it nearly ended the world as we knew it. 
Yes, this is a recap of the final battle from Wargroove 2, where they all banded together to fight Requiem. A pretty cool final map, if I may say so. I really liked it. Aronia's leader did manage to defeat it in the end. However, our allies suspected there are other weapons like Requiem out there. They've asked us to seek them and uncover their secrets. Wow. Wow. What? But why do you need me? <sighs> I have been investigating uh, this door all afternoon. <sighs> Yet I still haven't a clue how to enter it. The Kingdom of Cacophony were masters of magic and technology. Between my wits and your magic, our success is inevitable. No. Oh no. Uh... Pistol, please don't be mad. I'm actually not very good at magic. <laughs> Hold that thought. Oh no. Hey, we found this island fair and square. You want to visit? You pay the toll. You want... Oh, hand over your gold. Oh, this is a robbery with just the two of you. Fascinating. Let's see how that works out. Alright, time to learn how to play the game. I'll handle these imbeciles. You just keep working on that yes, dough. Yes, madam. Alright, so it's gonna mm. teach us how to play. So, uh, again, I mean, we have to go through the tutorial. I wish there was, like, a way to click, like, hey, I played World Group 1, I don't need a tutorial, but I guess they want everyone to go through it. So we gotta go and, uh, swordsmen are the most basic unit. As I am a commander, my victory is assured. Yeah, commanders are really OP. They one-shot infantry units. I don't have time. So, the presence of your commander does mix things up quite a bit. I do like it. What the heck was that? The power of crystal technology! A bit advanced for you, I'm afraid. <laughs> but I'm happy to provide further demonstration. Wow. So cool! Alright, now we got... get two swordsmen. Ah, Litra, your sword friends have arrived. We're not her friend. Just in time, too. I've already performed an action this turn. You two swordsmen will have to take care of the rest. Well, right, Phil, time to show your worth. Attack the Spearman. So yeah, if uh, if you attack from adjacent from a commander, you get a critical hit with these guys. Again, so far, this game looks identical to the first one. I failed to strike yes. them down? Yeah, it's a bit of a shame, really. A shame you don't use all the tools at your disposal. Each unit type has a special condition that allows them to deal massive damage. We call that a critical hit. A swordsman will perform a critical hit when it's next to the commander. We should try a critical hit now with the other swordsman. And there we go. No, no. Yeah, I, I know how to play, dumb game. There you go. Oh, I feel more powerful somehow. Yes, I see, see the flashing damage preview. That indicates a critical hit. Now strike. Critical hits are actually one of my favorite mechanics of Wargroove. I think it's a really, really cool mechanic. Meng's doing the full campaign in one Madam? one go. That short, or is he gonna stream for like 24 hours? I don't know how big the campaign is. Madam Pistol, what what is the number for besides the swordman? Oh, uh, excellent question. That's the health indicator. Full health units begin at uh, 100 HP and have no indicator. But our swordman's swordsman's foolish behavior has reduced his health to around 60 HP. Attack power is based on unit health, so this swordsman will deal less damage from now on. Alright, we got some- oh, oh god, that's a lot of reinforcements. I hope we get some new units then. Lytra, dear. How are things coming along oh. with the dome? I think I figured something out. Brilliant girl, let's route the rest of these fools. Alright, so we, we have- uh, are these the same unit? Oh, they're just facing different directions? They look very different. Let's be sure to practice critical hits whenever possible. Okay, so... I guess the best thing for me to do would be to go down here. And then attack, and then attack Let's adjacent. Hmm. Ah! There we go. And then we go down here and score a critical hits. Yeah! They have different fur colors. Oh, of course they do. Yes, Wargroove, very progressive. Gotta have different fur colors on the mouse. Very important. You're so early in America? Yeah, I know. I'm six hours ahead of you, so it's pretty early now. But I wanted to start early. Because I plan to do a very long sprint. Alright, looks like we lost some swordsmen. Oopsie. That's a shame. 
but we can finish the rest of this battle with our commander. Hold still. So, so far, this place identical to War Group 1. Like, there are no differences. But I do know for a fact that there are quite a few new mechanics. And I appreciate that you get to play around a little bit in the prologue, that it doesn't hold your hand too much. There we go. And the swordsmen are defeated. Well, well, seems we won the robbery. Please let this work. Please let something I do work for once. What's going on? I have been a fool. Oh no, Valder, what are you doing? <gasps> okay, so we're going through the, the various countries. What? No. That's Ryota. What? It worked? Lytra! This is magnificent. Quickly, everyone, there's research to do. My word, just look at the stonework. Uh, uh, Madame Pastille. And such details and gravings. Pistol! Pistol, we can't get in. Hmm, am I trapped? How curious. I wonder what sort of mechanism. Pistol, what do we do? There are more bandits out there. Listen, dear, there is enough here to keep me occupied for hours. Instead of asking me for every little thing, what if you were in charge until I return? Me? Me? Yes, you. There, problem solved. Her? Yes, yes, the magical girl is in charge. I don't like repeating myself. I am terminating this conversation. Goodbye. If Lithra's in charge, we're definitely going to die. In any case, let's head back to the ship. We must warn the others. She trusts me? Wargrove drinking game. Take a shot every time they mention knowledge, research, or studying. Well, that's their gimmick. I won't let you down, madame. That's their gimmick! We gotta enforce the gimmick! Alright, here we go. So yeah, you get stars when you beat missions. And to unlock certain guidance chapters, you gotta have multiple stars. Mm. One thing I will say, the soundtrack is always spectacular when it comes to Wargroove. Ah! Monster. Mm. Ah! Let's see. This one a little bit like so. All right, Luther and Co are definitely lost. They are taking the scenic route. Yes, I am a boomer, a proud boomer. Friends, we have been walking for nearly an hour. Perhaps we should reassess our path. Your perception of time is faulty. This is the correct path to the ship, I'm certain. Or would you rather listen to Lithra? Madame Pastille did leave Lithra in charge. Ugh. Uh. So, uh, the sound of the ocean is actually quieter this way. Actually, um, uh, mm, uh, maybe let's, uh, turn back, uh. What? You can't hear the ocean from here? Stop making things up. What? I'm not. This is ridiculous. What? Look up ahead. Thank goodness. Where's the ship? We lost ourselves, unfortunately. There are houses up ahead. Perhaps we should ask for directions? People live here, but only but the only people we've seen so far were. Oh no, more bandits! Those were the imps we were messing with with the old bell. That old cacophony junk. Boss will kill us if he finds out. Not if we kill them first. Did he just run away? He just ran away. Oh, what should we do? Easy, friend. Just use the archer's critical hits. If you do not remember how, we can check the info screen. Yeah, so archers, they score a critical hit. Open the... Oh, really? I have to do this now? So I have to open the... Uh, so, yeah, I would open this. Yeah. The info screen can help you size up unfamiliar units. This section displays the unit's critical hit condition. As you can see, the archer crits when it attacks without moving. There is more to explore with the info screen, but for now you may close this window. So yeah, archers, they crit when they stand still. So I just have to strike without moving, easy. So, uh, wait, what's that? Name? Oh, you can name your units! That's actually cool, I like that! You can give your units names now! Alright, that's, that's actually a pretty cool mechanic. <laughs> 
so you can be devastated when you lose them. Amazing. Urgh, that's it. Take them all out. All right, let's see if I can. Charge! Wait, friends. We must be smart about our approach. Huh? Huh? Normally, this spare unit would overpower your swordsman, but terrain can help even the odds. Shallow water reduces the spearman's defense, making it more vulnerable to attack. Additionally, your swordsman will gain a defense boost from attacking from the forests. Let's try using this area's terrain to our advantage. Yeah, so one of the things that I really hope they fix in Wargrove 2 are Spearmen, because Spearmen creates a very stally meta in, in competitive PvP because of how, like, you line them up next to each other to get critical hits. So, Wargrove PvP was, like, lines and lines of Spearmen walls, which was not fun to watch or play. So I really wonder if they've nerfed Spearmen in this, in this game. Amazing work, friend. We should use the tile info screen to investigate any unfamiliar terrain from now on. Got it. Help! Assistance, please! Your archer is in danger from the enemy swordsman. Archers are powerful, but quite fragile. Consider moving your swordsman to the forest to defend this archer. There we go. You still have one more unit to move this turn. Before you move your last unit, take note. You can undo all moves you've taken this turn by selecting Undo Turn from the mission menu. Oh, they did a, they did a turn wheel mechanic. I'm not terribly sad about that. Hmm, the strategy here will be a bit more difficult. Sometimes terrain will force you to make tough choices. If your archer stands still, she'll deal critical hit damage, but she'll be stuck in the shallow water. Retreating to the mountain behind her may be a better option. Attack now or retreat, the choice is yours. So, I actually think attacking is better. Hmm, actually, maybe not. 57, yeah. Because the enemy archer is in a terrain. Yeah, I think I'll retreat, actually. There we go. Will our strategy work? We'll find out soon enough. Oh, you only get one? Oh, you only get one. I mean, I don't terribly mind. Actually, maybe this wasn't the best. Eh, maybe it was. So, animations are exactly the same. So far, this is exactly like War Group 1. Thanks to your strategic thinking, you're in great shape to def quickly defeat the remaining units. Remember to use terrain defense and critical hits to your advantage. Yeah, that works. So, uh, yeah, let's just do a crit. Can we name them now? Can I name my units yet? Oh, I can! Uh, Bane, Gady. There you go. There you go. Look at that! <laughs> that's <coughs> that's actually pretty cute. Uh, that's actually really cute. You can I can name them after chat. That is uh, that is actually adorable. I like this feature. There you go. And then I can kill you horribly. Mm -mm. I think what it, I, I don't really know if there's any point to this aside from just it's cool, but uh, it might it might help you differentiate some units. I don't know if there's gonna be like level up in this game or whatnot. Why can't I not attack? UI is a little bit janky. Sometimes it doesn't register your mouse clicks for some reason. All right, and then we'll go and kill this guy. And I do believe that is this mission defeated. That's good for a roguelike mode, yeah, and, cust and custom right. games too. We did it, we won. No, we won, you just won. Why are they so rude to her? Let's just go, friends. Two hours later. Sorry. Sorry, but uh... haven't we passed that statue before? Like five times? Are we going in circles? Ah, uh, shut up, Lithra. I know the way. I can do this. I know I can. I'm not like you, but I'm not. I'm not. Stupid. Pilthrim, I am exhausted by your behavior as of late. Do not toggle me, friend. Lithra has made mistakes. So what? It is her first mission. Ah, oh, stop being a white knight. 
It's our entire army's first mission. Of course there will be mistakes. Need I remind you who got us lost in the first place? Oh no, he's, he's standing up for the woman, you guys. Octagon. Yes? Yell at him again. Should I not wait for him to respond? You heard her, Tago. Yell. Ah! It's just like the dome from before. It activates with sound. That is a decent observation. Why couldn't I think of that? Uh, I'm always just a... Oh, never mind. Let's just get out of here already. Oh, uh... Ah! Wah! Name that guy Simpman. Yeah, maybe we should. Wait, please, friend. Uh. I'm not stupid either. He just doesn't even know me. Things are not well at home for Filtrum, Lithra. I don't think there are for anyone else on this mission. I will not ask you for to give him, only to remember that... All rats are queens. <sighs> Chamber of Lost Souls. Traveler, in these walls lies the true cost of war. Our friends, our families, our children gone. Fallen soldiers from both lands. Oh, this is the commoner's tomb. I wonder... I wonder if there's anyone more important down here. Oh wow, commoners are not important, you guys. Princess Elodie sacrificed herself to seal Requiem forever. <laughs> hmm, wasn't quite forever, was it? What's this? Hmm, who are these two? Prince Harmon of Cacophony. Prince Sordino of Silmore. The war's first deserters. Would that we followed their lead. May your souls find peace wherever you are. Eureka! Here we are, look at this. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. Oh. Oh dear, I suppose that's my cue. Alright. Let's go on to the next mission. An ancient artifact. Lithra and Co. find new trouble old friends and a strange crystal device. Um, could we stop and rest for a bit? I think some of us are still hurt from the last battle. There is an abandoned village up ahead. They may have supplies we can use. Ah, so now we're gonna be taught about reinforcements and fortifications. So now it wants us to capture properties. I will say, I like how properties are captured instantly in Wargroove. That is actually one of my favorite aspects of this game. The capture game is very different from Advanced Wars, but it works. Buildings actually have hit points, and you can attack them by destroying them, and they will actually defend themselves when attacked. And you can use the buildings to heal your own units, but that drains the building's hit points, which is a cool mechanic. Village secured, now let's see about those supplies. Use reinforce to siphon health from structures you control. Really cool. It does cost money, though, so be aware of that. You know, it's not free. There are not enough supplies to go around here. Lithra, shall we? We shall have to heal you up ahead. The property system here is actually better than the one that evolves for us. Yes, it is. Look, friends, is that not our ship? What is it doing so here? It's not right. Where is everyone? Oh, more pirates, I guess. Another village up ahead. Bandits are guarding this one, though. We'll need to defeat them before we can capture the village and resupply. Alright. So let's use our units to attack the village. So you actually need to defeat it. Hans? Wait, they gave the pirates a name? Now we capture, right? Indeed, but we should leave that to our swordsmen. Capture structures begin with half health with capturing units, so it's better to capture with your higher health units. Let's go and capture. There we go. Got it. Help! Hey, reinforcements. What? What's going on? What happened to the ship? Bandits seized it. Everyone fled. We know not how many survived. This isn't good, friends. Lithra, why don't you reinforce here while we figure this out? Alright, let's go and reinforce. There we go. Up to six health. And here come some more bandits. So, there's more of you, eh? Oh, damn. Band of Hans, attack! What do we do? There's so many of them. Is this only on Steam? Uh -huh. I think so. I haven't seen it on the Switch. Ah, finally, here we are. Madam, Madam Pistol. Oh, Sigur is playable in this game. I've seen her. So, she's one of the COs available. Look at what I've uncovered. 
Oh, uh, uh, a harp? What is it? <laughs> Who can say? A baby-sized loom? A be beadless abacus? Or perhaps a Mantra. weapon? Whatever it is, I'm sure you can make sense of it, just like the dome. Wait! Wait, madame, you aren't going to help us fight? No. No, those ruffians have stolen our ships. Along with one of my, along with one of, along with my one-of-a-kind technology, I'm going to sneak aboard. You just get that artifact working. <laughs> You're in charge while I'm gone. She's in charge. Isn't that the girl who always, without Lithner, would never have found you, friends? Ugh, Targo is correct. Lithner is our commander now. If you don't like it, fight quickly. All right. So we find we have our commander unit now. I want. I wonder what her groove is like. Can I see what her groove is? I don't think I can. Maybe maybe it's available in the codex. Oh, here we go. So here's her groove. It's called Song Cyclone. Fling units around Lithra up to 180 degrees in the chosen direction. So it charges... It deals damage, and it slows. Oh, okay, so she... So, by the way, it seems like every commander has a groove and a super groove now, similar to Advanced Wars 2 superpowers. Song Cyclone bonus. Affected units lose their next turn. She, she stuns units. That's really cool. I like that. So it's like a crowd control group. Anyway, let's go and reinforce a bit more. We got some guys over here. Um... What, what is this? Is that a priest? No, this is another archer, okay. So we probably just want to set up our units adjacent to our commander. Now, in the old game, units would always attack your commanders if they were able to. I don't know if they still do that. So we're going to find out. It was very easy because they would always attack your commander no matter what. It seems like... Oh, they also like attacking buildings. It seems like the AI is still very similar. They go for properties first, and then your commander. But whenever you can make them go for your commander, that's very good for you. Because your commander heals every turn. But, uh, looks like we have, uh, we have some archers that can score critical hits. How groovy. And then we can use the swordsman right here to attack. The grove doesn't slow, its charge time is slow. Oh! Oh! Yeah! That's a good point, yeah. It, the grove doesn't slow, it has a slow- yeah, okay. So, the first one is medium, the second one is slow. Ah, okay, I see. Ah, okay. So I believe most of the grooves are just like a stronger version of their basic grooves. Which is a little boring, but, you know. Anyway, let's heal up. I think we're just gonna wait. Roman rats. Yeah, that's actually a very good description. They're Roman rats. All right, let's capture. Wow. The artifact, <laughs> it makes a sound when it hits something. And the strings vibrates. Lithra, what are you doing? Focus on the battle. But yeah, I'm just gonna move forward with my units. It seems like the AI will still just like target your commanders no matter what. So it should be fairly easy for me to just bait them. Hey! hey. Hopefully there's a good multiplayer matchmaking system. I am very sorry to say this, guys, but I queued up for a quick match and it seems to be identical to Wargroove 1, aka random quick matches, which made me a little bit upset, not gonna lie. Oh, wait, was that the boss? Oh, did I just kill him? No, he's here. Oh, okay. Former Cherrystone Alchemist asserted as the- Is that actually a hero unit? Or is it just a name generic? Mini Commander. Oh, okay. Is he just a regular unit then? That's kind of funny. There seems to be a bridge here. Maybe I need to activate it. 
So mini commanders are a thing now, apparently. A commander without a groove. Yeah, that could be the case. Oh, cool. I can shoot over the river. That's actually pretty smart. There is one thing I absolutely detest about Wargroove, and it seems to be carried over in this one. And that's the fact that it seems like the units still have random, like, they still have different names per faction. Which is very confusing to newer players. They're stronger than they look. Lower the drawbridges. Yes, sir. Okay, so that's how you do it. Okay, I thought they were gonna ambush spawn me. Lithra, what did we do? I know we- I know- I don't know if we can handle all of them. Hey! I think I know how the artifact works now. Get this, you use it for music. Music? Unlikely. Wait. No, see, you pull out the strings with your fingers and listen. Oh, she has her groove now. That glow. Quick, get their commander before she can use her groove! Commanders, units charged with heavy responsibilities of work can access unique abilities in times of need. Lithra's grooves flings units around in an arc up to 180 degrees in the chosen direction. Oh. Okay. I need to use the artifact's power. Oh, okay. Okay, this is interesting. Ha! Huh. Okay. That is really weird. Coming at you live. Oh, wow. Okay, so you can't fling them into the water. It worked. Grr, at least that commander, at least commanders can't use their groove every turn. Get them before she can recharge. Okay, so that is a disgustingly strong group. That is a disgust- and it stuns them, too. Commander Luthra, it's the bandit leader. Right, um, we would like to have our ship back, please. Uh, that weapon. If I can't let- I can't let them lead. Okay, so that is a disgusting groove. That is, like, really, really powerful. And it seems like units are stunned, similar to Von Bolt's Ex Machina, so... I don't even know if they'll be able to retaliate. That is actually crazy. Are these priests? What are these? Ranged ground units are able to move... Okay, no, they're, they're archers. Better than Ex Machina. Well, she has to be close to activate it, but it's still pretty good. I wasn't quite sure how it worked, though. It seemed a little confusing to me, but we'll see. Alright, let's capture. So I'm curious to see if this guy is, like, any stronger than a regular archer. Um, doesn't seem like he is. Fantastic. Excellent. They're distracted. What? 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 What have they done to my beautiful crystal cannons? It'll take our ages to sort this out. Uh, yeah, it seems like they're just... Yeah, there's nothing special about this guy. He's just a named... It's just a named unit. Literally just a name generic. But that's cool. Uh, is that the best you got? Nope. This is the best I got. I don't even know if he's stronger than a regular archer. He seems just like a normal unit to me. Grr. Uncle, what's going on? They got an artifact from the ruins. We can't let them leave with it. You want your ship? Come and take it. Wait, what? But... But... But, but the mouse is there. How curious. The ship is moving, though. I haven't told it to. She's so useless. Friends, what now? The ship's our only way off this book-forsaken island. Lithra, can you, um... Hey, hear where the ship is headed? Uh, I think... No. I I'm sure I can do it. Okay. Cool. Congratulations! Let's continue. Uh-oh! Fog of War! Let's go! Looks like the bandit camp is up ahead. 
The ship's here too, just like Lithra said. Is this everyone? We lost a lot of people today. Ah, we've only got one chance to take back that artifact. Might be the most important thing any of us ever do. Okay, here we go. But wait, why can I see them if it's Fog of War? Uh-oh, they look more prepared than last time. Friends, look, a barrack! We should capture it. We can use it to bolster our ranks. But why can I see the enemy? This is so weird. Huh? That's so weird. It's it's Fog of War, but I get vision of the enemy? Oh, wow, that? The barracks won't be available until next turn. In the meantime, we should renew our, review our plan. Oh, it's just nighttime. Ah. It's a map of our whole area. Did you make this? Indeed, friend. Here's our main objectives. We must either defeat the bandit leader or defeat their stronghold. The stronghold is a castle-shaped structure in the... Yeah, it's their HQ, basically. Bonus objective. Use Lithra's groove to fling an enemy into the sea. Oh, I like it. Bonus objectives. Capture two... That's great. I love this. This is great. It's like additional bonus objectives for extra stars. Like fun little side objectives. This is great. This is absolutely fantastic. I added some optional objectives. They should be fun to try if we get bored. This isn't the game. Save the fighting for the enemy, friends. Alright, that's cool. Okay, so this isn't Fog of War, it's just nighttime? Seems a little bit weird to me, but okay. Boss, they're here. Don't let them escape. Form up. Surround them all. Don't let a single one escape. Let's go! I think the barracks is ready now. Yeah, so now we can produce... Yeah, so this is... I absolutely despise this. Duelists, perforator, archaeologist... Just look. Wargroove, for, for the love of Christ. Just call them swordsmen, pikemen, uh, archers, knights, priests. Like, I, I understand you're trying to give, like, flair to the units. But this is so confusing to newer players, because they may have played World War One and they're like, Swordsman? Is the duelist different from a swordsman? No, they're not they're not different at all. All swordsmen are the same. They just have different names, and I hate it. It is so unneedlessly complicated. They even call it a swordsman in the tutorial. It's not that complicated. No, it's not. You get used to it, but it's unnecessary. Still, every unit counts recruit a swordsman for now. I don't hate it, you get used to it, but I wish it wasn't like that. I wish we could afford more than a swordsman, no offense. None taken. I also wish I was not here. <laughs> okay, that's fine. <coughs> that's pretty funny. To build a bigger ink army, you need more gold. So we need to capture more properties, got it. At the start of each turn, you'll receive 100 gold for every village you control. That's actually really funny. Alright, so let's just capture all the properties, like so. Hey, we got the side objective. That's cool. And we'll send our commander first, because commanders eat swordsmen for dinner. Come to return the artifact, strangers. This night mode is actually nice looking. Yeah, it is. I wonder what's different about it, though, if it's just... Is it just, like, visual? It's also very good to have your commander uh, see a lot of combats, so they get a lot of groove charge. Maybe they have a type of units that profits from the night effect. Maybe there's like a day-night cycle now? That would actually be really cool. Alright, that's cool. Lithra, you can't use your groove to help? I'm having a little trouble getting it to work. Commander draws strings from the brave deeds of their armies. You'll gain group charge whenever any of your units attacks, counterattacks, defeats an enemy, or captures a structure. The commander's group become available at 100% charge or higher. So we are at 54% group charge right now. Alright. Let's use the pikemen to kill these guys. Also, don't get reckless. Commanders are strong but not invincible. Yeah. And it is very common to lose in war group because you overextend your commander. It happens all the time. Get 
Getting a groove by cat. Oh, you get groove. Everything your commander does generate groove charge. Here but I killing come. units is the absolute best way to get groove. It, it doesn't matter if it's a 1 HP swordsman unit. You get a lot of groove every time you kill a unit. Look, I just went up to 78% groove charge. So we can do a critical hit on this village to kill it, which is really cool. All of your units gives you a group. Yes, all of your... Oh, that's different, actually, from War Group 1. You get groove every time you attack now. Oh. But I also think you get extra groove charge when your commander lands a killing blow, right? So you get more groove charge in general. Okay. But you can see your commander isn't invisible, I invincible, so you gotta be careful. Oof, I can't give up now. And the AI really likes to focus your commander, too. But this is good, because any damage that we take, we can repair back up, so it's fine. Hey, Uncle, that warship's got cannons, doesn't it? Let's use them. Show these gannets what's for. Already tried. Must be busted. My cannons are flawless. You busted them with your stupid hands. But I'll fix them soon, just you wait. Ah, we're gonna get a battleship. That's cool. Alright, so let's uh, see if we can... Uh, so our commander is very injured, which we gotta be very careful about that. Did mini commanders are promotions for takedown and surviving? I wish. If there's some kind of like level up system for this game, that would be amazing. Your charge lift thrust grew up to 100%, however all commanders have a second stronger groove at 200% charge. To monitor groove charge, hover over commander, the charge meter will appear in the bottom corner of the screen. So I kind of want to use my groove right now, but she's on 3 HP and I really don't want her to die. So I'm gonna... Um, I'm gonna play this a bit more cautiously, I think. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna kill the village. I'm gonna capture the village. And then I'm gonna put this... I'm probably just gonna attack because I don't like keeping this archer alive. But I'm gonna use the village to heal my commander, I think. The animations are a bit faster. Yeah, they might be, actually. Alright, heal up to eight. That's great. And why don't we just get the first strike on these swordsmen while we can? Do archers get penalty at night? I think so far, this nighttime mode is literally just visual. I don't think there's anything to it. All right, let's get another duelist out. Loving the music. The music is so nice. Well, that village didn't last long. But yeah, it seems like animations are just a teensy bit faster. I wish the counterattack came a little bit faster, though. Oh, looks like I lost the swordsman. Oh well, it's fine. Now, I'll be reading some donations very soon, guys. Oh no. Don't worry, in Wargroove it's generally fine to lose non-commander units, as long as you ha have the resources to replace them. Don't care about your units. Alright, let's see if we can, uh, let's just use the song. So, um, so they're gonna end up here then. Yeah, if we do this... Coming at you live! There we go. Oh no, that didn't work. Uncle, help, we're overrun. Wait, I thought... I still don't 100% know how this groove works. I thought that would make the unit end up in the ocean. That was kind of weird. Hmm. Can someone explain to me how that works? Oh, that was a bit... No, no, but... Okay, so they're moved 180 degrees. Ah, okay. Oh, I can rewind. That's that's a very good point. You killed... Yeah, but I want the... Okay, so if I want the archer... Oh, okay, I see. But if I do this, the archer will go like... Oh, okay. Then the archer will end up there. You can choose if it's 90s. Is there any way for me to get this archer? I don't think so. So I'll just attack normally then. How about this? <sighs> right tile to put it into the sea. Okay. The 
tile above the village's water, yeah. Well, we'll see, we'll see. I might still be able to complete the side objective. And I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get control of the ship very soon. Alright, let's get a uh, perforator. Okay, so that's a spare man. But they're slow. <coughs> Drown hands. Damn it all. Hold, hold on. Look, I know what I'm beat. Just leave that artifact where you found it, and I'll yield. What do you want with it? I don't want it, nor should you. Cacophony artifacts are a danger to us all. Wait, you're not suggesting we would use it to hurt people? I meant besides today. We were sent here to do research, not wage war. <laughs> That's how it always starts, research. Just like Heaven Song's engineering. Oh, what the? Or or Felheim's experimenting with the fail fell gauntlet. Behold the fell gauntlet. Cherry Stone's battle mages. They used to be doctors. Okay, we get it. War bad. If you're not gonna listen to sense, draw your swords. I'll die before another war comes to our Aur uh, Nina. Okay. So, so the moral of the story here is war bad. Got it. But it's called War Group. And dead. Okay, I'm gonna drown hounds. I'm gonna see if I can do it. Lithra, something's different about the bandit leader. I feel it too. Units with this symbol carry items that grants powerful abilities. Use the tile info screen to check these abilities before you advance. Oh. Okay. Oh, Lucius Bow. Units gain 1 times 5 defense boost, 1 times 5 attack boost, and 1 attack. Oh. Can I get that? I would love that. Oh wow, that's a pretty good item. So wait, can you equip can you equip generic artifacts to random units? Really cool if true. I wonder if that's going to be used in quick games at all. But yeah, we're going to drown Hans next turn, guys. See if we can get the achievement. I do like how your turn auto ends when you buy all the units. Connect the wires, grease the ignition, and... It's alive! Oh, ho, ho. oh, oh what a funny reference. Now, how do I stare at this thing? No, my unit! Maybe that's why you have the option to name them, to know where the items are. Yeah, I think so too, actually. So I think my groove charge is above 100 now. Everyone protect our commander at all costs. Yeah, so now I have 145% groove charge. Alright, we're gonna drown hounds now. So how do I do this? If I go like this, wait, what? Why can't I use my groove? Huh? Oh, do I- Oh, I, I can't move and use it? Really? Oh! Really? So I can't... That's interesting. What's this, by the way? Um... Uh, looks like a tower. Is it just ah? Uh, it's just a uh, it's just a visual thing. I don't think you can use it on mini commanders, really. Uh oh. Uh oh. Not my commander. Okay. This. Nah. This is fine. Got to be a little careful though. Huh. So wait, can I use it now? No, I cannot. 
Huh. Okay, if I do this, Let's he should end dance. up in the water, right? There you go. What? Oh, it's a beach tile. Oh my goodness, I'm so dumb. So now I cannot rewind anymore. No, I only get to do it once. It's difficult to tell the difference, okay? When you're colorblind. Anyway, should be able to kill him next turn, so this is fine. I don't know if building more units gives you a better ranking. Hmm. The graphics may look like, but the readability is terrible. A little bit. Oh my goodness, can this guy die? Oh my god, he's hiding behind a tower. That is actually really annoying. So, this looks like a structure, but it, it's just like a... Okay, I don't need to do anything else. Looks like you skipped recruiting a unit this turn. Oh, it's, it's it gonna call me a noob for base skipping? In Wargroup, the size of your army is often the key to victory. Therefore, it's a good practice to recruit as often as possible, even if you can only afford weaker units. That's a nice tip, though. I like that it tells you not to base skip. That's actually really cool. Alright, we can get a critical hit now. That's actually really cool. And he's dead. I didn't know Manx had a mouse for Sona. Give up, sir, please. Uh, no. There's only one way you're taking that thing off this island. Over my cold, dead. What have we here? Madam! Madam Pistil. <laughs> ah, Lithra, you're right on time. Ready? Aim? Oh my god, she just fucking killed him. Another victory for she scientific just, She just murdered that guy with a cannon. That's kind of dark. Another victory for science. What was that idiot blabbering about anyway? He was... <laughs> rhetorical question. There's no time for stories. Not whilst we have a fresh lead. Should we not wait for other ships to arrive? They'll simply have to catch up. Research waits for no one. Our ship departs in two minutes. Wow. In the name of science. Yeah, it's, it's okay to kill people as long as you do it in the name of science, guys. Lithra, you were very brave, friend. Me? Me? Not at all. Tago is correct as always. You performed adequately. More than that, more than I can say for my useless... Oh, more than I can say for my useless self? Peltram, I will not stand here while you slander my best friend. Our victory is owed to all of us together, including you. Lithra, save you, save you a seat in the galley. Hold on, are we all just supposed to be friends with you now? Uh... Um, yes? Cool. Well, that conflict got de-escalated quickly. What did that bandit mean about bad news? No, he must be wrong. I have friends now, thanks to this thing. How dangerous could it be? Oh boy, we're the bad guys. Oh no, we're the villains, guys. We're the villains, guys! We're the bad guys! I didn't get three stars. Oh, interesting. New campaigns unlock. Campaigns can be played in any order. However, if you are new to the game's mechanics, we recommend you continue the Far East journey in Breaking Ground. The campaign will introduce you to some important game mechanics. Sure. Ah, I like that. That's really cool. Rising Tides, Dark Skies, Breaking Ground. Ah, Intermediate, Intermediate. And then I guess you get you unlock that campaign last. That's really cool. Okay, we're, we're, well, let's go with the cannon route for now. The Gloomwoods. Ah, it's time for uh, it's time for Nuru. Uh, is it Nuru or Muru? I think it's Muru. Something in the shadows. Stand back. Show yourself. Muru, I hope we'd run into you. Ah, it's Mercia and uh, Percival. No, Mercival. Mercival. Uh, no, Emmerich. Emmerich. Mercival is her father. Emmerich thought we should fly over the Gloomwoods. But miss, but miss seeing you, not a chance. <laughs> Isn't Nura from another uh. game? I think she is. Is everything all right? Yeah, it's fine. But you shouldn't be here right now. What's going on? Nothing. <laughs> Just busy getting ready for my big day, you know? 
You know you can tell me anything, right? Ugh. There's nothing to tell. I'm handling it. I'm fine. Well, all right then. We'll only be in Heaven Song a week, so dipl um, or, or so diplomatic business. I'll pass through on my way back, okay? I want to see you all properly. Okay, sure thing. But Later, Queenie. My queen. My queen. Come, you'll catch a cold out here. My queen. All women are queens. Muru. Why Muru didn't tell Mercia? <sighs> Get back to patrol. Oh, now she's keeping secrets. Why is she keeping secrets? Did the Rosen hear that? If she photosynthesizes, she's a thought. Elsewhere in the forests. Oh, we're back with the rat people? Lithra, I'm open, I'm open. Here goes nothing. You should have been more perceptive, friend. Score one for Tago. Are they using it as a bowl? Madam. Oh. What have we here? Um, we are researching the durability of the artifact. Ah. Ah, clever thinking, Lithra. We'll have to see about you getting published when we get back As home. As for me... As for me, I've just finished examining the area. No sign of an ancient ruins, but no forest folk either. We should be safe here for now. Think we'll find more artifacts here, madam? Of course. Without a doubt. Our allies. According to our allies, these woods were once cacophony seat of power. Why don't we finish setting up camp while I plan our next yeah! move? Yes, madam. I smell a rat. Hey, what's up with that spearman? To tree people! There are many Florence converging on our location. We must prepare quickly. Ooh. Intruders! Pistol! We're under attack! Aha! This calls for another one of my brilliant plans. If you can hold the floor enough for about nine turns, I'll have just the thing to take them all out all at once. All right, defense mission, got it. Cool. Hey. All right, everyone, we just need to defend our stronghold for nine turns. Just the stronghold, but we bet we stop them from setting. Bet we could stop them from setting foot in our camp altogether. <laughs> You're on. Is that going to be the bonus objective? Yeah, prevent the floor from entering camp. Bonus objectives are completely optional, intended for players who crave a more challenging experience. I like that. And we also have defeat three cavalry units using spearmen. Okay, easy enough. All right, so we got a floor and knight coming in here. Interesting. Let's just begin by capturing a bunch of uh, buildings. Send this guy over here. Can I like um, increase game speed? Options. Yeah, here we go. General. Uh, animations. Uh, movement. Always fasts. There you go. Oh, I like that you can skip the cutscenes from for, for multiple playthroughs. That's actually really cool. Did you, did you play on Switch, PC, or Steam Deck? I think Wargroove 2 is PC only. This... Oh no. He's attacking our village. Is he just going to keep doing that? Uh-oh. That unit's really tough. What can we do? Do you remember how to check a unit's strengths and weaknesses? Yes. Great. Let's use the info screen to see the cavalry unit's weakness. Then we can recruit. Yep. So that's easy enough. We'll just attack it with the spearmen. This is another reason why spearmen are just incredibly good. Like, they're very defensive. They crit often if you keep them next to each other. And they're good against knights. So I guess we should probably build more of those. Oh shit, I just placed myself in range. We'll build more pikemen. Put me in, coach. Let's get some more uh, properties. Like so. The music is so good, by the way. It is amazing. And that guy just suicided? Okay. Meng's mech spamming, what else wow. is new? Cylinder, you're so strong. What can I say? Horses don't like spares. Wait! Everyone waits! 
Hmm? What's I that? I think I hear more Florence coming down that path. Enemy reinforcements, be on guard. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, so they actually, it actually shows you where the, where the reinforcements come from. Neat little mechanic, I like that. That's actually really cool. Anyway, that archer stupidly just decided to let me attack it, so I'm just gonna attack it. And then we can reinforce at the barrack. Of course, that does mean that uh, let's just let's just spam a bunch of pikemen. Because if this if this is a defense mission, pikemen are absolute king. Hmm. Now where did Aha. I put that? Aha! Yes, this should do splendidly. Uh, oh no 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 no! I really should start wearing gloves. Yeah, we're gonna mech spam our way to victory, guys. That pikeman took 5 damage from the 5 HP archer. Um, so maybe they have nerfed pikeman. Looks like they could... Oh, there we go. We got reinforcements. Enemy reinforcements to the west. Okay, I think I hear more coming from over there. I like that the game tells you where the reinforcements come from. That's really nice. I do like that a lot. Alright, let's get our commander into, uh, into the action here. No! That was a misclick. Let's let's undo the turn. That was a misclick. <laughs> I pressed wait instead of attack. Why doesn't it allow me to just attack by by like doing this and then just like double click? I swear to god you could do that in the old game. Like select the unit, move down, and then like double click to attack. Why can't I do that anymore? That was actually really nice. Divine Pulse is a good mechanic, but I like that you only get a single one per mission. That is actually really nice. Alright, uh, should we get some archers out? Probably a good idea. It is a defense mission after all. Alright, let's read some donations. Sturm donated 100 Swedish crowns through Super Chat. Thank you. Swordsman exists. Commander. Om nom nom. Also manx. Have you considered making a video on Advanced Wars Reboot? You said that you had a problem with it, and I for one think you should make it known. Yeah, so it's a video I'm kind of dreading making, but yeah. It is a video I'm going to make at some point. Sab donated one ninety nine to Super Chat. She's going to war in my groove until I'm going to too. Yes, yes, Seb. Yes. Madam Pistol, we could really use some help out here. <laughs> Fear not. In just five turns, my plan will positively shock you with wonder. And electricity. Okay. So we're already on turn five, though. This doesn't seem that hard. Anyway, we should probably attack with our commander. I will say the units are a little samey. It's kind of hard to... I don't know if anyone else agrees with this, but I have a few... They're a Here little I bit come. hard to differentiate. They all look like rats, essentially. <laughs> turn Sarkana now? I guess so. All right, let's just spam Spearman. That's how we're gonna win this. Can okay, this guy? Okay, now we're gonna keep our archers here. And it's very important to keep the pikemen next to each other, like so. And let's get even more pikemen. Rip commander? What? But my commander's on full health. Ah, oh, that's a crit! Oh, that's a crit! That's a double crit! Am I dead? Am I dead? Oh! Okay, that's not a crit, though. Woo! Okay, that was kind of scary. <coughs> I almost died. Shit, I almost died. <coughs> I think I hear more Florence coming. Wait, from behind? Oh, damn! And there's- oh, there's a property here I didn't get. Would you look at that? Okay, well, that was, um... That was really, really scary. Alright, we need to think about this. So let's attack this archer first. Let's get that critical hit. Turn six out of nine. Ha ha ha. And we can wipe out this guy with a Spearman crit. For 116% damage. That's nice. 
And we have our groove ready right now, but I don't think I'm going to use it just yet. So uh, let's just attack with our archers. Let's bring some pikemen down here as well. So I think I might fail the bonus objective, you guys. Should I just attack this guy too? Yeah, let's just attack this guy too. Get rid of the knight. Hey, look at that. Objective completed. So what unit do I have left? I, this guy is left. Okay, let's just attack the swordsman. When the enemy is coming behind me. Hate it when that happens, man. Turn six. Here comes the swordsman. Okay, Pikeman actually does seem a little weaker in World War II. All right. Oh, wow. Lithra, we cannot take much more of this. Madame Pistol will be here any minute. We just have to hold down a little bit longer. Oh, my goodness. Whew. So, if nothing has changed, there should be like a 5% luck modifier in Wargroove. Oh, you can't reinforce on the stronghold, really? Okay. Alright, full health, that's nice. Let's get some archers out. Oof. Yeah, that's terrifying. Only two more turns now. Am I invited? Yes, uh, Ponsegraf, you're invited. Here you go, Ponsegraf. You are a rat now. Ponsegraf. There you go. Let's see if Ponsegraf can kill someone. You can name units. So you can finally roleplay with your Wargroove units. You can you can name your hecking cute Doggerino. We did it, Reddit. We did it, Reddit. Squeak, squeak. Mm. Oh no, they're attacking my building. Mangs, it's not minus five plus five. It always has been plus ten. It's that Wargroove shows the average damage. Ah. Lithra, the floor and have entered the camp. Oh no, I failed the bonus objective. It's okay though. It's a stupid bonus objective anyway. Ugh. Pulsed rats, yeah. I will say though, I was kind of hoping. Like, did that guy just suicide? Oh my god, what an absolute moron! I will say one thing though, I would have preferred if they added like a unit level up system. Oh no! Oh no! Let's throw. What is uh... it? I hear even more of them there, and there, there too. Please. Oh boy! Please. Pistol, please hurry. Fasten the bolt here, and marvelous, you have truly outdone yourself this time, Pistol. How do you do it? Oh, I'm so quirky. Oh, wow, I sure love being a funny wine aunt. Oh. Alright, so I guess I'll... Um, we'll, we, we'll soften up this knight a little bit first. I'm really sure, but luck damage seems to be gone. I don't think I've seen any damage from one display. Okay, maybe they just... Maybe they removed it. Nothing. I'm gonna see if I can get the super group. So we are at 145% groove charge right now. I, I kind of like that all combat gives you groove now. It, it definitely focuses the battle more on just your commander. So that gave us like a little... You don't get much though. Not a lot of groove charge. I don't think there's any point in... It looks like... Yeah, we just have two more turns we gotta survive, so... This doesn't seem that bad. So it looks like we'll just have to defend from the top now. Bro, didn't you just make a unit stand still the previous turn? Did I? I don't remember. Probably not. So yeah, all kinds of combat gives group charge right now. Not a lot, but a little bit.
It just said you did 60% of a unit and it still lived. Maybe luck is still a thing. We'll see. Uh oh. Company! Company, oh. halt! We found them! Oh. Oh, they're my units. Awaiting your command, General. Waste no time. Route the enemy and secure the camp. You've heard them. Defeat all remaining enemies. What? Oh. So I guess it's not a defense mission after all? Oh, okay. Cool. Oh, this is, this is the mouse cavalry. Are they riding cats? Are they freaking riding cats? Oh my god, they're riding on cats. This, this game has such Reddit humor, oh my goodness. Oh, Hikarino, oh, cute! It's the mouse are riding the cats, get it? Oh. That's so heckin' cute, Arino! Oh wow, that's a buff mouse. Wow. Wow. Thanks, you're more cringe than the game. Hey man, I never said I wasn't. Oh, it's a big chungus rat, oh no. General, we have secured Excellent the area. Work. Excellent work, let us regroup. Alright, that was easy. <laughs> Alright, Florin, your time is hereby up. Hold still! Now hold still. This will only hurt until the electricity melts your brains. Oh. Wait, where is everyone? That was incredible. General, General Rhombus Madir. You may call me Rom. That was incredible, Rom. Incredible, it was merely my duty. All your praise belongs to my brave soldiers. Brave? You flatter us, General. <laughs> you all deserve praise as well. I must, apologize. I must apologize profusely for not arriving sooner. House pirates, those pirates gave us more trouble than we could have imagined. Wait, you fought the pirates? Mm -hmm. huh? Ah, oh. oh, hello, little soldier. Uh, I'm Lithra Falaki. Very nice to meet you. Your muscles are very large. Thank you. Thank you. Where is your commander? What is your commanding officer? <laughs> You're looking at her. <gasps> Madam Pistol, put me in charge. Pistol. Oh, lovely. The rest of the army survived. I suppose I should let you in on our plans. You missed that quite a lot. Madam Samtel Ross. You are contra contractor Pistol Sam... Al Ras, I presume. I would certainly appreciate a debriefing. But after that, you may return to your assigned duties. Maintaining your experimental crystal weapons for the Wait. army. Wait! Wait, pistol? Madam? I thought you were, you know, in charge. I... technically... Uh, perhaps not technically. But it was clear this mission needed my experience. <sighs> especially in your absence. I was fighting pirates alongside every other ship in our fleet. Where was your ship, madam? Madame said we received orders to retreat. Yes, the only sensible strategy available. No. Yet, I did not give that order. I understand you may not may have been frightened by combat. However, leaving was not your decision to make. Reckless behavior! Such reckless, co uncoordinated actions can get people killed. But thanks to me, everyone was just fine. Tell them, Lytra. Tell them, Lytra. Uh... Well, everyone was fine. Pistol. Madam, with all due respect, fabricating orders, desertion, promoting a recruit to commander... No. This is all out of line. I must ask you to never again. Oh. You're not listening. Uh, None of you are listening. I, 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 cannot, I wor cannot work like this. It's treason then. Okay, so Soldiers. she's so she's an overgrown man child, and here is General Giga Trat Rat just going like, "Hey, stop being a bitch." This location is compromised. We shall have to move camp. Yes, General, my dear. I have a feeling she's going to betray us, yeah. You heard the general. <laughs> Giga rats. I'm going after no. her. You will not. We must move camp before nightfall. What? But she... I will send a scout to keep an eye on Please. her. Please. Please, little soldier. We are here to do a job. No one should take a necessary risk for that. Very problematic of him to mansplain to her like that. I know, right? I know, right? It's terrible. Someone should teach this 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 rat a lesson. So I have a feeling she's gonna she's probably gonna betray us and we're gonna have to fight against her. 
All right. Congratulations. You unlocked Conquest Mode. I don't know what that is. The General. The Fari tracked down an ancient ruins in the forests. Oh, no. She's still not back. Madam Pastille will return, I'm sure. Why do we care about this woman? She's only rude to us. I hope... I hope I should have stuck up for her. I hope she's not mad at me. Friends are understanding. Friends are understanding, friend. If Madam Pastille is a friend, then she will understand her actions were dangerous and apologize. I guess you're right, but what about the General? I made them mad yesterday, too. But if she's not here... What if the general tells me they don't need me around? Who's gonna stick up for me? They already think I'm weird. I'm confident the general will think quite highly of you. If they do not, well, then we shall simply mutiny. Thanks, Tag. Wait, you do that? You do that? Little soldier. Ah, oh, little soldier. Um, I must apologize. I must apologize if I was brusque yesterday. Your scribe friend informed me of all that transpired, and I've in, I've in, in, interviewed many of your. Simpmates, your auditory skills are quite important to our mission, yes? As we search the forest today, I shall expect you close at hand. General Madir, we... Oh, is that coffee? Filtrum, finish your thought. Ahem, uh, Filtrum Eloth, re re reporting for the third re reconnaissance team. We encountered a site of interests, but there are Florin on patrol. Let us depart! Then let us make haste. We are unwelcome here, to say the least. This place, it is beautiful. Why must me... Little soldier. There you are. The Florin have not yet noticed us. Care to help me with our strategy? Me? Sure. There are two paths before us now. No. North. And east. What are your thoughts? Oh, oh shit. Route split. So north is clearly easier, but east is more fortified, but it's closer. Um, is this like a trick question? Does he does he like want to see how adept we are? Oh, I mean, part of me wants to go east because I like the challenge. Uh, but north might be the correct answer. But I ain't no little bitch, so I'm gonna go east. The path does have a barracks we could use. We could even send an archer to weaken the enemy before they can open the gate. Thank you. Thank you, little soldier. I shall factor your thoughts into my decision. Fall behind me, Lithra, but stay close. Okay. Oh my god, look at the size of this guy. General Ma Ma Is it Madir or Nadir? I, I find it difficult to differentiate the M's and the N's in this game. General Nadir, we were unable to decipher the instructions for Madame Samalarat's mech units. However, we did bring the wagon you requested. Oh, wagons! Yes! Wagons are the best unit in Wargru. Use wagons to transport units quickly across the battlefield. Wagons typically start empty, but this one contains an archer. Try unloading the archer somewhere that will help you reach your goal faster. Look at the moon! Did they nerf wagons? Oh, maybe maybe they didn't nerf them, but yeah, because they move really fast on roads. Alright everyone, onward to our objective. Well, I'm going to capture this property first. And then I'm going to use Nadir to capture here. Yeah, wagons are like APCs on crack. They're great. They're absolutely great. I like the, this guy's theme. It's cool. Mm -hmm. Check objectives. Yeah. Patrol is boring. Krem and I must focus. Patrol keeps the forest safe while Greenfinger away. When Greenfinger comes back, Gemini patrolling for days already. Greenfinger will return soon, and Gem and I must have faith. Grr, okay. Alright, let's check the uh, map objectives. Defeat the Florin Stronghold or defeat the Florin Commander. Bonus objective, use a third path. Win without attacking Bullrush. Bullrush? Who's Bullrush? Uh, huh? Oh, this guy? Yeah, Bullrush lands. Okay, so we can if we we get a if we can defeat the the fortress without attacking him, we get a bone. Use a third path. Okay, where's the third path though? I don't see a third path. Oh, let's check his groove. Yeah, let's check his groove. Uh, let's see. Uh, okay. 
Crystal Heart. Plus two movement, plus two attack range. Rom can attack air units? Whoa, so he like transforms into a super rat. That's cool. Can you walk on the river? Yeah, maybe. That's really cool. So he's like, uh, he like buffs himself. I wonder how long it lasts. If it's just for a single turn. He also gets extra defense. Oh wow, so yeah, he gets plus one. He gets extra defense and extra movement. That's really cool. Center is the third. Yeah, like over here, you mean. I guess so. Oh, cool. So you can actually, you can... What? Intruders? Someone open the gate. I like how you can load commanders into wagons. I always thought that was cool. Uh, maybe we should get a uh, another archer. Maybe this guy will attack us. Intruders. The air attack is only on his big charge. Oh, they're actually attacking us from the north now. Little soldier. Little soldier. About this mission's objective. Perhaps we should attack the stronghold instead of the foreign huh? commander. Huh? Can't we do either? Yes, however, I would prefer not uh, to harm. Yes. You are correct, little soldier. Either goal will do. Is that a quiz? Did of I pass? Course. Of course. Excellent work. Excellent work. Hmm. So we got two pikemen coming in here. I guess we'll send our first our commander first. You can activate the groove and then move. Okay. That's kind of cool. I like that. Anyway, that guy is coming awfully close to me, so I think I will place my archer like this, and then we'll get some pikemen out to deal with that charging guy. And I really don't want to move my knight forward, because there's two pikemen there. And that seems kind of scary, so I don't want to do that. Alright, they're attacking Giga Rat. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, the AI seems to always target buildings whenever it can. Man, it's just got here. Got some tasty gyros. What are your thoughts on this game compared to the first? Well, so far it's the exactly the same. It seems more like an expansion pack, really. Which is fine, but it's... Again, it, it seems like an expansion pack. Alright, let's just prepare our defenses right here. We can use a critical hit on the archer doing this. Is online play better? I mean, I did a single quick match before the stream. It seems to be exactly the same, which is a little upsetting. Alright, so here we do 95% damage. Let's see if there's luck. So far, I don't know. You should run. I never got War Guru. Is it worth yeah. buying this one instead? Considering this seems more like an expansion pack, I would definitely say so. Amazing, how do you do soldier. that? Training any little other. soldier, same as anyone. I don't know, this guy doesn't seem natty to me. Why do these guys have so much defense? Plus three defense? What? Oh, you get three defense in forest? Is that new? Didn't forest used to give two? Tree defense for a forests? That's actually pretty crazy. Huh. Oh no, they're attacking my fortress. Ow! That was a crit, I think. Yeah, that was a crit. Alright, well, I say we deal with this, um, with this barracks. I don't know if they actually build anything out of it, but we'll see. You get tree defense in the tree. Yeah, I know, right? Don't make fun of my accent, guys. Oh, alright. I fear no creature. Yeah. So we have our groove available now. 
How much groove charge do we have? Oh, actually, no, we don't. I thought we did. So I think I will actually bring another soldier into the wagon. So I'll do this. Because we have pikemen right here that we can use to crits. So I'm gonna... I'm a bit surprised by how much damage they did to my fortress, though. It seems fortresses might have less health in Wargrove 2. Alright, let's get a Chevalier. Woods gave three defense in Wargrove 1, too. Okay. Alright, soldiers, show these intruders a good hunt. Okay, so they always had three defense. Got it. Yeah, it was a cab crit, which explains why it did so much damage. Alright, let's see if we can kill this barrack now. 58% damage should be doable. Minibosses are a cool new mechanic. I agree. I do actually agree. I think it's really cool. Alright, cool. Commander Bullrush, intruders at the south barrack. Hunt them. Show no fear. So we gotta be careful about that pikeman, but we have a uh, we have a river in between us and them. And I'm pretty sure he can't reach. Yeah, no, he cannot. Oh, we can get, can we get a night crit? No. Actually, we might be able to get a night crit. See, so yeah, Pikeman still seems really busted. Look at the damage they deal with critical hits, and it's so easy to get them, too. But yeah, we can get a critical hit here. 142% damage. That's incredible. Did they buff knights? It almost seems like they buffed knights. Alright, Wagon Sean, come over here. Rom can only activate his groove if you feed him a Pepsi Max. Based. Favorite commander. Oh shit, they can attack me. Oh no. Oh no. Oopsie doopsie. Alright, they're sending more knights down to us now. This is actually a little bit scary. Oh, I love wagons. They're the best. Maybe they buffed crits in general? I, the damage numbers definitely seem a little different than what I'm used to, but it's difficult to say for sure. That mini commander just danced? Really? Rom, you're glowing. Do you have a groove yes. too? Yes, little soldier. But it is a power I use only for emergencies. If we are in danger, then I shall handle whatever stands in our way. Really? Um... Where- Oh! He has the Encourage ability, yeah! He can indeed dance, ladies and gentlemen. That's cool. I like that a lot. Alright, I say we, uh, we take this back. So that lance literally lets you dance for people. Okay, I have an idea. Let's uh, soften this guy up a little bit with the archer first, and then we can take it down. Problem is, knights can't take buildings, sadly. Grr, tricky little prey. Bullrush must keep Green Greenfinger Forest safe. So he can literally... It seems like he can dance for one unit. Oh, that's nearly a kill. And that is a kill. Oh, he's moving now. Oh, shit. Um, so how am I supposed to do the bonus objective if he charges at me? Okay, I kind of want to check out this group. Strength from beyond. <sighs> okay, so he becomes Giga Chad for a turn. In their crystal form. Why, why did they say there? They. There? They? What? What? Are they pronouning? In their crystal form, Rom moves further and deals more damage. Oh no. Oh damn, that's cool. Oh no. They put pronouns in my war groove. Damn them liberals!
So I don't know how long this this like mode lasts if it has like a if it's only a single turn. I don't know how if he like charge at me or whatnot. I guess we'll find out. Oh yeah, so you can take a third path, path over the river. I don't know how you unlock that. Okay, now what does he do? No, he's coming even closer. Maybe he's like a rat king. Okay, it's only for one turn. So it's a it's a good power. He gets extra defense too, so he's harder to kill. Okay, that's not quite enough. I think I'm just gonna land a killing blow. You should run. Yeah. Ah, so that's why he could uh, lecture the lady. He, because of his pronouns. It all makes sense now. There we go. Don't think I'll be needing all these units. I think I failed both of the objectives already, so... Yeah, knights versus spearmen, not... not something you want. I'm gonna try walking over the river just to see if it unlocks a hidden objective. I don't think it does, though. Wait, what unit haven't I moved? Oh, this guy. Uh, I'll just move like this. My pronouns is supreme being in Earth compared to other species, and now you have to give this pronoun to me or I report you. <coughs> Alright. Let's attack. Oh, wait, no. We've killed all units already. So, I guess we've already engaged him in combat, which means that there's no point in not attacking him. I fear no creature! Do, 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 do. Let's move the wagon up. Oh, we have a unit to drop off. That's fine. Alright, you can load into a wagon as long as you move adjacent to it. That's cool. Alright, can I get bonus objective now? I'm moving on the river. <sighs> I don't like pikemen. They're annoying. I guess I can get another Chevalier. I have to base skip, guys. I'm so sorry. Your leader even said that he didn't want to fight the opponent, and that was a hint. Yeah, but he moves around, so what am I supposed to do? <laughs> Yo, just tuned in. Why are you playing Ratatouille Advanced Wars? That would be a cool concept. Sorry for base skipping, guys. I don't mean to. You should run. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. All right. He should probably die next turn, I imagine. Let's capture this property. I kind of like that capture animations are off by default now. It's not that I didn't like them, but they 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 were pretty slow. Alright, can I get the bonus objective now? I guess not. So we- Oh, that guy is tough. My goodness. Seems like that artifact gives him quite a lot of power. Let's put the wagon in front of our units. To shield them. And I don't really think these units are gonna reach in time, so I'm just gonna end. I'm so excited to see what will happen this Sunday CMU. You'll see. You'll see. I picked a lot of units already. If you can probably get the bonus objective if you move a unit onto the forest and the lake. You might be right about that, but I think I'm killing the commander next turn, so... Unless we just go for the fortress? Let's see. Can I crit the fortress? I might just be able to kill the fortress. There you go. And then we use uh, Giga Rat. 
It seems to me like it's- What? Are you serious? Come on. It seems to me like it's easier to kill fortresses now. There you go. Grr, retreat. We must tell Nero. Excellent, Excellent work. Didn't get in a single bonus objective. Feels bad, man. This way, secure the ruins. One moment. One moment, little soldier. Psst, Lithra. Is that rock talking to me? Oh, I wish my rock baby experiments worked, but alas. No, dear, it's me. It's me! me. I hate this character. I'm conducting my own investigation. <laughs> you know. Oh no, is this like I turn myself into a rock, Morty? Is this is this, is that is that the joke they're gonna make here? You know, since I was so rudely ousted oh. yesterday. Oh, I'm about that. I only stopped by to let you know you're wasting your time here. I've already taken copious notes on the ruins ahead. I doubt Chancellor Rumboid, whatever, would be able to decipher them anyway. So whenever you feel like making real progress, you know where to find me. Yeah, she turned herself into a stone. Little soldier, come quick. Wasn't there a rock here before? Wah wah. Look. Look, Lilum Candidium, the flower from before. Ahem, and also these ruins. But we can't read it. Maybe if we got Pistol. Pistol is not here. We shall have to make no, do. Now let us think. think. A lone structure in the middle of the woods? What does that say to you? Uh, Maybe it's lost? Perhaps. perhaps. Or perhaps it is here to help others who are lost. Wait, there was something like this back on that island. You were right. <laughs> Maybe so, but you did the work. You're only as good as the sum of us. I hope Madame Sant Alras understands that someday. Meanwhile... Muru, camp was attacked, intruders. Many furry-faced intruders with sparkly weapons. What? What? I fought bigger. I'll handle it. Muru, maybe we wait for Greenfinger? Furry invaders, very strong. Maybe Greenfinger. Oh no. Ah. <laughs> They're gonna come and have Dashcon. No, what was it? Uh, yeah, Dashcon. Wasn't that the one? No. What was the rainforest? Rainforest. That's the one I was thinking about. Dashcon was the Tumblr convention. They're gonna. They're gonna hold. They're gonna hold. They're gonna hold Rainforest Convention, we gotta stop them. I'll handle it, just point the way. Alright. Act 1, Mission 3, A Door in the Forests. Romb and Lithra find an ancient settlement deep in the gloom woods. Wow. An abandoned settlement. We never would have found this place without your sound device, little soldier. General Madir, we found something. Hmm. Look, little soldier. The seal on this door does not match the rest of the structure. It is still ancient looking. Ugh. Yet, it must have been placed after the kingdom fell. To keep us out? To keep something in? Can you open it, little soldier? I'm no amateur. Leave it to me. Oh yeah, they nerfed Nuru. Oh, is it Nuru? They they nerfed Nuru so hard in World War One. She was busted. Sorry. Uh, sorry, everyone. There's no trouble. Not to worry. Try once more. There is no. Hold it. <laughs> You're the ones who have been wreaking havoc on the forest, huh? Last chance to leave peacefully. General Madir, is it Nadir or Madir? I think it's Nadir. Our orders. Our allies were quite clear. The tree folk are not to are not to deter <sighs> us. Florin! Florin, if you intend to fight, you'll find us more than capable foes. It's Nadir, okay. Fine, don't say I didn't warn you. Oh no, she's using her <sighs> ability. That that's such a broken ability. Trebuchets, swordsman, fall back down. Oh no, cutscenes. Yeah, she could do that. She could summon trebuchets, and they could attack in the same turn. It's a busted ability. <laughs> Plenty more where that came from. 
You have no idea who you're messing with. Lytra! Lytra, if we can defend this position if you concentrate on opening the gate. Uh... I think so. Yes, I can do it. Do not worry, little soldier. I shall protect me, I know. Thank you, Rom. I won't let you down. Alright, so, hmm, for an opening strategy, how about a squadron of spearmen? Or perhaps cavalry would be the wiser option. Oh, can I choose? Deploy sp Oh, okay, here we go. Four spares or two cavalry? Uh, four spares seems much better for a defense mission. I like cavalry, though. I like the option, but spearmen is just seems way better here. Yeah, good choice. Fari, remember, we are stronger Toward together. It. Now to arms. That's really cool. I like that you get little choices like that. Alright, so we have a... Uh, let's take a look at the map. We have a barrack here that we gotta get to. Any other? We got a bunch of buildings. I wanna check out Nura's groove. Have they changed her at all? Alright, so she has... Uh, teleport beam. Uh, beam's a friendly unit down that can act immediately. Charge one, very slow. Pray normal price for the unit. Charge two, very slow. Pay no cost for the unit. Pay no cost for the unit? What? 25% discount at recruit? Okay. So they reverted her charge, but they probably made it slower. Huh. Mirror's teleportation beam allows an extra unit to be quickly called up. This is such a broken power. Yeah, they, they, it seems like they've turned... Because what they did in Wargroove 1, they, they made her units like 50% more expensive. So you wouldn't want to summon them in unless you got a tactical advantage for it. But, um, yeah. Okay, let's just charge ahead. Get, get as many properties as we can. Literal Merchant Union on steroids. Well, I wouldn't say that. I mean, Merchant Union allows you to buy units in all your properties. Which is way more busted. But, you know, it's still pretty good. Both charges are very slow. Yes, it's gonna take you forever to get there. What the heck? I've never seen this part of the forest before. Alright, yeah. The Spearmen were definitely the right choice here. There's no question about that. Just put them next to each other like this. Uh, but the, probably the best thing that we can do here... Just to put Rom right here. Get this barrack. Get this one as well. Honestly, probably don't want to send my spearmen to capture. It's probably better to use swordsmen for that. So I'll just continue spamming spearmen, honestly. Seems like the best choice. They must be looking for more cacophony junk. I thought Requiem was the last of it. She has a 25% discount now. Yeah, with her super groove, but... The super groove takes forever to charge, though. Clan Tachi? Yeah, I guess so. Okay, the trebuchets are coming up. We gotta be careful about that. I think I got the gate open, everyone. So it's a 12 turn defense mission now. Oh, shoot, there's more. Never mind. Still, though, doesn't seem that hard. We'll just make a wall of pikes. That should be it. You should run. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I just got here. Is Mang's a rat? I am now, apparently. Oh, I forgot to check the range of the trebuchets. Oops! Looks like I messed up, guys. I placed one of my guys in range of a trebuchet. You know what? Screw it. I'm gonna get a shovel here. Oh shit, did I use up all my money? Oh no, I base skipped. I'm so sorry. Oh no, I base skipped. I'm a terrible player. That's fine. The Chevalier is worth it. Nah, I'm not gonna turn wheel. I only get one of them. Yeah, so the, crit the trebuchet's crit at max range. So that's a one shot. Oops. And now they're gonna focus my hero, as they do. Comes the knights. I don't think this is a crit. Never mind. It was. Wow, I got my ass handed to me this turn. 
I do know what you guys are, but you need to get the heck out of this forest. <laughs> Simply leave us to our business and we shall leave in short order. Well, that, what kind of answer is that? You're in our home! However, I will get to set up a crit here. More trebuchets are dealing serious damage. What should we do? Yeah, I know. Soldiers. Trebuchets cannot attack units within two spaces. They also cannot move and attack on the same turn. We can exploit that weakness by staying far out of range or moving close in to strike. It's not that hard. Do, do, do. But we did just get a crit with our spearmen, so that's nice. There we go. And looks like they didn't co properly co cover their trebuchet, so we can run like this. And then we can simply do this. Unleash the plague? I wish they were more like the Skavens of Warhammer. That would be kick-ass. I would love that. So I'm actually going to move like that to charge this guy next turn. It looks like I have most of the properties at this point, so that's good. If I set up this pikeman here, I can recruit another pikeman right into crit range. We have 400. Uh, we could get a... Oh, it looks like we don't have access to dogs yet. So I guess we'll just keep building uh, pikemen. Ooh, I hope I won't die. Wish the factions would be a bit more as asymmetrical. What is that supposed to mean? Okay, that's fine. Is Nura going to attack me though? Oh shit, did I just get crit by another trebuchet? Ooh. Rats don't have dogs. No, I know they do. Because I, uh... But they have boars or whatever. I've seen them. Oh, you... Oh, you guys wanted each faction to have different units. Ah! Eh, I can kind of see that, but that would have been hell to balance. Another one. I think I'm getting somewhere. That certainly would have given them more flavor. I absolutely agree. But it would have been absolute hell to balance. Could Romb beat Quick Head Taker? What? What are you talking about? Alright, let's set up a wall of pikes, guys. Okay, so we got 6 HP left on our champion right now. We gotta be a little careful. We can set up a crit, but only with a 6 HP spearman. So I don't think that's necessarily worth it. But I feel like if I leave Romb out here for too long... Uh, he might die, so I think I'm gonna pull him back. Um, I can crit like this. It's 46% damage, which is pretty good. There we go. And I think I'm just gonna keep this, uh, this rat right here. Four damage? Did he deal six damage to me? Really? Wow. Let's reinforce and get another crit. Never seen Wargor before? Is this the Rat Kingdom trying to find the mythical cheese relics? I guess so. How much gold do we- Oh, it actually Oh, nice! It says available gold in the top here. That is actually incredibly nice. I appreciate that. That definitely makes things easier for me. I think that might be a new thing. I don't like- I think it worked like that before. So yeah, as long as they don't get back up, I can just keep capturing the property on the left. And he'll just damage himself trying to kill it. Of course, actually, no, he won't, because he kills it in one shot, so... It literally is just like a tug-of-war. Will Mang try the roguelike survival mode? I hear there's a new mode called Conquest, but I don't know what it does. Okay, kind of getting my ass handed to me right here. Oh shit, Nuro has entered the fight. I wonder if you get a unique ending if you defeat Nuro. Okay, we probably want to retreat, guys. We're getting beat up pretty badly here. Yeah, we probably want to back up, I think. Let's heal up our commander, let's heal up our knights. And let's back up. We have two, only 200 gold available because we reinforced this turn, but that's okay. 
we can start taking these villagers now to reduce their income, which is really nice. And we have an additional barracks on this side. Honestly, if I stick around here, I will just lose, so I think maybe it's better to pull back with this unit. And then we have this pikeman right here, which I'm also going to back up a little bit. Because this is a defense mission, we got to remember that. If we stay in the center, we're probably going to lose. Check the bonus objective? Uh, oh, I didn't do that yet, did I? I, get, I bet the bonus objective is to defeat Nuru. To end the map. Little soldier. How goes it? Uh, just a bit more. I'm not useless anymore. I'm not useless. I'm not. Litra, I shall leave you to it. Uh, let's see. Map objectives. Protect Litra and survive for 12 turns or defeat Nuru. Yeah, defeat Nuru within 11 turns. And the other one is win without using cavalry units. Well, I've already failed that one. So... Alright, so yeah, the, the the enemy commander always plays very defensively. Wait, I can set up a crit now, can't I? Yes, I can. Look at that. Yeah, so I'm afraid to say it looks like Wargroove is going to turn into another... It seems to me like Wargroove 2 might turn into another Pikeman spam fests, unless it works differently. So I have my power now. I kind of want to charge my super groove, though, just to see what it's like. Um, mm, 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 mm. So we have a bunch of guys that we can kill very easily here. I'm going to leave my... I'm going to do it with my... Com so there's one thing I want to test, actually. 106 charge. Let's see, how much do I get... How much do I get for killing a unit? 126. So, this guy gets 20 charge every time he lands a killing blow. I'm guessing killing stuff with your commander is still optimal. It seems that way to me, at least. Wait, who haven't I moved? Oh, this guy. The charge numbers are in the codex. Okay, good to know. I also like how you can quickly skip animations with a left click. Or, sorry, a right click. It's nice. Speeds things up. You know you're gonna die anyway. Yes, they're, they're advancing pretty hard over on my uh, left flank here. If I'm not careful, I'm gonna lose some units. So probably a good idea to set up some defensive units here. Some pikemans. They can take my left buildings. I don't really care about them. Can I set up another crit? No, pikemen are slow. So, uh, we could go over here and kill this guy. Blast the boss. The boss is still too far away. Oh, can we set up another crit? I think we can. Yes, let's go! Setting up crits is by far the most satisfying thing about playing Warcraft. I love this mechanic so much. It is by far the best mechanic in the game. It's amazing. <laughs> Nuru, the trebuchets. We are formidable opponents. Stand down while you have the chance. Don't think I want to attack these buildings just yet. But we can start softening up these guys. And then we can bring our pikemen down here. And have we moved? Is there any way to check what units you haven't moved yet? Setting up crits feels so good. It really does. Bank on a crit. I wish they were RNG. Space bar? Is that how you do it? So that's definitely something I'm missing. Uh, oh, yeah! Look at that! Oh, that's amazing! Thank you so much! Oh, perfect! Oh, that's lovely. Oh, I love it. I was missing this one. I was really missing this one. That is so good. Thank you. Thank you, chat. I appreciate it. 
There's a button to select. Yeah, it's amazing. All right, you can see the, the enemy commander plays super defensively. It's actually a little bit overkill. Okay, how much charge do we have now? We have 187%, so this is pretty good already. And hell, why don't we just want... Wow, we're actually driving her back. Maybe we can try and kill her. You didn't bring an archer to support your unit wall? No. Okay, I think it's time we, we take this uh, we take this property right now. Let's kill it. And we could score a critical hit on the knight, but it's still not that good. I think I'd rather take this. But we can score a critical hit right here, and then take out the village. I like how you kind of push on the right side, and then you get pushed on the left side. Kind of reminds me of like a strong side, weak side dynamic, which is really cool. Uh oh, here comes the knights. Oof. Okay, so I might get my superpower next turn. Depending on how much charge I gain from that. They almost killed my village. Oh, there we go. The village is dead. Oh, Nuru has her power now. I gotta be very careful. I gotta be very careful. Almost there. Oh, I think I have it. I do have it, but I wanted to heal up first. I wanted to heal up first. Hmm. Sadly, cannot get a crit on this knight, but I can kill it. And then we can reinforce these pikemen. I wonder what kind of unit Nura is going to summon. Game looking good. I mean, it's Wargroove. <laughs> it's Wargroove. I mean, it's fun to play. Wargroove 1 was fun, too. So far, it's the exact same game, though, with new commanders. But again, Advanced Wars 2 was just Advanced Wars with new commanders, too, so... It, it feels very similar to Advanced Wars. Oh, here we go. Teleport Beam. What's she gonna summon? A dog? Really? You summoned a dog with your superpower. Wow, AI fucking sucks. Alright, let's use superpower. Oh, you can't decide to use normal? Really? You can't decide to use your normal groove? That's terrible. I should have the option to use my normal groove if I don't want to use super groove. That's terrible. What if I want to use my normal groove twice? I should be allowed to do that. I don't like this. Maybe it doesn't want you to do that. You leave me no choice! I mean, he's... Wow, he's pretty damn strong. My goodness. So I can go like this. 50 damage. Can I crit her? Oh, I'm... If I had moved my knight a little differently, I could have probably crit her this time. Oh, if I moved her here, I could have gotten a crit. Oh, well. I almost killed her. I could have... I think I could have killed her if I had set up just a little bit differently. I could have done it. Actually, do I have a... I almost have a crit here. I might still be able to kill her, maybe. But the bonus objective is to kill her before turn 11, so... Oh well. So you can do this to cycle through units. Amazing. It's a cool superpower, I like it. It seems very strong. So it seems like every groove is either one or two. There's no different groove. You don't have a... It's not like Advanced Wars 2, where 
you have different kinds of powers that do different things. Which I think is a bit of a shame, if I'm gonna be completely honest. I think I it, they're just basically powered up normal grooves. Which, don't get me wrong, it's cool, but I, 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 I kinda miss the flexibility of it, that's all. Yeah, it would be too good to use normal groves twice. Yeah, like Caesar, I agree. Their commander is near. Now! Holy! Now we strike. Well, I can easily kill her now. Oh! Oh, I think I did it for real this time. Oh, there we go. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> I got it open. Oh, so you don't need to actually play turn 12. Got it. Excellent. Wonderful, let us descend. Oh, they just teleported away. Okay, got it. Several days earlier. Wow, I've never seen this place before. <laughs> You've been holding out on me. Mm -hmm. These are the hallowed hunting grounds. Dangerous, beautiful beasts live here. Beasts fit to train the best of hunters. Grounds meant for one green finger to train another. Surprise! I see what you're trying to pull. I already told you, Sasa, I can't stay here. I can't stay anywhere for long. Why do you think I came here in the first place? No. I do not wish to pers persuade you against your own nature. Consider this a parting gift for all you've done for the tribes. Greenfinger. It is no good for Florin to hunt on our own, Nuru. Whenever your travels next take you, remember this, please. <laughs> Anyhow, shall we? Saza? Is that her real name? Nuru, what is everyone waiting for? After them! Zero stars gained. Okay, alright. Let's check out Act 1, Mission 4. What is this place? Careful, watch your step. Oh, we're gonna have a dungeon map now? Wow. Wow, this looks like exactly what we've been looking for. We should scour this place, take as many notes as we can. And then leave this forest as soon as possible. Rom, Rom I hear something behind us. Didn't anyone ever tell you how rude it is to waltz into places uninvited? Oh. How good of you to join us. I was beginning to worry. You guys are really trying to set me off, huh? Oh boy. You are so dead. Oh boy. Soldiers. Everyone listen. Let us make our way to the chamber at the end of the hall. If we hurry, we can take whatever there and leave. Okay. General Nadir, the gates Move. block our path. Rake your way through if need be. We must be swift. Do not waste time engaging the enemy or until we are close to the final gate. Okay. So what's this, an artifact? Items bestow no non-commander units with powerful abilities. Ah, okay. So this is Hero Sword. Unit deals three times damage, but receives 1.25 damage from incoming attacks. Oh, wow. That's busted as hell. Let's give that to an archer. All right. Once a unit, once a unit picks up an item, I'm gonna name it after chat. Three times the damage. That seems like an archer kind of thing. I don't know about you guys. All right. So run from the enemy. Got it. I can do that. Grim, just name it Grim. Has this place been here the whole time? Carly Conan donated two bucks to Super Shot. How are you feeling? Feeling better? Welcome back. I'm still a little sick, but I am getting better. I am much better now than I used to be. Um, there aren't so many of them. When we can yet claim victory. Never mind. <laughs> Thanks for the advice, bud. The enemy draws near. Hurry through the gates. All right. Uh, where's the uh, this guy? We're gonna name him Grim. He is now the Grim Archer. Look at the damage this guy. Fifty-four damage. Wow. Okay. Good. We've broken through the uh, hall. There's more items down there. Move. 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 So what's this? Life Song Essence. 
Replenishes 20 health to your entire army. What? Just when you pick it up? So it's like a it's like a big heal for your entire army. Seems strong. Damn. Not so fast. Hey, stop cheating! You when did, since when could Nuru teleport? I hate campaign abilities. No, do not break the second door. Why not? Teleports in front of you, yeah. Reverse Edgelord, let's go. Oh, damn! Huh? Muru? Where are we? No time for chit-chat. Get these little gremlins already. Oh, it could have delayed the enemy movement. Oh, you're right. Rom, there's so many. Worry not, little soldier. As long as we keep our wits about you, uh, about us, we can overcome. Oh, we have two commander units, which is pretty damn strong, so we should be fine here, I think. Let's just make sure we utilize terrain correctly. Can you check global range? Oh, I should also check bonus objectives, shouldn't I? Reach the objective in seven or few turns. Lose no more than four units. Okay. Interesting side objectives. We might be able to do that. Is there any way to check global ranges? Because that would be really cool right about now. Also, where's Grim? Is that... Okay, there's, there's Grim. Uh, I hope Grim is going to be okay. This is... This is Cacophony Junko, right? If there's anything like Requiem down here, I gotta stop him. Check options for hotkeys. We will see. Maybe you can find it in settings. That would be nice. I love how people made such a... Uh, they made such a big deal out of killing dogs that they changed it so that the dogs just run away. Like, oh no, you can't kill the heckin' doggerinos in my Reddit game. Please, please, Chucklefish, fix. And they, like, hotfixed it. Okay, so we took some damage. Um, we gotta, we gotta try and get Grim out of there. All right, so we can get a almost a crit. Actually, we can kill this guy with our commander. Yeah. We got an archer right here. Um, we can set up a crit against this cavalier by doing this. Killing mounts is all right. Double standards. Yup. Meow. So far, I haven't seen luck damage actually happening. That doesn't mean it's not here. But I haven't seen it happening. Ah, shit. We gotta protect Grim. 184% damage. Dave. This artifact is crazy. Oh, okay, we have our power already, dang. Uh, we have to back up a little bit, though. And that's without a critical hit, mind you. That is without a critical hit. They're still trying to focus my commander down, which is fine. I do have to heal her, though. Luck damage is in the game, Mang, so you can go into settings and turn on luck damage chart. Can I? Let's try. It's okay. I can keep going. Wow. Dog seems to have gotten the damage boosts. No, Grim! No, Grim! Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo! down and out now 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 So if I go on the potion, I'll heal my entire army, correct? That could be smart. Maybe I'll leave Commander Guy behind. I kind of want to kill this archer, not gonna lie. Hmm. 
I think we should go and activate the Andy Potion, yeah. Does it take an entire turn to consume it? But yeah, if we go to uh, if we go to over if we go to mission and settings, apparently we can turn on luck charge. Um, show absolute crew value sounds like a good idea. Health display, number badges for sure. Accessibilities, colorblind mode. Really? Oh! Oh! Oh, that's so good! Oh, that's so good! Oh, thank you, game. That's amazing. I like the music. Let's turn it up a little bit. That's amazing. Uh, resolution, full screen, general. I don't see the luck chart here. Maybe it'll show up later. Oh, that's so much better. Oh, thank you, game. I kind of want to click on the potion, so I think I'm going to do that. But I don't know if it takes my entire turn to do that. So maybe I should wait. Do your worst! I get excited about colorblind mode. I do. So if I heal for five, I'll just put the spare in here. I feel like I should choke point them. So I'll do this. And then I can put the, uh, let's see. We need to kill this guy first. Yeah, I feel like I should use the potion already. I just don't know who I'm gonna do it with. Okay, so that does take a turn. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, 20 health. That's just two. I don't know why I thought it was... I thought it was like a 5 HP potion. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. I'm so stupid. I thought it healed for more. Ooh, let's go. I thought it was much more than that. I don't know if it's safe to, to put my hero here. I really don't want to lose Legrim. I'm sure it'll be okay. He's not gonna die. We'll be fine. Concrete, sadly, uh, but we can go here. I'm doing God's work. Yeah, I really didn't want him to die. Okay, so the potion was just 2 HP. I, I thought it was 5 HP because I thought I'm the hyper repair. Oh, Neuro's attacking my commander. Let's go. I might just be able to kill her. Ah, a scratch. Keep talking, Furball. Next one's going right through the armor. I hope I'll be okay. As long as they don't attack Grim. That's the only thing that matters. Ooh, that's gonna be a crit, isn't it? Ah! No! Not Grim! No! Grim! Oh, shit. Oh, they killed Grim. They killed Light. Okay, what happens to items once a unit dies? Do they drop? No, they just vanish. Okay. Mm. It's Jover, guys. It's Jover. I wonder if you have two commanders on the field. Do Groove Charge split between those two commanders? I'm actually not sure. Anyway, do I have my... I, I do have my Groove now. So, if I use Crystal Heart... You leave me no choice! Then I can go back... Wait, what? Don't I get ranged attacks? I don't get ranged attack. Really? That's only my superpower. 
Oh, okay. 20 damage, 30 damage, 30... Da yeah, that should be a kill. I know it's a normal power. I just thought the normal power gave me one range, but I guess not. Well, you learn... I can kill Nura, though, so she's dead now. And then the knights finish the job. 29 damage. There we go. You got Is that just a win? Did I just win now? Hey. Nah, not like this. What? Are you serious? That's bullshit. You can't just change the rules. No! You can't just change the rules! Excuse me? Where was the indication? That's bullshit. I don't like it when games do that. Stay faithful to the rules you create. You can't just change the rules! That's not fair! I can't fall here, I must make my retreat. Wasting Grim on a 2 HP. Well, I thought, I thought I would win. Oh, we gotta get out of here. Apparently. Not now, not while we are so close. Damn, I've been, I must be defeated, but I can't die here. I must change the rules. Ugh, okay, we gotta get out of here. Our units are very low on health. They never said you would win from yeah. killing her. No, yeah. but I didn't expect her to just teleport like that. It feels a little cheap is all. Alright, well, we gotta run. Let's see. 36 damage on the gate. That's not great. Well, um, Grim, you're gonna have to die like a hero, man. 13%, 36%, my goodness. Um, General, the gate, it won't budge. No, it won't. Maybe a reset? I don't know. I can try and destroy... Maybe killing the second door was uh, not super smart. Oh my god, look at the damage this guy is doing. My goodness. 70% damage. The Grim is incredible. Ooh, that's a crit. Ugh. Well, I might have my Super Cyclone charge ready soon. So that could help, maybe. We are sustaining heavy losses. Keep moving, do not stop. Okay, this mission is kind of brutal. Not gonna lie. Let's see if we can get the gate open in time. The odds are dire, but we must not lose heart. Hmm. Well, we'll kill the gate in one more attack. If we just move, so we should be fine here. If we move one space up, we'll get a crit, but, but we'll also be closer to the enemies, which is not great. You're clearly dead now. No, I think I'll be fine. I'll break the gate down next turn. Rip Grim, you did great. You did get great, buddy. I think I can still beat this. I still think I can beat this, because I'll be able to break open the gate this turn. Alright, looks like I'm just gonna make it. General Commander, this way. Oh boy. Nuru, don't you fucking start teleporting around on me now! now. Everyone inside, now! 
Did I do it? Did I win the map? Nowhere left to run. One could say the same for you, my dear. Oh, it's... 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 It's Pistine! Madame! I'll fight you too. I don't care how many of you there are. <laughs> Combat? Oh dear. Well, that sounds fun. Don't you have a forest fire to attack? Oh, no. did we just fucking ignite their forests? We are the bad guys. What? Oh yes, on my way here, I could have sworn part of the forest was set ablaze. We are the bad guys. Mur, smoke, smoke coming from the great tree. <sighs> well, I'll be. I'd hurry if I were you. Fire must be a dreadful thing for a creature made of leaves. <sighs> War crimes, let's go. Madam Contractor, where have you been? What have you done? I caused the distraction. You're welcome. You're welcome. Pistil, you came back. Of course, there. If someone had defended me earlier, I might have left in the first place. But that's neither here nor there. Now, shall we finally do what we came here for? Wow, that's kind of dark. We just set their forest ablaze. New objective, investigate the ruins. Uh, what? Oh, is this like a exploration guide? Wow, imagine borrowing ideas from Andron Saga like that. Oh my god, it's literally a Gaiden chapter where you go around talk. They're copying Andron Saga, guys. Hey, okay, madam. About the other day. I'm Bissilitra. Oh, okay. Um... Wow, literally green unit guide mission. I wonder, what was the purpose of this chamber? Such a grand entrance only to listen to this. Any thoughts? Back in the hall, everything was so echoey. But everyone's voices sound so much nicer in this room. Maybe maybe people came here to talk or play music. Music? Hmm. Why build a, such a place for that? These flags, the purple ones are cacophony. The others likely... Selmore. Perhaps this was a meeting place between the oh. two kingdoms. Meeting to end the war, maybe? Look, hmm, look carefully, little soldier. Not a scrap of jewelry or any of, on any of the deceased. Not even a hint of weaponry. These people were commoners. This must have been well before the war. Were Cacophony and Selmore friends back then? Interesting. It is literally an Andron Saga-style guiding chapter. Literally. Down to the very letter. Look, people. Or at least they used to be. I wonder what happened. No signs of a fight took place, and I can't imagine they stayed here on purpose. We have a word for that back home, friend. An accident. Oh, right. But what kind of accident would happen down here? I believe we're all ignoring the owl in the room. <sighs> Incredible! A crystal. It's beautiful. Wow. I hear Can something. anyone else hear that? Something in the crystal. It's singing. Lytra! No. Leave her be. It's clearly working. Oh no. Is everyone unarmed? Let us exit the chamber. We have seen enough. Now, let us think. What have we learned here? This place dates back to before the war. To a time where Cacophony and Silmore may have been friendly. But something happened to sour their relationship. It may have happened in this very room. The discovery of a special type of crystal. A power that resonates with music. Perhaps, Perhaps this power caused an irreparable rift between Cacophony and Silmore. Perhaps. A possible story. <sighs> But we've yet to find what our allies seek. The secret to harnessing Cacophony's power. Wait! Wait, don't you study crystals, madame? Can't you figure out how these ones work? Oh, I'll be taking a very look close look at what we found. But I'll be Cacophony's but I'll bet Cacophony's crystals are made of tougher stuff than ours. If we could find Cacophony's royal palace, I'm certain we'd find everyone our allies needs, and then some. <sighs> madame Sa Samt Al Ras is correct. We have learned much, but not enough for our allies. We mustn't provoke the ire of a nation so powerful. Not when the Republic needs their protection the Dismissed. most. Our mission continues. Hmm. Kefna the Useless says, Hey Manx, how's it going? How's Warcraft 2 so far? Well, it's... Again, it feels more like a Wargroove 1 expansion pack, but it's, it's still fun. Gloomwood's great tree vicinity. My goodness, we just burned down their sacred tree. We're horrible. The fire, we stopped it. <laughs> That's a relief, huh? Muru, or Nuru, what's going on? Greenfinger Savran never, never gone this long. Rosen is scared and Nuru not helping. Nuru just yell orders and laugh like everything okay. Rosen doesn't like this Nuru. This Nuru fake. This Nuru hiding something. 
Is it Sigri? Is it Sigri? I'm sorry, it's just cause... It's my fault. It's my fault, green fingers. Oh, I thought Sigri was disguised as Nuru. It's no good for Florin to hunt on our own, Nuru. Wherever your travels next take you, would that you remember this. Anyhow, shall we? Nuru? Our final hunt together. Let us cherish this moment. Oh, wait, is Greenfinger dead? Oh, I think Greenfinger is dead. Greenfinger, I wanted to tell you something, too. <laughs> Leave it to Soy Games to emphasize diversity and minimize immaculate cruelty. Shh, shh, shh. Don't think, just consume content. It's about where I'm from. Where we're from. Nuru, our prey is just ahead and we must be quiet. Maybe I should just show you? Where I'm from. <laughs> We've got way better weapons than sticks and staves. Nuru, careful, you'll startle. <laughs> Nuru! Hang back, Sara, Sasa. I've got this. Nuru! Oh, he did die. Okay. Greenfinger! Sasa, your wound. It's bad. The beast's poison. Not much time. Nuru. There is a sacred place, an ancient place of healing, deep, deep. Okay, let's go. I'll take you. <sighs> no! That is one place you cannot go, no matter how dire. I shall get there myself. Please protect the others in my stead. It's my fault. That's why I gotta be the one to fix this. Nuru. Hunting alone, not good for Florin. <laughs> what did you say? Rosen knows Nuru needs help, needs friends all the time. Friends who would help Nuru too. If Nuru just ask. You're right. <laughs> Man, I'm such a dingus, huh? If we're gonna get through this, it's gonna be all of us. <sighs> Shoot, Mercy, I might already be in Heavensong by now. Rosen, Gillen, take the floating thing to Heavensong Palace. Looks like we'll have to invoke our treaty with the Empress Tenry. Sweet gum, see if there's anyone in Cherrystone who can help. Those furballs ain't getting away with this. Here I come. We're gonna stop them together. Oh wow. Through the power of friendship. I felt more emotion for Elliwood's dad. Alright. Act 2, Mission 1. Her loyal assistance. Lithra helps Pistol with an important experiment. Look, friends. Hor Hornarm has decided to grade us, grace us with his presence tonight. Whoa, what's that star called? Arai, of course. Huh, I know, it's my favorite. What about that one? Furud, I think. The lovely ones. Or uh... lonely ones. Hey, Tago, back on the island, you said none of us are here because everything's great at home. What did you mean? When your job is paperwork, you pick up on certain patterns. Looking through everyone's files, I started to notice. I don't think anyone actually wanted to be here. Many people simply had other jobs or family debts, or had premature departed or had prematurely departed university. Sorry, Pilchum, I did not mean. No, it's all right. I'm not ashamed of it anymore. Hey. Hey, at least you were doing better than me. I didn't go get into any universities at all. Wait, none of them? I mean, that's impressive. I uh, sorry. Hello. It's okay. Nobody expected me. Expected me. Can't sit still for anything. Hey. Hey, it's not a bad thing we're here, Tago. right? I mean, I met you, Tago. And Phil's alright when he's not a jerk. Hey, that's true. I'm very glad to have met you, Lithra. And Rom. They know so much about plants. They're always pointing out the coolest ones were out. If I had a teacher like that before, I know what you mean. Madam! Madam Pistol gets so fired up about her research. It makes me feel like I could do something like that, too. When it's all over, maybe. Maybe I could be her assistant. Lithra? Friend? Dearest friend. I've been meaning to talk to you about Pistol. I do not think she... I do not think you should... I know she's hard to understand sometimes, but, you know, she was the first person to ever say anything nice about she me. She stood up for me. She's the only one who stood up for me when Phil and Cylinder were being jerks. Uh, Pistol has just been a jerk to everyone, in my opinion, but okay. She trusted me with something important, and she, did, she didn't yell at me for messing up. 
first person to make me feel like I'm okay, just like I am. I've been waiting 16 years for that. I would so do. I would do anything. Anything to make her happy too. Lithra, uh, it's getting late. We should go to bed, yeah? Good night, friends. Mm. So the writing is weird. Uh, it's like they're trying really hard to make you care about these units. But it, it, the, the writing is weird. Wait, what? Pistol! Lytra, oh, dear. good. You're finally awake. Let's try an experiment. I need your help with an important experiment. You'll be my assistant, yes? I trust you can be my assistant for the night. I'm in! It's just up ahead. Oh, no. What was that? Yeah, should have just held it in until we made it to the base. Hey, Gustav had to go too. Isn't that right, little ghosty goo? Hey! Pistol, someone's there. Likely just the wind. I'll check it out just to make sure. Ah! Aroo! Foreign soldiers. Not foreign, though. <sighs> Someone else's problem, then. Come along. Tarkid, you see those soldiers? They almost look like Fari, but it couldn't be. My family's from around Starglass. They don't have an army. They're like librarians, for goodness sake. Stars above. Oh, looks Let's like it's a begin. fog of war map. Now the rules of this experiment are quite simple. No rules, a free-for-all battle. Oh, who are we fighting? <laughs> Each other, of course. What? I'm definitely no match for you. <laughs> but I'll try my best. Uh, unfortunately for her, so shall I. Oh. Okay. It's just a regular fog of war mm. battle. Ordinary, this would be an effortless victory, but the fog conceals our enemies. How to proceed? What is wrong with the graphics of this game when it's fog of war? Why why are all the colors so faded? Extend your field of vision with scout units. Scout units have a larger sight range than others. I don't get it. You can further increase sight by placing them atop mountain tiles. Be sure to use every available advantage in fog of war. Aha! Ah, I have the perfect strategy in mind. I don't get it. Yeah, why? Look, why are the colors so faded? Is it colorblind mode? Maybe. Let me let me check. Um, Mangs, you really look sick. Okay, thanks, asshole. Hey, oof! You really look ugly today. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Got cancer or something? Jesus Christ! Be polite. I know I'm sick. Um, let's see. Let's try uh, photosensitive mode. That didn't do shit. Uh, what about? Okay, let me try to turn off. No, it doesn't do shit. Why are the colors so faded? That Warcraft One didn't look like this. This is so weird. Okay, so these are the uh, scouts, I think. Okay, so they have extra vision range. Oh. Click, click, click. Uh, click, of click, course. click. Thanks. Is that so? Very useful information. So I know that the colors look like this because it's Fog of War, but Wargroove 1 didn't used to look like this in Fog of War mode. <laughs> Can't hide from me. So they're just having a friendly fighting match. Is that it? So this is just how the game teaches you Fog of War. Got it. Capturing watchtowers to repel Fog of War in a large area. Units can pay 200 gold to recover 30 health at work watchtowers. Oh, really? That's kind of cool. I like that. That's really cool. Madam? So what's this experiment about anyway? If I told you, it would invalidate the results. Aww. Aww. Yeah, so it's the Days of Ruin radar tower, basically. Oh. Oh, there's another barrack right here that we gotta capture. But it looks so ugly. Like, I hate these faded colors. I really don't like it at all. I agree that Fog of War needs to be more visible. But I really don't... I, it shouldn't oh. look so faded. 
What if I guessed what the experiment's Absolutely about? Absolutely not. not. Guessing is a game for idiots. I thought you were better than that, Lithron. I am, I am. Okay, so they have scouts too. So these are the dogs, I take it. Oh, I didn't check her uh, groove. Alright, so let's see. Chain reaction. Charge very slow. Damage fall off. Minus 20 health per tile distance. Okay. Uh, electric damage spreads to all units connected to Piskel in an unbroken chain of adjacent units. Okay, so it's kind of like... Uh, it's kind of like uh, Ryota's uh, Blade Dash, but it doesn't move her. Directly adjacent units takes 100% groove damage. Damage decreases the further unit is from Pistol. Minimum damage is 10. This groove cannot kill a unit. Okay, interesting. Pistol's groove deals devastating damage to large chains of enemies, and she can use her own units to make these chains longer. Train reaction leaves enemies with at least health health, so ensure you have units around to remove the weakened f uh, enemies from play. Okay, so it's like a chain lightning. So it's, it's very, very strong against a bunch of clumped up units. Um, okay, interesting. So we can capture the watchtower, I guess. There you go. If a hidden enemy interrupts your movement, your units will immediately stop and lose its turn. Yeah, so trap, basically. Ah, okay, so this watchtower has just three sight, really? Days of Ruin radar towers had way more than that. Alright, so we have a thousand gold. Should we get some Chivalers out? I say we get some Chivalers out. Um, hmm. So these are beetles? A quick unit. Critical hit adjacent with another dog. I love how it says dog. Why are the Vision Rangers so shit? Oh no, they took my watchtower. Is the experiment about Pistol's crystal tech or the cacophony crystal we found? Or maybe Madame is testing me, seeing if I'd make a good assistant for real. Yes, it is just a test. I don't have time for this. Let's check her attack, shall we? Okay, kind of cool. Wow. Amazing. No, just basic up. strategy. Alright, so we got a thousand. Maybe we should get a Chevalier out. Actually, no, we should get a Duelist out so we can uh, take the space next turn. Oh, wait. Oh, okay, so they attack the fort, I guess? Hmm. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay, so you don't, you don't critically hit when there's another enemy dog adjacent. Got it. Wow, they really buff dogs. These deal a lot more damage than they used to. Oh, I never captured the tower. Oh, did I not? Let me see what happens when I capture it for real, then. Ah, okay, so they have one, two, three. They have five vision range, which is a lot better. They have five vision range, which is a lot better for sure. Well, they buffed dogs in Wargroove 1, so this might just be a change that is followed through, basically. Here's the thing, though. Dogs actually don't have more vision. They just see through woods. Oh, there's the enemy commander. There you are. Ooh, or, or maybe the experiment is just an excuse to hang out with me. You know what I just realized? This game tries very hard to be Undertale. That's what it is. This game tries very hard to be Undertale. Hold Am I wrong? Like the writing style, it's like they're, they're trying to emulate... It's like they're trying to emulate Undertale. I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. There's an entire era of games that tried to be Undertale. Yeah, probably. What's an Undertale? Oh, let's see. Is this barrack captured? Wow, my vision range is terrible. So we have 800, so we can get another Chevalier right into the mix. Ah! 
So I wonder if artifacts will ever see play in, like, PvP. Okay, so watchtowers will defend themselves. Here oh, there's the enemy commander. I don't know, the writing Coming style reminds me of, like, someone trying to emulate Undertale. Maybe I'm wrong, though. She shoots, she scores! Ridiculous. So where's the enemy commander? Yeah, she's in the forest, so... I don't think we can kill her just yet. Actually, maybe we can. 33 damage. Hmm, not quite a crit. Maybe I should have gotten some spearmen out. You can crit her? Yeah, I can crit her with this one. 33 damage, but I can't kill, though. So I don't know if there's any point to doing it just yet. <laughs> so I think what I'll do is I'll go and capture this. I can crit here for 75 damage. But I can also crit here for 81 damage. One potion below enemy stronghold. Other is oh, there is a potion here. Oh yeah, right here. Oh, okay, cool. Oh shit, I should have known. I should have known. I should have known. I'm just gonna clean up all these units right here. Oh, I have my groove now. Use Pistol's Groove to spark an electrical train that damage all units connected to Pistol. See Pistol's Codex, yeah. I'm gonna try it. We'll see if it... We'll see if it's any good. So, the fort heals 3 HP for 200, exactly. But it seems like regular buildings reinforce better. Alright, let's get some dogs out, just to get some vision. What is the bonus objective? I keep forgetting to see this. And back to the shadows. Okay, so she's retreating. So their dogs are literal beetles. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, use pistol's groove to strike five targets at once. Prevent the enemy from capturing the watchtower. Well, we fucked up on that. Alright, so let's see. Um... I don't think the Guru will really do a lot at this point. So let's just wait. Let's begin. How's Wargroove 2 so far? Uh, it's Wargroove 1. That's what it is. With extra commanders. Yeah, no, we don't want to heal. I feel like that healing is a bit of a noob trap. A lot of people are going to click it by accident, which is not great. Okay, can we crit the barracks? Yes, we can. There is a third team in this battle. Yeah, I, I... So I see. They didn't drastically change much. Again, I said this many times. It feels more like an expansion pack. It feels a lot more like an expansion pack. 94 damage. Let's go. Let's get another Chevalier out, like so. And yeah, I like these dogs. They're pretty good now, so. Madam? What do you think about the campaign's difficulty curve? It's pretty easy, but then again, I'm playing on, like, normal mode, quote-unquote. Madam, about the other Come day, to I wanted to my forgiveness. beg my forgiveness for not defending me to that bore of a general. Sorry. Yes, well, yes, sorry, but also, um, uh... I was wondering why you lied about being in charge. Because she's an Lytra. asshole. I forgive you, but all this talk is starting to affect my concentration. Can we keep it quiet from now on? Yes, madam. I agree. Shut the fuck up and let me play. <laughs> Meme review when? At some point. Not right away, though. Alright, shall we try the groove? Let's try the groove. Let's try an experiment. Mm. Aha! Yay. <laughs> I mean, it works, right? Yeah! 
Yeah, online doesn't seem like it's changed much, and it's actually a bit annoying. Oh, there she is. Hi. Online seems very similar. Oops, I base skipped. My bad. There is a potion here. Maybe I should get it. Oh, it can only be it can only be obtained by someone who can walk in mountains, I think. Ah. Okay, I'll remove this one. So I guess I'll go into the forest and attack this one. And yeah, that's about it. I don't have any money, so I can't recruit. Green potion. Maybe that's different. Maybe. So what does this do? Your commander's groove charges to the next tier. Oh. Oh. Cool. Let's try it. It looks like I might have to. Uh, might might have to get it with a dog though. But yeah, I gotta say, these, like, faded Fog of War colors, I really dislike them. It just makes it very hard to see. One thing that I'm struggling with, especially considering I'm playing with colorblind mode on, at least I think I am, I'm struggling to see which units have moved and which one hasn't. Is colorblind mode on right now? It is. Colorblind mode is on, and I still struggle seeing things. Music is good. Oh, yeah. Music is great. Oh, there's a knight. Can we kill it? Yes, we can. Seems like whole view has a faded effect. Yeah, it's... I don't really know why. Wow, dogs are garbage against knights. My goodness. They're terrible. Alright, let's use the space bar. Okay, so we can only purchase right now. So let's just get some duelists. Honestly, let's just get mo more dogs. Or beetles. Do -do 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 -do. Dogs have always been garbage. No, they've been buffed heavily. Oh, there we go. They just. Oh, wow. They do a lot more damage now, so they're very, like, glass cannony. I'm so glad the beetles retreat, guys. I cannot handle watching beetles die easy. Alright, let's see if we can do some damage to the commander now. She has her groove ready, so we gotta be careful. Alright, let's do this. So now we have our groove ready. This will only hurt the entire mm. time. Aha! That's wait. Did it hurt my own units? Are you serious? That's garbage! What? Also, why can I not attack? Huh? It damages your own units?! That's terrible! Garbage groove, what the hell? Worst groove ever. Also, why can I not attack? I don't get it. Why can't I attack? Can someone explain? Like, why not? Why why can't I attack? This doesn't make any sense. Can someone explain? No actual vision? Oh, there we go. She's actually in the fog. But I could still see her, though. Oh, maybe I could only see her because... Uh, okay, yeah. Maybe I could only see her because... Uh, because because I used my groove. Ha! Huh, with that, I control all production Just in this area. Confirm. Victory is inevitable. Okay, so, I know she's there, but I still didn't have vision on her. Makes sense.
Alright, so I'll kill her next turn, pretty much. That means I can probably just end She's probably gonna use her groove this turn, though. There you go. Oh, no. Where's the group? We can do it. We got one. Lytra. Nice. No one likes to spoil sport, Lythra. She didn't use her groove. Why not? Why not use your groove? You have three HP left. All right, let's go kill her. I'm sure we all. I hope she won't teleport this. away and heal to full. I messed up. You did indeed. Oof. You got me good. Hey, two out of three stars. Not bad. Madam? Please. It's still, tell us about the experiments. Was it a success? <laughs> we shall soon see. The scribes are compiling their observation as we speak. In the meantime, tell me, as you were fighting earlier, did you notice anything different about your weapons? Click, click, click. A very good guess. No. But no. Haha, <laughs> it's funny because she understands what the beetle says. I've replaced the crystal material in half our army's weapons with fragments of the crystal we found underground. I'm curious how much more powerful Cacophony's crystals are than ours. <laughs> the data from our battle will show us precisely. She's literally colder, what the fuck? Our observations, Fine. madame. Finally. Let's begin. Without further ado, the results... What? Hang on, this can't be correct. There must be some mistake. There is not. Huh? What's wrong? According to the data, there is no difference. Cacophony's crystals and ours, they are the exact same material. Oh. oh, is that bad? Do you know how hard it is extracting energy from the crystals back home? I spent years perfecting that technology. The crystals fought me every step. But I pushed the technology to its absolute limits. When we learned Cacophony had crystals of their own, my heart leapt. Surely they were stronger than ours. Pure, higher grade, something. But there's no difference. They're the same damn thing. I lost an arm and an eye shaping our crystals into swords. Yet Cacophony used the same tools to enslave mines thousands of years ago. Madame? I'm no idiot, Litra. I didn't say. If Cacophony managed Requiem with a bit of crystal and glue, I can do a thousand times better. There must be some trick to it. Some stupid trick Cacophony found. This mission is no longer just about our allies. It's my mission too now. I need to know. I need to know how Cacophony managed it. Shall we head back to camp? The others must be waiting. Madam? Pistil, are you okay? Yes. Yes, yes. Just something stuck in my prosthetic eye. You run along. Lytra. Lytra? What a wonderful assistant you were today. I suspect I'll need your help from, from you now on. That? Can you do that? For, for me? me? Yes, madam. Of course, madam. Helping you is... I... Helping you is, uh... I'm glad. Can you stop simping for this Good woman? Girl. This woman is clearly evil. It's so obvious this woman is clearly evil. Alright. Anthony BM donated 20 bucks for Super Chat. Poop. Thanks. I appreciate it. Alright, Act 2, Mission 2. Not quite ideal. Lithra must save a friend from a dangerous new enemy. From my point of view, the Jedi are evil. Filtrum, please calm yourself. We have to go back. Yes, but without a plan. Hey, guys. Private... Oh, that's... That's her. I didn't recognize her. Private Falaki, where have you been? Uh... Madam Pistol needed us for something important. You should have just cleared that with the General. We needed you. Lithra... Lithra, the human state... Romp. Wait, he died? Save yourselves. That was their last order. Wait, he died off screen? We should have done something. Why couldn't we see do anything? It's not our fault. Your fault, Filtrum. You were outnumbered. And where were our numbers, I wonder? So, what's the plan? We don't have a choice, do we? We have to save them, right? Hmm, it will not be easy. But now that the other half of our army is finally back, we may stand a chance. Okay, we gotta go rescue. We gotta go r rescue them. Come, we must prepare. We've arrived. The Redheim soldiers have made their bases in the compound ahead. 
We should strike soon, but we must be careful. In this fog, we don't know when the enemy's numbers or their resources. I do not wish to mince words, Lethrum. This is not quite ideal. What are your orders? I don't know what to do. I'm sorry, I just... You need not put this all on yourself, friend. Yes, even General Nadir relies on us to help with our strategy. What do we do? What do you think? Hmm. Perhaps we could send half of our forces to circle around to the north? Attacking from two fronts could be advantageous. But... But we'd be half as strong in two places. Shouldn't we stick together? With such low visibility, it's difficult to say. Sorry, I cannot be of more help. We should make a decision. Oh! Split up or stick together. Hmm. Hmm. Huh. Split up or stick together. What should we do, guys? Split up or stick together. Hmm. Hmm. Split up. Sounds more fun. Understood. Cover team, move out. It will take them a turn or two to reach the north. We should do what we can here for now. What? What was that? Is that Gigarat killing people? I hope I made the right choice. Alright. The colors seem clearer now for some reason? I'm not entirely sure. Let's see. I'll do commanders only for the animations. Okay. So we're, we're using Lithra again now? Oh, it's the weather, yeah. Alright, let's send the uh, Beatles out. Remember, you can use scout units to see further ahead in fog. Place a scout on a mountain tile to see up to five tiles. So, what kind of bothers me a little bit is that they don't actually have more vision, only when they're on mountains. Hmm, this isn't a barrack or a village. Still, it may be useful. Oh, this must be a hideout. Oh no, lumber mill. Can cut down forests in exchange for 50 gold. Regrows one forest every turn. Okay. Cool, I can cut down trees. That's kind of cool. Oh, they do actually have one more vision. Ah, the bear people have returned. Oh, okay, so they do actually have one more vision. Cool, I can de I can cut down trees. Awesome. Uh-oh, we need to hurry. Rom. We've got the last one surrounded, sir. What should we do with him? Yes, sir, of course, sir. You got a lot to answer for, buddy. Okay, so Romb is still alive. That's good to know. There you go. Covert, covert guys have arrived. Splitting up was definitely better, I think. Lithra, we can use these structures to, to fund our mission. Use lumber mills to turn surrounding forest tiles into gold. First, select the lumber mill. Next, choose as many adjacent forest tiles as you like. When you're finished, select the mill, mill once more to confirm. Oh, we're cutting down all the trees. If you used up all your forest tiles, worry not. At the start of each turn, one forest tile will grow in an available space, providing new potential income. Oh, we're getting... We're, we're killing all the trees. Every single one of them. That's not even a question. Fuck trees. I do like that mechanic, actually. Oh wow, there's so many lumber mills. Holy shit, they're everywhere. But they can't be used to produce anything, can they? Oh, they can reinforce! They can actually reinforce. That's cool. I like that. And we'll, we got some barracks here. Uh, can we capture them, though? So we have a watchtower and a barrack that we can't... Okay, we can actually reach it. Let's put the beetle up here and capture the barrack. Like so. Open treasure. It's a treasure chest. Oh, hello. Heavy armor reduces incoming damage by 50%. Cool. Alright. So now this guy takes 50% less damage. That's actually kick ass. I love that. That is actually amazing. 
Great Knight promotion, let's go! What a tricky beast it is. Tricky. But no match for our commander. No! No, no! Stay back! Stay back! Stay back. What are they doing to him? Alright, fuck the trees. I'm killing all the trees. This is incredibly funny. So, is there a reason not to cut the trees down? Like, ever? It seems like there is no reason to not kill the trees. It's literally free money. And you just keep getting more of them. So you get, you get a lot of cash. Alright, let's uh, equip the other armor. All right, let's name this guy. Um, Bench Juice. All right, let's see what's over here. Let's get some duelists out to capture the uh, capture the surrounding properties. Probably want to keep our units together, I imagine. Oh, I haven't moved this guy yet. Hello? What? What is that? Whatever it is, we must think of a plan. Oh, it's a golem. Sir, more of the possum people are at our gates. This is grim news indeed. We barely escaped the last encounter with our lives. Soldiers of Cherry Stone, prepare for battle. Uh-oh. They killed our doggo. Yeah, so we probably want to take up some defensive locations here. Alright, let's capture this watchtower. Oh, never mind. Oh, so if you try to capture a building... I see. If you try to capture a building that's already captured... Then uh, you actually get trapped. So you gotta be very careful. Anyway, fuck trees. So you don't have to do it every single turn. You can you can let the forest build up for a turn. My goodness, these trees regrow really quickly though. What the hell? Alright, let's go and capture these units as well. But we got two super cavaliers right here. Who take 50% less damage. Let's see if these are captured. They're not. Oh, hi there. I should have moved the beetle first. You again? You really are fari, aren't you? It's been years since I've returned to Starglass. I won't fight you, I refuse. Whatever you're doing here, I hope it's for the right reasons. Who are you talking to? What? What? Who is that? Oh, here comes the golem. Oh, good. You finally decided to calm down. Didn't I tell you? You're no match for the boss. Now then, who sent you? Won't talk, eh? We have our ways of fixing that. Commander, what do you think? Ah, that's bad news for you, I'm afraid. Take him please. away. No, please. Oh, no. That thing is out of control. Do not panic, Litra. Do not panic. It would be most unwise to panic at the present moment. Alright, so these guys, they crit whenever they're below 40 health. But, they are not invincible. We can defeat it if we work together. They are pretty scary, though. Especially once they start critting. But they don't take a lot of damage from Swordsman, as you can see. Do, 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 do. Here goes nothing. It's definitely. Oh, yeah, it's Caesar. Absolutely, it's Caesar. That's the plot twist. Yeah, that's the plot twists. It's Caesar the dog. Yeah, splitting up was definitely the right choice here. 100%. Okay. Doesn't seem like there is much this way. Uh, looks like there's some pikemen. I think we're gonna send our cavalier. Okay, well, let's name this guy. Uh, Kurt. Matheson. There you go. 
You're a cavalier now. Congrats. Congrats, Bozo. Yeah, watchtowers are like they're like they're like radar towers from Days of Ruin, yeah. Exactly. So I don't know if I like lumber mills, because it's just a lot of stuff you gotta click all the time, which I don't know if I like that. Do you guys like the idea of lumber mills? To me they seem a bit tedious. It's like things you gotta do every turn. The best yields. Yeah, I have a feeling the path grows even more dangerous from here on out. Let's not lose hope. Rom, don't worry, we're coming to save you. Anyway, we gotta heal up our calves. They took a lot of damage. Do 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 do. They regrow trees a little too fast. Yeah, they might do that. It's like I just know I'm gonna forget to cut down the trees, and it's like you gotta do it every single turn. Well, you gotta do it at least every three turns. If you want to be optimal, especially like now when you got like four of them. I mean, it's a lot of extra cash. Don't get me don't don't get me wrong. That is kind of cool, but it also just feels very micromanagey. I would have preferred it if they just like I don't know, automated the process or something. Anyway, let's break open this. Can we break open this gate? Is that a gate? Yeah, it is. You just gotta be able to see it. Anyway, let's capture all these buildings right here. And let's just wait. Oh, the golem dropped something? Oh, it dropped a potion. You're right. It did. Is the beastie finally ready to Do talk? Your worst. Do your worst. You cannot hurt me in any way that matters. Oh, I wouldn't be so sure of that. It's 100% Caesar. Hope it's not too dark for you. Boss says we should conserve what? energy. Where are we going? Oh, just for a walk. Might chat with a mate, visit the pond. And when you return... Oh, good question. I'm not sure you will enjoy your... I will enjoy your... Heart emoji? Heart emoji? Did he just say heart emoji? Here goes nothing. Yeah. Heart emoji? That's cringe. Why did he make a heart emoji? Okay, kill the dog. Um, what does this do? Uh, wait, what? Do I need vision over it, maybe? I think I do. What? But what does he do? I can, okay, let's just cons... What? I need to- I think I need to be next to it. There you go. Okay, replenishes 20 health to your entire army. Okay, got it. That's fine. Okay, we've almost killed the gate. We will have it down next turn. So this pikeman is just standing about, it seems. I attack the gate again. I mean, someone's gotta do it. Just came back from a nap. What did I miss? Uh, we're trying to rescue Gigarat. Okay, maybe now we can use it? I'll go and drink the potion. It's only 4 HP. It's like an Andy Hyper Repair. All right, I'm just gonna charge up my superpower. It's actually, it's very hard to see if a unit moves. I agree. It is almost impossible to see if a unit has moved. I don't know about you guys, but I'm having big difficulties telling if beetles have moved, especially when they're blue. All right, nope, I didn't mean to press wait, but that's fine.
Oh shit, we gotta remember to cut down the trees again. I almost forgot. There should be an op- there should be a quick button to cut down every single tree. Don't you guys think so? Like, cut- cut down every single tree. Fuck all the trees. Should probably have a few more beetles lying around. I'm just gonna attack here. Oh, there's a dog. Help, help! The mole folk are attacking! The mole folk are attacking! We have infiltrated the enemy base, proceeding with caution. Alright, we're going in. We're going in, folks. With the armored chevalers. Let's go. Yeah, I should probably get more beetles out. They're actually pretty handy. You can click all trees, then click the lumber. Oh, can you now? We shall not yield to the ruthless badgerkin. Oh, shit. If it wasn't for the armor, he'd be dead. Interesting. So fog kind of updates, but you still see the units in the fog? Alright, the plot twist this is going to be Caesar. We, we know it. That's what they're setting up for, right? Oh, should I save up for my super groove? Wait, I got 227. Yeah, okay. What? It says 227, does it? Should I not have my super groove ready? Time to improvise. Ignoring his fiance. So what did that do? Did it stun them? I'm not sure. I guess we'll find out. Alright, let's uh, bring down this uh, this uh, watchtower. There we go. Hey, I got the side objective. Sweet. Hmm? What happened? Oh. Do, 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 do. She's asking if the game is good. Well, I don't know yet. I haven't played the whole thing. I mean, I feel like I'm just repeating myself every time someone asks. It's... It's okay so far. It's not, like, amazing. It, it's fun. I mean, Wargroove 1 was fun, too. The new commanders are interesting. Yes, I'm attacking pikemen with cavaliers. Shut up. Alright, we gotta heal up our armored cavaliers. That's very important. What the fuck? What? Did I just get trapped by a unit that I could see? Fog of War works in strange ways in this game, man. I don't get it. Did I, did, was I just trapped by a unit that was visible? That's really weird. Why, why does it work like that? But why could I see it if it was in the fog? Why are units visible in the fog? Fog of War looks very buggy. Yeah, it does. It does look like a glitch. It does. Yeah. Uh, hey, okay, my commander's kind of getting beat up. This is not good. I might need to retreat back to a heal tile. Okay, my cavaliers didn't die yet. Uh oh. Um. Ooh. Please kill. Please kill. Thank you. Okay, another- yeah, I gotta be more careful, you guys. Turn 10. Wait, what is the objective? Storm the enemy compound. Okay, so I just gotta get a unit in here. Got it. Anyway, um, let's go back and heal. Yeah, just- why can't I click on reinforce? There you go. There- Fog of War does very strange things to this game 
I feel like it's a little buggy. No, don't wait. Okay, kill the pikeman. There you go. And then we got a... Uh, oh, this is an enemy cavalier. Got it. So, but I can kill it by doing this. Boom. Do, 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 do. Okay, so... No! Oh my god, no! It's shitty design that attack and wait are so close to each other. It should be attack, cancel, wait. It should be attack, cancel, wait. Don't put wait and attack right next to each other. This is terrible UI design. Absolute garbage UI design. Sounds like a cope to me. Of course it's a cope. I'm just saying, I'm just saying it leaves a lot of room for, for mistakes to happen. Especially in a game where you move units very quickly all at once. It's not good. Look, look, I don't know what to say. I like to play quickly, okay? Like, just, it's not hard. Just move weight down. So you don't accidentally click it. Okay, so I have my groove ready again. But I gotta be very careful so, I don't, so I don't lose my commander. Ah, you cut your trees? Ah, oh, the stupid trees. We can wait a little bit. We don't need to cut them right away, do we? We don't need to cut them right away. Oh, we got an archer right here. All right, let's infiltrate here. Any other units that we need to move? Uh, we have these uh, beetles right here. We can send them in as well. We got some infantry coming in as well. I don't think they'll arrive in time to be useful, though. Yeah, beetles. What else are you supposed to call them? Dogs? Oh, Archer's still alive. I don't care about the trees, guys. You can go play Lumberjack Simulator some other time. Alright, do I just need to get a single unit in here? Oh. Oops. I guess I should have seen that one coming. Attack, attack, attack! Get the beetles! I kind of feel like I should use my, my groove right now. But, uh... I don't wanna. All right, I'm gonna use the swordsman to attack over here. Oh, there's a oh, there's a little barrack here. I didn't I didn't even realize. But we can one shot it with a crit. Enemy barracks neutralized. Victory is on the horizon. Thanks for telling me. All right, we're doing pretty well. I think we can. Uh, Get a unit in here pretty soon. Is this our hero? Are there like different icons to units wielding uh, wielding actual relics? Because I know I picked up two armor tiles. I'm not gonna bother building anything. I'm pretty sure I can win next turn. They have a small arrow next to them. Okay, oh, that's good to know. We have one more hour, one more uh, barrack we probably want to take out. Okay, so we'll move back here and then we'll crit this guy. Bonk. 
And then it's just one unit over here, right? Oh, no? Yeah, I fucking knew it. It's Caesar. Lithra, their commander. It's, it's, it's a dog. dog! Yeah, world's most predictable plot twist. You cur, what have you done with General Nadir? General? Ah, you must mean that beasts. They're talk taking some time to cool off. But I wouldn't worry about them after all. You're the ones in danger. Oh, we gotta we gotta we gotta fight Caesar. I like how the music changes. That's a nice touch. That is a nice touch. The Beatles are very strong against archers, by the way. Incredibly strong. There we go. Let's critterino our way through here. We can even capture the barrack. Why not? Oh, we have the cyclone now, the, the super cyclone. Alright. Send the turn. Caesar's groove is so broken. Oh, I wonder what Caesar's super groove is gonna be. Let's check it out next time in the codex. Oh, he has his groove ready, too. Oh, wait, he ran away? Hey, come back here. Alright, let's check what C Caesar's super groove is. Uh, Alright, so... Inspire. Allow certain units spent to take an additional action. Inspire. Charge to your radius two tiles. And they get plus two move. Oh shit. It's like a mega dance. Oh damn. That's really broke. That's broken as shit. It's a mega dance. That gives them two movements. Okay, that is terrifying. Here's the thing, though, and I don't know. I don't know, like, I, I almost, whenever I played uh, Wargroove quick matches, I almost never fought, I never really fought Caesar on the ladder. He was very rarely picked. Like, his, his groove sounds very strong on paper. Howard, stop behind those crossbow guards and fight us yourself. It sounds very strong on paper, but it actually is very hard to use in competitive. Uh, let's see. Yeah, let's take down this lumber mill, shall we? Caesar is best boy. Hacking Doggerino! Wow, he's such a good boy. We like dogs. All right, let's clean up these units around here. Isolate Caesar. And let's protect our barracks so he doesn't get taken down. Oh, they actually killed our watchtower. Oops. Not great, but it's fine. All right, fine, I'll build a knight. No, I, I can't be bothered to chop down trees this turn. Check if Caesar has a death animation. Oh, he, he does, kinda. Woof, woof. He doesn't actually fight himself. He just has two guards that fights for him. Ugh, it's breath fetid. Yeah, dogs have really nasty breaths. Uh, okay. Can I kill Caesar? Let's see. 14 damage. Yeah, knights don't do a lot of damage to, um... Well, I guess it's a half HP knight. But I should have him... He should be dead pretty soon. He is dead next turn, unless something... Actually, he might be dead this turn, if I can crit him. 19 damage? No. 
Reminder, they kiss dogs on the mouth. Yeah, I guess they do. Where are all these units coming from? Is there a barrack I didn't kill or something? Pretty sure there's a barrack here I didn't kill, because the enemy keeps getting reinforcements, and I don't know from where. It's really weird. You know what I miss? Being able to combine units. That's actually one thing I miss from Advanced Wars. And you can't do that in Wargroove, and that kind of sucks. I oh know, they took over my lumber mills. What am I gonna do? <laughs> Alright, Caesar is done for. Let's have a... Uh, let's have a bench juice kill him. Everyone who kisses their dog in the mouth needs to be shot in the, street, in the streets. It's a bit weird behavior, yeah. That's for General Nadir. Caesar, no! <laughs> woof, woof, woof. Thank goodness you're okay. Because the coward didn't do anything. You two just did whatever you wanted and said the dog told you to. Well, anyway, it looks like the time is getting late and we're all kind of tired walking all the way from Cherry Stone. Don't you know? We probably would have regrouped with Nero in the other all, on the other floor and anyhow. Good day to you. Oh! Oh, they dropped a key. Alone. Oh, not here. No, not back Just here. Go back to that darkness. Oh, is, does he have PTSD? Romp. Ah, that explains his pronouns. <laughs> Tris dot. What is happening? Where are you? Ray. I am here, Ray. Tris, Ray, Rom, where did everyone go? Look, here we are all right here, are we not? My body feels strength. <laughs> I cannot hear my own voice. I cannot feel my own heart. I cannot see all dark except except enemies. Enemy, you are all help. Enemies everywhere. It's us, Tris. It's me. I'll kill them. I'll kill them all. Rum, where are you? I am here. Rum, where are you? I was there. I was there. I, I was, was right there with you all. Why could you not see? Rum, where are you? I am here. Found you. You see, you see. You should rest, General. Perhaps. Yes, perhaps. What? What What happened to... Dorcas? The trees? Oh. oh yeah, we used them to get the resources to rescue you. Pretty handy, huh? <laughs> Had to think on our feet just like you taught us. Romp? I did a good job. We didn't... I didn't mess up, did I? Oh no. We should have been faster. I should have been there before. No. I... No, you did wonderfully, little soldier, Litha. Thank you. Thank you. Good work, well done. Good job cutting all down those trees and ruining their economy. That that's great. We should return to camp. I'm glad you're okay. <laughs> Phil was really worried, you know. Okay. We did it. We rescued Romp. And we killed Caesar, the dog. Lytra! Lytra? You look miserable. Where have you been? Incredible. I've had such a rush of inspiration since our experiment. Made a few adjustments to some of my experimental machines. Pistol. Are the machines combat ready? Of course. Obviously. Why? We have encountered a most dangerous foe. If we are to defeat him, your expertise is surely needed. <laughs> expertise? Say no more. Oh, we finally get golems now. Yeah, I agree, Clark. The sentences are very short. Due to the way they're structured, you can't really have long sentences at all. Act 2, Mission 3. Romb and Pistol team up for a battle of seismic proportions. Ugh. That's all of them? <laughs> ha! Fodder for my machines! Looks like another sealed door here, too. 
My cherry stone have opened it already? They don't seem to be the brightest bunch. <laughs> woof woof. What is it, boy? Whoa, what's all this? Wonder what happened if we just... Ah, do it again, do it again! Stop that. Ah, one more couldn't hurt anything. What the fuck? Lytra! Lytra? My machine! No! What the fuck? Ooh. Phew, that was a close one. Yeah, I can't kill a name character. Oops, did we do that? Man, we must have been due for a ground shake. There's no way the humans could cause that much damage to the environment. Those imbeciles! I'll grind them to stardust, I swear. Look. Should we retreat? No, look. The enemy has few resources. If we can deprive them of income and surround their forces, victory is ours. But we must coordinate. Strike their forces from both sides at once. Ah, oh, yeah, let's go. Madam Contractor? Idiots! Every last one of them, exsanguated from here to high heaven. I assume she accepts the plan. Let's rest, stay uh... close. Yeah, that's probably for the best. Oh, so I have to play as two armies now. Ah, okay. I see. So do I control them at the same time? Interesting. Environmentalist denialists, yes. That's, that's what we're going with here. Okay, so I do control them both at the same time. Hmm. Ah, this barrack may have enough supplies to build some of my machines. <laughs> oh, that flea bag is going to be vaporized faster than you can say, uh, moo. Please do not vaporize me. Quirky dialogue. So, do I have to, like, share- do I have to, like, pool my resources between two armies, or what am I gonna do here? Everyone, I can hear the ground shaking again. Be careful not to fall. Oh, shit. Okay, so... Ah, I see. So all of those guys... All of those tiles are gonna be attacked. Okay, they're, they're gonna vanish next turn. Aha. Okay, so we gotta be careful. Got it. Oh, what's this? Tensho, ability, push a unit backwards one tile. Ooh. Ooh, that's cool. Okay, I do- wait, what? I can only build- what? I can only build chevaliers in this barrack? Are you serious? Why? I don't get it. Wow. So cool. What are those big metal things, uh -huh. madame? You mean experimental crystal unit type 6? My patented pride and joy, possibly the most elegant design ever conceived. <laughs> it's nothing much, just a few spare parts and a bit of luck, really. Ah, uh -huh, okay. Huh. So I can only build Chevaliers from this barrack. Call the trees? Well, I, do I have any lumber camps? Oh, I do! Oh, shit! Again? We didn't even do anything that time. Caught have been us. Oh, shit. Yeah, you're right. I have... Oh, you can actually, like, mass D4. Oh, that feels nice. Oh, I love cutting down trees. All right, we have an artifact, ladies and gentlemen. Do your worst. Check mission objectives. You shouldn't cut trees for it. Oops. Uh-oh, win without cutting down a single tree. Push three enemies into a chasm. Should I undo my turn? Let's undo my turn. All right, we're not gonna we're not gonna cut down any trees, guys. We're gonna be environmentally friendly. I fear no creature. We can do this without hurting the environment, ladies and gentlemen. Here in this house, we stand Mother Nature. 
Ah, oh, this golem is gonna go to town. What is that sound? Is it part of the soundtrack? Spent all this time planning, fine-tuning, calibrating, lubricating joints, and that dog ruins it. Alright, there you go. Gauntlet equipped. I can still only build a Chevalier from here, though. Always happens when you select her for some reason. That's weird. Why? Is that just a sound effect she makes? Hey, what are you doing cutting down trees? Don't you know this is a green space? Not cool. Alright, they got a pretty big army guarding the gates, so I probably need some more units before I can break through. They also have a golem, which is a bit terrifying. Oh shit. Oh, damn. Alright, let's name this guy. Bethany. You're a rat cavalier. And this guy. Strong wind. He is, uh, ice. Ice. 125. Wait a minute. Can I go around here? Calling your fiance a rat? Of crystal technology. Oh, before the patented power of crystal technology. That presence, it almost feels like Sir Emmerich's cherry stones, doesn't it? Ooh. Yeah, it does actually make that sound every time you equip her, or every time you select her. An immiscible forest with miserable company. And the one bit of fun I had was gone. Stop complaining, lady. My goodness. Hey, at least we can get a triple air this time around. Okay, so we're getting our asses kicked a little bit here. I think I'll capture this. And I think we just need to reinforce some of our guys. Wait, uh, am I going to be okay here? I hope so. I hope I'll be okay. Hopefully I will. The enemy mill losing trees because of the quake. That's hilarious. A little bit. Uh, hopefully I'm okay. My commander going a little bit low. Push golem into hole to kill it. Oh, I can! Yeah, you're right. If he doesn't move... Okay, my commander is taking a bit of a beating now. But it's fine. The commander is pretty sturdy. Yeah. Oh no! Wait, I can still do it, I think. Yes, I can push the golem into a hole. Are the Gloomwoods even anywhere close to a fault line? Must be. You can't have ground shakes without them, can you? Folks get ground shakes here all the time, no? No. See? Wait, were you agreeing, or...? Okay, well, uh, so where is our... There's Bethany. So how does this work? You Okay, so you can only push in a straight line. Okay, I can actually do this. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Oh no, I can't reach. Ah, oh, that sucks. I can still use strong wind here, though. Uh... What? Huh? I guess it doesn't work like that? I guess not. I really thought it did, but okay. Undo? I could I can't. Well, that's a shame. Yeah, what? that is such a weird sound effect to make. 
No respect. Simply no respect for the si Shut the fuck up. My goodness, I hate this character. For science! Oh, I like science! Oh, that's my personality! Shut the fuck up! Why does anyone like this character? Okay, I think we're... yeah, that's all the units. I guess it pushes back from the open dial, yeah. Okay, I think I can do it now. I think I can do it now. I think we can push the golem down the ravine. My goodness, this is a clusterfuck. I think it's time for our, uh, for our superpower. Yeah, you need to have an open space, I think. You leave me no choice! <laughs> Obviously, I don't think they're gonna actually make her a twist villain. I don't get it. So, how the fuck does this even work? Oh, okay, I see. Yeah, like so. Ah, it's like an AoE almost. Got it. Okay, that's cool. I like that. Also, I have like no gold. Because I'm not cutting down any trees. Feels bad, man. Shut up! Shut up! Stop talking, I hate you! Okay, I don't have any more money. Alright, so we have our superpower now, so I don't know if that means he'll retaliate. No, it's only the superpower that makes him retaliate at range. But he should get, like, extra defense and shit now, so... He should survive this pretty easily. You must do your farming symbol. I actually kind of like that there's a secret objective to not cut down trees. It's a lot of damage, but it's it's good that they're focusing my commander, because that means they're not targeting my other units. And he's in power mode now, so he takes lo a lot less damage and deals a lot more damage back, so it works. Ugh. They brought him pretty low. Oh, that's Caesar! What? What? Save yourselves! No! Are you serious? Oh my goodness. I overestimated my commander. I overestimated my commander, guys. Hmm. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Caesar looks like a regular dog, so... But yeah, I probably play this a little bit too recklessly. Everyone, listen. Biggest mistake of the match. That was a pretty big mistake, wasn't it? Maybe I should equip wow. the glove on the golem. <laughs> I don't think uh, heroes can equip regular items, right? It has to be a generic. Hmm. I do think it's a good idea to put it on a cavalier, because they can move faster. Might be able to do something. Yeah, only generics. Can you change the sound effect somehow? I don't think so. I don't know how I would be able to. Uh, 
Alright. Golem is now equipped. That's good. I think it's just a bug. I think it's literally just a bug. Oh shit, I didn't see that guy. I thought that was one of mine. Sorry about that. I feel like some extra archers might not be a bad thing to have here. Because this, this area gets very choke pointy. The different in colors make me think they should have done an advanced war situation so where the two forces under your commanders have separate turns. Yeah, that's that's what I thought would happen. But that's not what happened at all. Hey, not my barrack! Don't kill my barracks! God damn it! Oops, um That was definitely not what I wanted to do. Ah shit, I have to go back now, my barrack is gonna die. gonna kill my barracks. That's hilarious. Okay, so yeah, you it has to you have to have available space between you and the target. What's this? This is a regular infantryman. Kind of annoying how you can only buy knights in the other barracks. I really don't like it. I don't really understand why they made it that way. It's just really weird. Is there ever any like is there an actual in-game explanation for why it's like that? I don't know. Okay, this time around I'm not gonna get my commander killed. Yeah. Okay, he went back and destroyed a lumber mill instead. So, cool. AI is stupid. One of these days, we'll, we'll create an intelligent AI. Is this a Ratman run? Yeah, it's a Ratman run. Alright, time to kill this annoying knight. Get the lumber mill, kill this. Let's begin. Shut up. Alright, so what we should do now. Okay, we cannot use the strong wind in any meaningful way just yet. But these archers are really strong. Ratmin. Okay, we can build a Chevalier here this turn, so we should probably do that. Oh, I see. So this barrack can actually build golems. The other one cannot. Ah, okay. Okay, they're focusing my commander again. Kind of annoying, but okay. You can kind of trick the AI by just making like make like take as many properties as you can and they'll just like flail at your properties i mean i don't mind a predictable ai per se but sometimes it does feel a little bit stupid especially since you can just use a 1 hp infantry to just do this over and over feels a bit silly that's all Let's capture here. Uh, oh shit, wait, that's the, oh, that's the unit with the glove. Crap. Oops. Let's reinforce our hero so we don't lose him again. Do, do, do. 
Alright, let's see what happens. Properties are the APCs of Wargroove. Yeah, I agree about they, they keep cutting down trees. Oh, well, there goes our gauntlet. We have one left, though. So we have our power ready, but I have a feeling if we're gonna, if we're gonna have, um, if we're gonna send our guy in against a big army, we probably want to wait for superpower. You should run. Wait, where's Caesar? Where's Caesar? He's right here. Okay, he's not in range yet. We just gotta be careful. Most of these guys are very injured. Mm -hmm. The dog is moving? Yes, he is. Let's put the golem forward. Leave our commander- Shut up! There's too much random dialogue, I feel. I feel most of the dialogue is not very... It's not very, um... Interesting. Like, I'm very- I'm rarely am I interested in what she has to say. I feel like she just- she just repeats herself a lot. Like, oh, hello, I am offended. Okay, we get it. She says it like seven times in a row. It's like, okay, we get it. You're mad. You don't have to repeat it a million times. Oh, look at that chain reaction, though! Look at that chain reaction, though! Oh, ho, ho, ho. <coughs> <coughs> oh shit. <coughs> oh my goodness, look at that chain reaction. Oh! Oh my goodness, I'm not even going to attack here. I'm just going to wait. Well, maybe I can use it. <coughs> Oof. All right, look, listen to this. Oh my goodness. Woo! This will only hurt the entire mm. time. Aha! Woo! Holy shit! <coughs> oh my goodness. I am tired of coughing. My goodness. That was incredible. That was absolutely incredible. Maybe we should just activate Crystal Heart? Nah, we'll wait. We'll heal up. That was a lot of damage. That was, in fact, a shit ton of damage. Whew. I feel like this map was almost made for her groove, though. The new grooves are fun. They are. And I do like the super grooves. Oh, there's Caesar. Uh-oh, his groove is ready. Yeah, come on, give me super groove. Give me super groove. Oh, they're just gonna focus him. And Caesar has already moved, so this is great. He's just gonna get a bunch of groove charged this turn. Come on, more, more, more. Yes, 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 focus my commander. Give him tons of groove charge. Shut the fuck! Shut the fuck up! The enemies are very suicidal in this game. Like they don't—they don't save their one HP units at all. They just rush you, which, you know, is not terrible. Oh yeah, 
Oh yeah, let's go. Strength from beyond! So the beast has returned. That's pretty good. Oh, wow. Hold still. Your end draws near. I think we might be able to kill him this turn. Maybe. He's standing in a river, so he has less defense. And we can get a uh, infantry crit. More rumbling. But I can't tell from where. This might be a kill, actually. If we get some luck. Yep, there we go. He should be gone for. He should be a goner now. Maybe. No, he's still alive! He's still alive. Uh, crap. I don't actually think I can kill him this turn. Aw, that's a shame. Wait, I have my... I have my groove. But it won't work, sadly. Alright, I guess he lives one more turn. Yeah, I'm not going to attack the golem. It doesn't make any sense to do that. Hmm? What? There's a trebuchet there. I didn't realize that. What the fuck? Oh, I swear to God, if Caesar uses his groove to get a double turn and kill me now, I'm going to be very sad. No, he can't. What a stupid AI. You had your groove. I am pretty sure that if the AI was a little smarter, he could have used Caesar's groove. Again, how droll. I am pretty sure that if the AI knew what it was doing, it could have used Caesar's groove to kill me this turn. Don't you guys think he could have killed me this turn? Oh, what the fuck? Perfectly natural. No, that's it. I'll kill him. I'll kill him, I swear. Oh, I got two stars. Act two, mission four, a great fall. Ah! Oh, we're underground again. Er, just how far did I fall? Hmm. Hmm, I suppose that's one method for breaking the seal. What is this place? It's beautiful. I guess fall damage doesn't exist in this universe. Where's everyone else? Ah! Wait. Uh, what, Walt? My beautiful creations, you're unharmed. Move! Look out! Blast, we're trapped. I think I see a way out of here to the south. Oh, it's another escape mission. But how do we get there? Perhaps that switch will reveal a path forward. Or perhaps it will collapse the entire Let's tunnel. Go! Only one way to find out. So, do we fight? Let's see. Map objectives, press the button. Don't let pistols machines be defeated. Ensure that four enemies takes a plunge. Okay. I guess we have no choice but to press the button. But first, let's kill as many units as we can. Only that this time they're all the same color. No, they're not. Oh, we can get a crit here. It's a bit it's a bit like a puzzle, I like it. Oh yeah, definitely not doing that. Uh let's see, can we attack the golem? We can. But how do we deal the most amount of damage here? I fear no creature. This map is so first turn advantage. Well, it's made for the, it's made with the player in mind. There's nothing wrong with that. We have a pikeman right here. And then we can kill right here. I feel like we should not press the button at first. <laughs> We should focus on killing the enemies first.
I'm leaving the golem alive for now. Hmm? Oh, I didn't even realize there was a fucking... What? What's this? Huh? Frog? Crits when target is on a beach or river. Ability pull... What? Huh? What the fuck? Is that a new unit? Frog? Is that a new naval unit? Okay, they're all focusing my commanders, as always, but I have three of them. Already have my groove. It is very nice that they all focus my commanders, I will admit. Makes maps like this a lot easier. But it feels like the enemy is almost too stupid, you know? Okay, so I have a frog. Hmm. Okay, this golem obviously needs to die. So let's just attack it from afar for now. It's not in crit range yet, which is good. So I say we attack it with uh, our run. commander. We're gonna take some yeah. damage from it yeah. as it strikes back. Hold still. And now we can press the button. I feel like we should wait a turn, though, just in case. Oh, interesting. So, you can also do this to allied units. Okay, I like these units. Is it a naval unit, or is it, like, just a new ground unit? Pullbot. Or is it, like, a unique campaign unit? Experimental unit type. No, so it seems like this is like a unique campaign unit. If this is available in, in actual play, then it seems broken. Alright, we can pull the bow, we can uh, uh, activate the button now. Let's see what happens. West bridge active. Bridge disappears in four turns. Interesting. Interesting. In fact, I believe our time here is about to get even more interesting from here on out. Uh, okay. So, we have to get over the bridge in four turns. Shouldn't be hard. Can we activate the button again? No, we cannot. Feels like I'm playing FE4. It's a new unitype. Other factions have frogs too. Not sure if you need harbors for them. Uh oh. You. Uh oh. More red helms. Keep them from reaching the center aisle. Why? Why do we need to keep them from reaching the center aisle? Oh, okay, so we gotta get over there in three turns. Got it. Shouldn't be hard. Oh, I could have set up a crit. I'm stupid. Let's begin. But what I can do. No, wait, I cannot. I can pull the unit. Remember, you need to drop four enemies for the other objective. What? Oh, like, drop them. Careful, we have no reinforcements down here. Okay, so we gotta get over there. The bridge is a curious mechanism. Ah, Attention. I understand. Attention, everyone. A minor announcement. All those who do not wish to die should consider exiting the witch rest bridge soon. Behold! Why, it's going to disappear, of course. It's exactly two turns. Uh, 
Uh, okay. Here goes nothing. Boom. Madam. Did you mm -hmm. see that? Hmm. Oh yes, brilliant, brilliant. Stay in the middle, Manx. Why? Should I not go this way? You can't go beyond the bridge. Oh. Okay, in that case, I'll go back. Run. That's the map, but why is it yeah. there, though? You need to exit south. Oh, okay. That's okay. I have a, I have a plan. I'll just pull the unit towards me. There you go. Ah, it's a survive chapter. Ah, okay. So I need to get. Okay, I see. So wait, does that mean? Oh, does that does that mean she's dead? Oh, I guess that means she's dead. What's this? Oh, it means I just died, doesn't it? Yep, it means I just died. Okay, so I misunderstood. I thought we were supposed to flee there. Do your worst. Ah. I guess I'm dead then. Grrr. Where the heck are we? Look, the fox folk wound up here too. Uh, could you guys bring the bridge back, pretty please? I'm sorry. Please don't be mad. Lytra. Yeah, okay, so... Alright. Okay. Okay. Alright. I misunderstood. I thought we Soldier. were... I thought we were supposed to flee that bridge. Mm. Okay. Alright, okay. Fair mistake. Fair mistake. That doesn't count. That doesn't count. I just misclicked. Soldiers! I just misclicked. That doesn't count. Mm. That obviously does not count. I just pressed wait again because this UI is fucking stupid. Hold still! I will die on this hill. The UI should not have weight and attack right next to each other. It's stupid. Uh, let's see. Okay, so they, they do decent damage. The frogs, that is. Oh, we still have our hero here. Okay. Here goes nothing. Mangs, when advanced force has fire and weight, when advanced force has fire and weight next to each other, yeah, but there's a big difference because with advanced force you don't use your cursor to attack. It's a fundamentally different UI. So there's no chance of accidentally misclicking, but in Wargroove you do in fact use your cursor to attack. So it's it's not the same. Like it's just bad UI. There's no excuse for this. It's just bad UI. There you go. Alright, so How about this? Got it. We gotta we gotta press the button, we gotta defeat all these enemies. And then we gotta hold our island, basically. Got it. Alright, let's push it. And the secret objective is to make sure enemies fall into the chasm. Okay. Yeah, 
And here they come. Uh oh. You there. You there. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Wait, I can actually pull them towards me like so. That's kind of cute. So stupid! Let's begin. Someone make a counter for how many times I do that in one stream. Seriously starting to piss me off. Yes, it is me doing the wrong thing, but it is a stupid UI design. What? Just slow down a bit? No. I don't like slowing down. I like playing fast. Do 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 do. Alright, let's place our archer behind the golem. It's important that we do most a majority of the combat with our heroes. Did they just attack our archer? Fuck. I thought I protected him. So wait, where exactly will the, will this bridge die? I'm not sure, actually. Anyway, let's go heal. So let's make sure we put Hold our heroes still. in the front so they attack them. Madam, did you see that? Hmm? Oh yes, brilliant, brilliant. What's this? Oh, this is the frog. I like how this map is a three tile choke and you get three heroes. Maybe I should just put my heroes on the front line, yeah. You're right. There you go. Okay, so two units fell down the chasm, and now we gotta defend from this side. But yeah, that's actually a really good point. Oh shit, I forgot about the swordsman there. Yeah, if we just bring our heroes up here, they can literally just choke the point. That actually works much better. We'll just put the ar archer behind here. It'd be nice if one of my guys had a healing ability. Can't blame him for not listening when Piskill talk. I, I fucking hate this woman. I don't want to read her dialogue. All her dialogue is the same. Whoa, science! Oh, I love science! Pistol is the kind of person to actually subscribe to the I fucking love science page on Facebook. Let's you guys remember that? You guys remember that monstrosity? Here goes nothing! Well, they're dropping more doggerinos down here. That's not good. Streamer spitting facts. That's what I do. Yeah, they're actually dropping quite a lot of units down on us now. What's this? Replenishes 30 health to your entire army. Don't mind if I do. Okay, now that I actually understand this mission a little bit better, it's actually pretty fun. Now that I understand that it kind of plays like a defense chapter, it's actually kind of fun. Oh, hi there! Yeah, the heroes have separate team colors, you're right. That is kind of cool. Atheists when no one leaves presence under their science mystery. Oh, we got 
more company. Attention! Warning, warning. Those with an emotional attachment to remaining alive should exit the North Bridge. Such a fucking Redditor. Oh my god. Haha, <laughs> emotional attachment to staying alive. I'm so weird and quirky. Woo! Uh, should we? Ooh, maybe I can... Okay, I might be able to drop. Hmm. If I go here and use Song Cyclone... I don't know if there's a way for me to drop both of them. I don't think so. Uh, I'll use the Golem to kill this dog. I'm a science unit. The pikemen are prime drop folder, drop fodder. Yeah, they are. Okay, so I actually have all of my superpowers now. But I, I, I don't want to use them unless I actually see a good reason to. I have an emotional attachment to my eyes, so I won't read her dialogue. That's kind of funny. Alright, here we go. What trickery is this? Oh, it's Bullrush. Fairy intruders, you did this. You did this to Greenfinger's forests. Oh, we didn't actually bring all of them with them. Alright, we got a new bridge. Hey, I got a bonus objective. Nice. Oh, they got golems this time. Thank God for archers. The thing is, I feel like many of the grooves here are not super useful. I feel like I should be using them at this point, I just don't really have any need to. Like, I want to get value out of my groove. As soon as you notice the self bring spawn, you need to get there a sap. The enemy commanders are going to use the bridges to rush you. Okay, thank you for the heads up. More reinforcements dropping down. There you go. Oh, I don't want to lose that infantryman, so I'm going to send him back. All right, you guys go over here. Oh, what's this? Your army becomes invulnerable until your next turn? Oh, shit. Let's use it. Should have used it at the start of my turn. Holy shit. That's pretty good. Okay, so the bridge is gonna spawn next turn. So they're just not gonna attack me then. That's kind of funny. All right, now I say we move everyone down. Attention! Attention! All flesh heat havers, flesh havers. Oh my goodness! And prospective members of people who continue to exist. Committee. Please exit the east bridge at your earliest. Think. Oh, they're they're all gonna fall down now. We should prepare to make our ways to the south hall. Ha ha! Flesh havers. Get it? I'm quirky. All right, let's get down here. Mm -hmm -hmm. Oh shit, I forgot about these guys. I guess I can leave some of them behind. It's not like I need to bring all the generics with me. What the? You're too late. This bridge is coming down in three, two, one. Uh oh. What? Son of a star system. Florin, attack! Okay, we need to run. Ah, oh, there she is. Teleport beam. There she is. 
But now we just rush south, right? And we'll be fine. Get Romlithra and Pastil to the south hall. Easy enough. We just run. And the generics can stay behind and guard. Mang's frog. That's ah, okay, he can stay behind to guard the bridge. I only need to get my commanders there. We're gonna get ya! And once we do, we're gonna beg you to get out of here. I don't like this place. Save the froggin? It says to get my commanders there. I'm assuming the 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 the, the other units don't matter. So the other units don't matter. I'll form a bit of, like, a defensive wall here. Oops, that was not intentional. Check the objective. I already did. That's a lot of golems. Muru, Nuru, these furry creatures. Unforgivable, let us hunt them together. I don't know what these guys are doing. But yeah, it's get Rom, Lithra, and Pistil to the South Hall. So, shouldn't be a problem. Hey! I'm here, everyone. Hurry. I don't have time. For I won't this. wait her all day. Hurry up. There you go. Fuck the generics. Ha, ah, serves you all right. That guy's just sedged on a horse. He really is. This was... This was a city. The deceased are mostly unarmed, nearly all dressed in cacophony attire. The few dead who saw Silmor who wore Silmor collars also wore royal crests. A planned attack from Silmor's army, then. A planned attack. A senseless slaughter. Those soldiers invaded the forest, cutting down all in their path. They destroyed these people's homes, desecrated their temples. Then they stood where we now stand, swords raised triumph. Why? Why? If this was an army's doing, they were only following their commander. Nothing you can do about that. Orders, orders. I have an announcement. Our mission ends here. I have seen enough. What? What? You'd have us leave right as we discovered something interesting? Our allies certainly won't appreciate that. We have gathered a wealth of knowledge. Perhaps. Perhaps it is less than our allies dreamed, but more than expected. Yet, if our allies disagree, I shall accept full responsibility. This is my decision, after all. But... What about our brave soldiers? You intend to make them go home having failed? Going home alive sounds nice. Litra, aren't you disappointed? Didn't we want to learn more about the, your cacophony thing? It's okay. I made so many friends here, like you, madame. So I'm not going home empty-handed. Um, it's nice that you were thinking of me, though. It is decided. We shall leave as soon as possible. How many of our troops remain? Two score at most. Vastly outnumbered, then. We should rest here for the evening. Madam Samt Alraz, let us meet later to discuss the next strategy. We shall trouble this place no more. Come on, Tago, Lithra. Let's try to find a good camping spot. Hmm. She's gonna go against him. I've come too far. I knew it. She's gonna betray us. She's gonna betray us, you guys. All right, it's time for another Andron Saga style guidance chapter, I think. Oh, no. Act two, uh, oh, act three, mission one, Cacophony Palace. Lithra and friends hang out on their last day in the gloom woods. Uh. Rise and shine. Not a moment to waste. Listen. I found something huge. I believe it may be the Cacophony Royal Palace. But, madam, aren't we departing soon? <laughs> you know, it's the funniest thing. I was talking to Rom this morning, and they've had a change of heart. True. Oh, she's lying again. She's lying again. Of course. Truly. They said we can explore for one more day. Where is General N Nadir, by chance? Uh... Uh, they are sorting through paperwork. Boring stuff, really. We shouldn't disturb them. Anyhow, I will not be accepting any additional questions. Let's go. 
Yeah, because this this woman totally wasn't lying earlier. Hmm, another blasted magic Lytra, door. Dear. It seems I'll need your help to proceed. Explore the area. Seek pistol, then when finished. Yep, it's another Andron Saga Gaiden chapter, you guys. Huh? Something on your mind, Tarsus? I am concerned. After we escape this place, we'll still have the forest to contend with. Now more than ever, we must stick together. Our lives are at stake. But General M Nadir said it's fine. That's what I'm trying to say, Filtrum. I do not hey! think... Hey, guys, everything okay? Lithra, everything's fine. Targo's just a scaredy cat. I was sharing some concerns with Phil, but I suppose they cannot be helped. Just be careful, okay? Be careful, Lithra. You shouldn't worry so much. Madame Pistil... Ma Madame Pistil's with us. She is present, yes. You can talk to them multiple times? Why would I do that? Ugh, she's so intimidating. Hey, yes. Hello, hi. Check out this weird river. It's weird, right? It's coming from inside the castle. That's a safety hazard. Someone could slip and then drown, and then the current would carry them off where no one could ever find them. Fish would feast on their body until the end of time. Ah. Must be fantastic for pool parties, though. Oh, you can talk to them multiple times. Hey, uh, about, about all this mean stuff I said back on the island. It was unwise. I got cranky without coffee. Yeah! Apology accepted. I wasn't apologizing. I was explaining. Oh. oh, thank you? Anytime. Wow, you really can talk to them multiple times. Hey, uh, okay, so... Yeah! Oh. Then it's the same dialogue. About ready there? Actually? Excellent, let us proceed. Oh shit, was there a chest? Treasure chest? Incredible! This is it. The answers I've been seeking, they're all just ahead. <laughs> might as well get comfy, guys. If it's anything like that other seal, it might take a while. Welcome. Welcome home. Prince. Harmon. Hear that, madame? <laughs> I'm royalty now. Fantastic. Brilliant girl. When would I what would I ever do without you? Um, friends? Oh no, it's more enemies. Who could have who could have foreseen this one? Sorry, I just had to adjust my sitting position. Then again, always a complication. Why so sad? The furry creatures will not be fighting today. They will be surrendering. Unless the creatures want Florence to eat their green finger. You intend to eat our fingers? What? No, green finger. The furry creatures. Green finger. Huh? <laughs> Bullrush found them yesterday. Sleeping on the job. Adam? Pistol, weren't you with Rom last uh... night? Oh no. Those those fiends. The floor must have taken Rom right after our meeting. If only I'd be there to stop she's such a liar. Are they going to forgive her for this? She's a, she's a liar and a terrible person. Why? Why? The little furry green finger is still sleepy. Ha 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 ha. What do you say? Surrender? <sighs> Enough pagan tree. I am not giving up now. Foolish prey. Oh, damn. How can units just teleport in like that? I don't get it. Bullrush will savor this final hunt. I don't get what the fuck is going on. Did he, like, teleport them in or something? I'm glad these guys who never met the guy knows the pronouns. You always respect the pronouns, Abundi. Even, even, even you don't know them. Lytra! Lytra, this way. What? Everyone needs our help. <sighs> if we're quick, we can go inside, take what we can, and leave. It's our best option. Or would you wait and see how many of your friends survive the onslaught? Commanders can teleport units. Apparently that's just the power they have now, so that's interesting. Oh, okay. That was apparently a whole mission? Uh, okay. Act 3, Mission 2, Queen's Workshop. I don't want to hurt you, nor I you. So, an entire, like, a cutscene is an act now? Okay. 
or like a mission? Cacophony Royal Palace. Interesting. Fascinating. Madam? Madam? Hmm. The secrets we seek must be somewhere in the palace. Pistol! Madam, to think the key to the crystal research have been here all along. Pistol! What? What? What, what, what? Before, you said you talked to Rom this morning. <sighs> yes, yes, it's very sad they're captured. That's why we should stop wasting time and hurry. What? But just now, that Florin said they captured Rom last night. Yeah, she's a liar, you fucking moron. They must be confused. They're plants, after all. Come, we'll have time for silly questions later. Hmm. Queen's Workshop. A workshop for crystals, perhaps? Madame, there's someone here. Oh, it's Queen Fingers. The healing water's all but dry. <sighs> it's only another Florin. Who is there? We've cut down many of your kind to get this far. I'd run if I were you. I am the protector of this forests and the secrets they keep. Please. Madam, let's just go. What? What? Ridiculous. We're so close. Lytra. Lytra, take, take care, care of this. No! It's not worth getting into another Lytra. fight. Not but... worth it? Everyone needs our help. All right, I understand. You do? Yes. Yes, I've been a fool. I expected more from I you. thought you were bright, trustworthy, special. But it seems I was wrong. You're right. Let's just leave. Lytra. Everyone home will be delighted to know Lytra Falaki ruined our ally's mission. I don't want to hurt you. Mr. Florin, please give up. I don't want to hurt you. Nor I you, but if the forest requires it. With the last of my strength, I protect my charge. Oh no, he used his power. Ah! Stars above, Lutra. They're vines. Just cut through them. Alright. Defeat the enemy commander. Lythra and pistol must Here not fall. Nothing. Yeah, I remember these vines. Yeah. Oh, really? You don't one-shot them? That's unfortunate. I don't have time for this. <laughs> Well, that's annoying. Madams, there you are. We must not. We must leave the Florin army. Greenfinger? Florin, children of the forests, I cannot ask you to die for me here. You know not even why I fight. No. Florin, stronger together. This story is a mess. I got. I gotta be completely honest. Like. This story is so weird, I don't know what to think about it. It's just all over the place. Steady, comrades, and stick together. We've no reinforcements here. The story is just so weird. Like, units just pop up out of everywhere. There's no rhyme or reason to why you... Like, it's just... Uni I feel like units just teleport in. There's absolutely... I have no prospect of where everything is it's just it, it just throws random units in i mean i know you're not supposed to take it very seriously but still lithra madame piskill what yeah. are our orders obliterate that old fool also why are we listening to this bitch why are we listening to this bitch she's a liar she's evil why are we listening to her she's a terrible person Okay, so this seems like a pre-deployed mission. How about this? <laughs> Alright, let's kill the vines. They only last for seven seconds, should be easy. Haha. -ha. Get it? I don't have time for this. What's in the chests? I don't know. Oh, there's a chest right here, right. Let's find out. Uh, okay, it's, it's the push glove. It's the pushy glove. Rats versus plants, yeah. All 
Alright, they're gonna focus my commander again. Hopefully they don't kill her. Shove my beloved. It's a fun skill. Do I have any way of healing my units at all? I don't know. Okay, so we're back to this, like, weird nighttime effect, where, um, yeah, we're back to this, like, weird nighttime effect, where it's not Fog of War, it just kind of looks like it's Fog of War, which is kind of weird. Do, 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 do. Should be Fog of War, but it isn't. It's fine, though. Oh, they're sealing potions up ahead. Okay, good to know. That is good to know. And your commanders do heal a little bit every turn, which is nice. Quickly. Continue at your peril. Oh, that's a lot of vines. My goodness. The poison. My strength. Tread carefully, the vines block our path, but not the enemies. Yeah. That's how they work. However, they don't do any damage when you attack them, so... They're not particularly scary. Tarsus, where is everyone else? Evacuating. Florin reinforcements nearly overpowered us. I'd hope to stay start our egress onward. as well. Upward and onward. Scientific pro progress waits for... Shut the fuck. This is this character is so unlikable. I hope I hope she's a villain. She better be a villain. Okay, this is a little scary. Um I feel like if I don't back off. Okay, that didn't do shit. He's slowly dying. Can't you just hold on? Oh, is he? Is he taking... I thought he was healing. You might be right. Um, I guess I just need to wait for them to come towards me. Summoning those vines cost him 2 HP. Oh, okay. Is the other potion like a damage one or something? Maybe. Ah, shit. Okay, they are charging at me, so let's see. No, it's, it's a healing potion. Alright, let's just kill this archer. There we go. We can kill this knight as well. How about this? We do have our... Wait, what? Okay, I did kill it. Good to know. Wait, what? Did I not... Oh, was the, was the guy on full health? That confused the shit out of me. Beetles fucking suck against knights, man. What the hell? Yeah, I guess I... Wait, I can, can I use chain reaction on them? That'd be kind of funny, actually. Om nom 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 nom. Oh, wow, they hit kind of hard. What the hell? No. I mustn't fail. Impossible. Just a bit further. That hurts a little bit, but it's not the end of the world. Oh no, my knight! Bum, 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 bum. And now that guy's dead. 46% damage against the knights. Let's see. The objective? 
Good question. Defeat the enemy commander. Lithra and Pistil must not fall. Bonus objective. Defeat the enemy commander in 10 or fewer turns. Don't lose more than 4 units. So, yeah, I guess we just continue on. I guess we just continue onwards. Remember that one time where Ponsigdov's commander got killed by doggos? Uh, I don't, but, uh... Sounds like something that probably happened. Not much further now. Cease. You know, those mines... Okay, so he does lose 2 HP every time he does it. Pain, I must hold fast. Okay, so he's literally just trying to slow me down, but it doesn't really matter, though. Like, all he's doing is giving me Groove Charge. Like, the plants don't really do anything back, so... They're kind of useless. Oh shit, they got two Treants? Aw, oh, crap. Oof. Uh, that is not nice. I'm not a big fan of that. Here goes nothing! Let's get our archers lined up. Let's see. I would very much like to get those potions and heal myself up. We'll see if I can do that. What does the green potion do? I guess we'll find out. I hope 2 will have many online players. Well, it will at first. Uh, your commander groove charges to the next tier, so... Uh, that'll, that'll mean I'll get tier 2 grooves. But I only... Okay, yeah, okay, cool, I can do that. Uh, but there's a fucking treant in the way, though. That is a problem. I guess I'll still use the potion, though. But, uh, I want to back off. I don't want this tree. Ah, oh, goodness, their range is so insane. What the hell? Here I come. Maybe I need to, uh... Maybe I need to bypass the trees? I don't know if there's any way I can kill two of them. I mean, I have my chain reaction power, but I don't know if it's any good against just a single target. I could try it, though. I don't have time for this. This seems difficult. I guess I'll go and consume that one. There we go. Heal up my guys. Alright, here comes the golem. You can eat them next to the water. Oh my goodness, you're right. I can. You're absolutely right. But do I still have the gauntlet? I think I may have lost it. That being said, I still have my groove. Okay, so I think if I go... Let's see. No. Yeah, summon more mines. Hey, Mangs, what platform are you playing on? I think PC gaming is the only one. Uh... Is there any way I can, I can yeet this guy into the ground? I don't think so. Do you guys know if there's any way to yeet this guy into the ground? I guess I'll just kill him. Here I come. Well, one of my archers is gonna die now. What? They dropped down reinforcements? Are you shitting me? 
Ah, oh, calm the fuck. What? My pride and joy. <laughs> Time for some de-weeding. Are you serious? Alright, I'm a train reaction to these guys. This will only hurt the entire mm. time. Aha! Right, they don't even kill, do they? Oof. Oh wait, wait, they're my reinforcements. Oh, pfft. They're my reinforcements. I thought it was enemy reinforcements. I was like, what the fuck? I don't know why I thought... I don't know why I thought they were, were enemy reinforcements. That being said, why are they... I don't know! This game just drops units in right, like, when it feels like it. Okay, because if those were enemy reinforcements, it would have been a bit nasty. Alright, I guess we can just charge him. I mean, the dude's got 2 HP. What is he gonna do? I must stop them. Now, with the last of my Nature's strength. Cry. Dude, buddy, you're dead. <laughs> stop it. <laughs> How pitiful. Open the gate and we'll spare you. A screen finger I am sworn to prevent all from entering. Even myself. What? You've never been inside? How utterly ridiculous. Lytra. Lytra, put this idiot out of his... plant out of his misery. Why are we listening to this woman? She's evil! Stop listening to the mad scientists! She's clearly evil. Aw, oh, sad music. Here goes nothing! Oh, I have my train reaction back up. Uh, I wanna be a bit cautious though. I could act oh, I could train reaction actually. Maybe I should have chain reaction. She better be a villain. If 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 they don't make her a villain, this is gonna feel weir really weird to me. Because she is so clearly evil. Uh. Coming at you live. Sorry. You, you are but a child. Children should not play at war. Even if you escape without a scratch, your wounds will never fade. Yeah, we're pretty dumb. Let's begin. We're pretty stupid. He just, yeah, he's. Heroes always heal a little bit. So, uh, he will heal a little bit. Alright, let's go, let's go murder the tree guy. Huh? Oh. Uh, why can't I kill the tree guy? Hey, get out of my way so I can kill tree guy. Idiots! The geezer thought he could stop us. Look, he's wilting. All right, let's kill him. How about an encore? <laughs> Yay, we killed him. We killed the innocent old man. Well, that wasn't so hard. Come along, science waits for no one. Did she just fall down? No! This isn't right, this isn't fair. This was our job, Litra, though I take no pleasure in it. It still writes, I feel ill, Litra. Ah! Madame! Let's go. We are the- yeah, we're the bad guys. We are absolutely the bad guy. I love how Nuru just teleports around in cutscenes. Mm. Queen finger? Nuru. 
<sighs> I'm afraid I'll not be seeing you off on your journey home. I have a journey of my own now. I hope you can forgive me. But you said this place would heal you. In my youth, these waters were awash with healing song. The song, I cannot hear it now. Perhaps I'm not meant to cheat death a second time. <laughs> Greenfinger, I can save you. There's something you should know about me. The place I'm from, we got way better medicine there. It's far, but I can take you. I, I got a shipment. <laughs> Dear child, there is no cure for death. No matter which planet you call home. <laughs> what? You knew? I've kept much from you, Nuru. I regret I it's I've not the time to change that. Nuru, goodbye. <laughs> Rip, rip, bozo. Yeah, we're the bad guys. Queen's Workshop. Uh. No, no, no. Madame. Pistol! Pistol, are you hurt? This can't be. The workshop, it's empty. Pistol! Pistol, we should go. What? But where? Who could have... Madame, please. No! I failed. No, I, I can't. What do we do? What should we do? Leave, of course. At any moment, the Florin will regroup. Please, we've no desire to fight. <laughs> Little late for that. I've been holding back all this time just to protect this backwater planet. Enough, I'm done. Oh no, she's gonna release her true power. Lithra, look out. This one again? I thought we killed you hours ago. And you have lasers too now? Wonderful. Two? I don't have time for I this. I don't have time for this. Lithra, stop wasting time with this bozo. We're leaving. Get back here. I hope I hope she turns out to be Sigurd in disguise. That would have been a cool plot twist. Tago, look! Lithra, you're safe! See, I told you. I'm so glad. Wait, Wait where's Phil? Wait, you didn't see? Uh, I'm, uh... I saw it. Save yourselves. I heard him shout that before, before he... He bought us enough time to chase after you and Madame Pistol. <gasps> Phil, so his... What? Wait, who? Who? Literally who? Am I supposed to care about a generic, like, NPC? I don't fucking... Phil? I, I don't give a shit about Phil! Stop! Stop trying to make me care about Phil! <laughs> Go fuck yourself, Phil! I don't know who you are! Stop playing sad music! I don't give a shit! Whoa, no! Not Phil! Don't take away Phil! The character I cared so much about! <laughs> oh no, Phil! Wait, he's alive anyway? I'm glad I met- <coughs> <coughs> He was very brave. Who? He was stupid. Piltrum, why? What are you doing standing there? <laughs> what can we do, Phil? Phil Demon War Group Saga? What can we do? The floor and have cut off the path to our ships. Our allies. We'll have to make contact with our allies. My research may be ruined, but I'll not die in the stupid forest. Why are we following this woman? She's a liar! She lied twice! What? We're not going back for rum? <coughs> <coughs> oh my god, I'm dying. The story is killing me. Lithra, do you hear yourself? There's no one left. We will die. We have our orders. Eastwards. Are you okay? No, I'm dying from cringe. Tago, chin up, please. This is the worst day. All that time wasted. Tago. Okay, can we... Can I play as characters I care about now, please? I, I gotta be completely honest, okay? I'm, I'm getting into some... I don't give a shit about these rats. 
I don't give one iota fuck about these stupid rats. I just don't. Okay? I want to see Sigri. I want to see Mercia. I want to see the characters that I actually cared about. We, this, we're three acts in. I don't give a shit about these rats. I could not care less about these rats. I couldn't... I don't give a fuck. The, the main rat is stupid. The, the rat... Is that it? What? Is that the game? What? <laughs> Was that it? Oh, it's the end of the rat campaign. Okay. Oh, you can skip it with escape. Okay. Yeah, that was... That was... Okay. So... Oh, okay. So that's... Right. Okay, so that's breaking ground. That was the rat campaign. Got it. So we got dark skies and rising tides. Okay. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. That was... That was... An incredibly shitty campaign. Um, I really could not care less about the story. The maps were fun. The gameplay is great. The gameplay is great. Like, I, like every map was fun to play. But the story is just these rats. I don't give a shit about them, and it tried making me care about them when there was just no reason to. And the 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 Madame Pistine or what? She was so unlikable, and she kept lying. Why did we not mute any? So, so a, a really poor start, I'd say, for Wargrove 2. This campaign did not do a good job of making me care about the characters. Gameplay was fun, though. Let's let's go and um, let's look at some memes. Uh, let's see. Uh, CMU, CMU. Uh, CMU, 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 CMU. There are no memes. People didn't submit memes. There's just CMU mails. Okay. It's a game with a light tone. It's not that deep. That's fine, but you can still have good dialogue in a game that doesn't take itself very seriously. Yeah, you guys didn't make any memes. Alright, so, um, I guess we'll play the Undead campaign now? Dark Skies or Rising Tide? I don't know, what do you guys want to play? The Pirate campaign or the Undead campaign? Dark Skies, one cold summer night, a kid's slumber party is interrupted by the Howl of Undead. Alright, let's go. Ah, finally, we get some characters I care about. Cherry Stone Castle, Courtyard. Queen Mercia, the tiny prince from Heavensong, requests an audience. He says it's, uh, super duper important. My queen. My queen, this may be about the matter we discussed earlier. Huh? Already? Yeah. Send him in. Ah, hi, hey. Koji. Hey, Mercia. Oh. Prince Koji. Uh. Is that how you address a queen? Where are your manners? Mm. Bruh, he's, he's royalty too, you fucking moron. <laughs> Lovely to see you again, Koji. Koji's here? Errol, Orla. Prince Koji, your duties. Right, sorry. On behalf of Her Majesty, Empress Tenry of the Heavensong Empire, we humbly request the heir and counsel of Prince Queen Mercia for... Uh, what was it again? A diplomatic summit. <laughs> yeah, what he said. Huh? A meeting with the Empress. Uh, the next Aronia Aru Arunia The next Au The next Aurania Aur Aurani Aurani How the fuck do you pronounce this? Oranian Alliance Summit isn't for months. Is something wrong? I'm not privy to the details, only that it's to be a private affair. My queen. A word? Huh. Koji? Ah! What are you guys doing here? Got you got some, some nerve, nerve asking us questions. 
Harold thought you died after he stopped answering letters. I'm real sorry. Sorry, I've been busy. But I really missed you guys. Let's go. Oranian. It's pronounced Oranian. Okay. It's settled. We'll set out for Heaven Song immediately. Hmm. Will you two be alright waiting for our father by yourselves? Hmm. Oh, I don't know. Harold gets so frightful at night, you Whoa. see. Do not. What? Do not. Errol. Work with me here. Hmm. Oh. Uh. I am very scared of castles at night. Hmm. But maybe Koji and his guards stayed with us. <laughs> a slumber party? What a wonderful idea. Oh. Now hold hmm. on. Come on, it's not like we have to be at Mor Morn's meeting. Besides, as prince, isn't my duty to protect my our allies? Oh, please help! Harold desperately needs a strong prince for protection. <gasps> What's this? A youth in need? Pray, let me be your blade. My life to protect thine. Oh, knock it off! All right, all right, that's enough. One night, Prince Koji. After that, we're heading home. This voice acting, yeah. It's gonna be the best sleepover in history. A few, just one more nights later. All right, what should we do next? Hey. You still owe us a go with Tinko. <laughs> Deal, let me just adjust the seat height and uh, Prince Koji, stand back. You are in the presence of the Royal Heaven's Own Guard. State your business or leave. Oh. Ah, oh, it's just a wee from we weeun from Fellheim. Are you lost? Those things aren't we, they're dangerous. Chatter, chatter, chatter. It doesn't seem okay. Yeah. Harold, don't you speak bone bone babble a bit? Go on. Go on, say, say something. something. Uh. Uh, chatter chatter? Arrow, look out! It's Ahmed. <coughs> Errol, are you alright? I... I think so. I'll teach him to mess with us! Mess with Errol and you mess with me. Why are they attacking us? We have a treaty. This is just what Felheim Felheim does. The Empire hasn't forgotten their ways, nor how to deal with their kind. Alright. Most land-based units are incapable of attacking air units. Archers are one exception. Archers aren't the best at countering air units, but they'll walk in a pinch. Looks like we'll need to use archers to take out the enemy aeronauts. Yes, sir. Can do. Not hard. Nice crit, soldier. Thank you, sir. Oh, what's this? Heavy limb locket. Accessible to those on foot or horseback, but no one else. Unit deals 1.5 damage, but can no longer counterattack. Okay. I'll take that. I'll take that, too. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Prince Koji, this is not your fight. Retreat to the castle now. And let my friends get hurt? No way. He will not let his friends get hurt. Oh, right. We have these guys, too. Check commanders? Sure. So archers are almost pure artillery now. Yeah, pretty much. Except that they can move and fire. They couldn't do that before. Shebas for the dogs? Yeah, they have Shebas. Alright, yeah, we should check the objectives too. I agree. Alright, so let's see. Destroy them all. I better not see as much as a stray rib bone by sunrise. Defeat all Felham units. Bonus objectives. Visit an old friend. Don't lose any archers. Okay. And let's check out... Uh, 
These kids, I never played them much in the DLC, but I know that they can... I know they have two different grooves, don't they? Yeah, they have like they have like a dual groove where they can choose either cooling water or scorching fire. And uh charge two. Oh, it's like a combination of the two. That's actually really cool. Heals allies and burn enemies 20 health per turn. That's really cool actually. And what about Koji? What has he gotten? Let's see. Sparrow bombs spawns two sparrow bombs that damage enemies or detonated or, or destroyed. Charge one, very slow, deals 50%. Charge two. Ah, the bombs actually get more health. And the bonus. Oh, they are, oh, explosion pushes back enemies one tile. That's cool. Hmm, that's actually really cool. I like that. Visit an old friend. I don't know what they're talking about. Go here, maybe? Almost pressed wait again. This'll be loud. Was that the same as the first war groove? I don't think it um Take that! Take that, you're bugging ba 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 Let's reinforce. Can we get more archers? No, we cannot. So this is kind of like a defense mission. Oh, we gotta be careful. I just got critted. Ugh, this is the worst! Uh, Stop hey. breathing. Alright, let's heal up. They're gonna go for they're gonna go for my heroes because they love targeting the heroes. But uh, luckily the archers can move and fire. They don't crit when they move, but they can still do it. All right, let's not lose units needlessly. But we can get another hawk bow. Okay, so I can't get true here. I cannot get true here, but I can capture this. Mm -mm -mm. The soldier's passive also applies to children or not, because it is not their faction. What? What are you talking about? Hmm? Are the Cherrystone guards not about? Could they help us? Maybe the Skellis already gobbled them up? Relax, guys. I'm sure they're on their way. Cherry Stone Army, it's time. Ready when you are, sir. Now for the most difficult night of our lives. Hmm? Get in the tub, Caesar. Come on. It's been nearly a year. You have to take a bath. The neighbors are complaining. Someone hold him down. Ah! Ha ha ha. They're bathing their dog. Okay, there we go. Uh oh. There's so Arrow? many of them. <laughs> Keep your head on arrow. Our skeleton or or skeletons are ripping them off themselves. Bye bye, Batlass. Bye bye, Batlassies. Engaging the idol stance. Oh, we got groups now. That's good. Please stop. We're supposed to be allies now. How could Valder do this? The evil guy who betrays everyone betrays us. Ooh, let's get a tiger lance out. Do -do -do -do. All right, these guys haven't moved yet, so I could use my groove if I want to, but I I want to check this super groove. Let's see if it's worth anything. Why would you ally with the Skeletal Nation? I don't know. Alright, 
Ah, oh, shit. They're coming. Let's go, Tenko. So I didn't get any luck damage this time around, which is a little bit sad. So this is not fog of war, so I can't just hide in the woods. It just looks like it's fog of war. But I gotta be careful. These dogs will tear me a new one. There we go. Oh right, I haven't moved with uh Ooh, I almost pressed wait again. I almost pressed wait again. It almost happened. No. I hate Ragna. She's so annoying. Yeah, Ragna was very annoying in the first game. She was very samey. It's like, ah, I will destroy you. Ha 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 ha. Wah, I will destroy you. Ah. Very samey. Voldor, at least, is a bit of a cooler character. Snow of War. Yeah, I guess so. This is a cool defense chapter, though, I will say. I like it, so far. You know what I really would have liked? I would have liked if Groove Charge was available in the top. Like, if you show Groove Charge, you know how you see the power meters in Advanced Wars? Alright, let's, uh, let's check this out, shall we? Orla. Ready. So this is the new Super Groove? <coughs> it heals for two and damages for two, which I really like. That is actually pretty cool. I'm pretty strong too, actually. go. Rip Boso. And as long as we stay in this area, we'll continue to heal as well, which is kind of cool. Okay, I think we should go and kill this guy. There you go. Sir, only five, en only five enemies left. Alright, Lord Walder, where are you? Fight us yourself, Walder. why don't you? Lord Walder's not here, you numpty. He's gotta be. He controls the undead with that gauntlet, don't he? Walder wouldn't do something like this. He helped us save the world. Oh, maybe it's Sigri? I could do this all night. Then I go got him, or we'll have to. I like it. It's like a mini hawk power. Yeah, it's cool. It's very strong. And then it heals everyone. That's eh, very strong. <laughs> Loving this music. It's amazing. Did Felheim get any new commanders? I don't know. I don't actually know. I think so? I mean, I think every- did- or did we just- did everyone just retain the same commanders? Uh, let's capture this property right here real quick. So we have to route these guys. Oh, looks like we got surprised. Do, 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 do. It's very hard to see where I can move here with this blue flame hanging about. Didn't Sigrid die last game? Oh, I guess she did. But she's a vampire. She can always come back. 
You can check in Codex if there's new commanders. Well, I don't have all the Codexes available from the start, do I? Oh yeah, here we go. Lithra, Pistil... Pistil, Romb, Salon, Neuro, Caesar, Koji, Errol and, and Orla, Valder, Vesper, Ragna, Wolfar, Nadia, Ryota, Tenre. I won't even get to see her, really. Merciful, Mercia, Emmerich, LOD, Dark Mercia, Sigidi. Okay, so Sigidi is here. A once trusted Felheim commander. Oh, it says she's deceased. But, I mean, she's a vampire. She can always come back, right? You guys remember how mad everyone got when I called Sigri a cat girl? When she, in fact, was a bat girl. Alright, barrack neutralized. No more skeletons coming from here, that's for sure. As long as we capture it before they come back. How long does this groove last? It seems really strong. There we go, and now you- Oh! I think I killed them. Is that all of them? I think so. Bonehead. Jigs up, you bonehead! So who's doing all this? Who's doing all this? He dropped a letter. Mm. Oh. It's from Lord Valder. <laughs> Attention, official statement from the Felheim Legion. I, Valder Ragnar. Hey, hey, hey! Don't be going copying my names now. Oh, what? He's Bjarki's brother. He's Bjarki's brother from Felheim. Oh no. Plot twists. First, they copy my guidance chapters. Now they copy my names. Bjarki, bro? Wielder of the Fell Gauntlet. Grand Necromancer, Fell Lord, and rightful ruler of the Felheim Wastes. As well as ruler of the various surrounding incorporated and unincor unincorporated lands. Ah! Ouch, get on with it. Yes, yes, enough with the titles. I address this message with utmost haste to Queen Mercy of Cherrystone. In accordance with the Pon Oroyan Treaty of 3042. Okay. Just go on like that for ages. Uh, Is there anything on the back? Uh, Ouch, here we are. Oh. Help. Well, that's no good, is it? So he attacked her with skeletons to say help? Hey, what's going on out there? What? Help? Uh. What? We missed what? Sorry, kids. We were all tied up with a mission of great importance. <coughs> we failed. Of course. <coughs> My goodness, I'm dying. But we'll try again in a few months. What to do about Lord Valder's message, though? This looks like a job for the rescue squad. The cringe battalion. <laughs> it's a job for Queen Mercia, not the rescue squad. Whatever Walder wants, I'll have to wait until we reach Heaven Song. Get off your head! That'll take weeks. Um... Or days. Transit times are a bit unclear. <laughs> okay, that's funny. That's a good line. Doesn't matter how long it takes. We're heading home first thing tomorrow. That's final. Yeah. No, Walder invoked the treaty. If we did nothing, he attacked us! <coughs> How could anyone trust Heavensong ever again? And with that kind of prince, would I be if I just ran away? The prince has a point, no? <coughs> Alright, fine. We'll fly to Hafelheim Fortress, see what Walder wants. <coughs> and then we're leaving, alright? Alright! All right. Come on! Come on, Caesar, let's get ready. Huh? You're not coming? Ah, oh, you're right, Caesar. Someone's gotta warn the Florin about this mess. Oh, he needs to run off and do side quests again. 
Come on, let's go pack. <coughs> Ooh. I'm getting worse. Are you really gonna help Falheim? After everything they've done? Some lands just aren't worth saving. The prince gotta learn sometime. Better he learns with us here to protect him. Ooh. Whew. I don't know how long I'll be able to go on. I was gonna do a very long stream, but I, I think that might not be possible. I'll play until I can't play anymore. Act 1, Mission 2, Falheim and Fallow. On their way to Falheim Fortress, the rescue squad stops to help a village in need. Drink water? Um, that might help. Somewhere over Falheim. We should reach Falheim Fortress by nightfall. What? What was that? Look down there. Stop, please, just tell us what's wrong. Hehehe, <laughs> Old Dvar? Really? Old Dvar? That's the name of the guy? Old Dvar? Mischief, mischief. Oh no, it's Old Dvar? You can't be threatening if your name is Odvar. And that just does it doesn't work like that. Help, please, our friends. They've been attacked by the undead. You misunderstand, the dead are our friends. We live together, dance together, help each other with taxes. But something's changed. What is happening? What's happening? Fell I miss in fallow after twenty years of peace. Last time we all saw it coming. But this time, why now? I know this is a lot to ask a bunch of strangers, but please, if there's anything you can help the living to escape to safety. <laughs> Don't rest, play till you feel better. Thanks, chat. Of course, say no more. Hold on. You're the Prince of Heaven Song, aren't you? We couldn't ask all of your people to. Of course, he's too young to remember that. Don't worry about it. We're here to help. Okay, everyone, let's get to work. Hang on, who's that over there? It's Old Dvar! Please, no! Why so glum, dear child, fortunate child? I am offering you a place in my family! Humph, fine then. You over there! Welcome the lost child home! I am the mighty Old Dvar! Never mind, I'll do it myself. No need to lift the finger, my darling. Oh no! Old Dvar, what are you doing? My family grows! But they still won't obey me once I claim the Feyfell Gauntlet? That man is hurting villagers, we have to Take stop that. him! A swift kick to the Bahuki will sort him out. Should we not be careful? He might have some nasty tricks. Mm. Murdering children, is this Fire Emblem? Errol's got a point. Let's use the info screen to check that guy out before we go. Defeat Old Dvar! Old Dvar, you've gone too far. Verge of Death. Unit gains the ability, the 1.25 defense boost. Ability at Explode an Ally, dealing 30 damage to adjacent. Oh, Explode an Ally, my goodness. That's kind of dark. Oh, we can talk to villagers, let's go. Did your empress send you? Can't believe she'd help us after after what our old king did. It ain't much, but here, take this as thanks. You received 400 gold. Cool. Ah, oh, and feel free to use my old lumber mills. Let's check the objectives. No, we know what lumber mills do. Defeat Oldvar. Uh, defeat Oldvar using a pair of seasoned hunters. Capture all lumber mills. Seasoned hunters? What does that mean? What is a seasoned hunter? Oh, we got a Tengu. Teng yeah, Taurus allows you to be- I know. Oh, children of death, come gather to me. No, no, come, the opposite of leaving. Listen, guys, to me, come to me. You must obey the great Odvar. Oh, well, I suppose all children are unruly at times. And why shouldn't they be? It is a glorious day. 
is a glorious fellow. Man, that old wad. He sure is a character. So these villagers give you stuff when you talk to them. You've come to help us? Great timing. I got something you can use. We used to get vampire attacks all the way time before Lord Volder made peace with them. What'll become of this place now? Thanks for the help, strangers. Good luck. Oh, it's a ballista. So yeah, these ballistas are very strong against air units, but they can't move and fire though. So you gotta be very, you gotta be a little careful with them. Uh, let's cut down some wood! So we can only build Tengus at the moment. Did they buff the Ballista? Good question. Did they buff the Ballista? No! Ah, oh, shit. It's okay, I have a flyer of my own. Hulse, there you are. Everyone's evacuating. Hulse, why, why are you looking at me like that? Oh, no! He got turned into a skeleton. Yeah, did they buff ballistas? They seem the same to me. Oh shit, did I put Oh no. Let me let me undo my turn. That was not what I wanted to do. Alright, let's get rid of this one. Uh, maybe I'll just go reinforce the barracks. Maybe I should build some archers. Ah, oh, shit, I used up too much money. Let's see, maybe I can go this way? With Koji, just move through the forests? Sounds like a plan. <laughs> Fuck all the trees! See, can this guy reach me now? No, he cannot. Ballistas are okay. They deal decent damage to line units. Once I become Fell Lord, our family will flourish. I'm so happy I could cry. Wahahaha. <laughs> Man, that old war. Hey, protocol. Donated 20 bucks to Super Shop. Mangs, long time viewer, and this is my first time ever seeing you live. I discovered you after Fire Emblem Tree Houses, and because of you, I am now deeply in love with the entire Fire Emblem series and Advanced Wars. Hope you are doing great. That's a very wholesome donation. Thank you. I'm very sick, so my voice is kind of struggling. But aside from that, I am doing fine. I'm just kind of tired of this. I've been sick for over a week, and it just won't let go. Like, it's... My lungs are just clogged up. He just won't let go. How's everyone doing? Freezing, but okay. Ugh. Errol? Yeah, fine, Errol. Just tell him you're fine. He's got enough to worry about anyway. <laughs> I'm alright. Just cold? Uh, I already said that. Get Orla. your own feelings. Two people can be cold, Orla. That's allowed. Ha. Alright, let's go get the villagers. Hello. Bless you, strangers. What an awful day we've had. My husband sprained the entire left side of his body trying to fit into Grant's armor. If that old armor fits you, feel free to take it for yourself. You got Great Granny Grimnil's Glittering Golden Girdle. Was this made by Fear Guy? Unit receives 25% less damage. Well, ain't that something? Oh, sorry, I didn't see that. What, you want to stay and fight? Okay, just promise you'll come home safe. I'll make us a big stew when all this is over. Hey, we got some dogs. Fenris and Fenris and Donut joined the party. Okay. This will be loud. This will be loud. Uh, let's see. Can I cut down some more trees? So I'd like to get myself a hawk bull. Let's get this one as well. Oh, right, the ballista. I uh, don't want the dog to kill me, so I'll just stay here, I guess.
Crimson Phil donated two bucks. It's okay, Manx. I care about you too. Thank you. Oh no, dog fight. Oh, is that like a is that like a mini dog? It's kind of weird. Don't forget to season your hunters. Rescue the hacking doggos! Oh my god! Ah, nice crit. There. Oh, wait, what? They can't attack? Oh, I just. No, never mind. I just fucked up. I guess I'll equip this armor. And then we'll go back and reinforce. Kill this harpy. There we go. Which units have I not moved? Oh, it's the barrack. Right, the barracks. I guess we'll just get some uh, regular swordmen out here. Oldbrook is a generic unit, but has an item equipped. Yeah, I mean, he's like a mini commander. Oh, man, they've been cutting down those trees. No, my barrack. All right, I do have my groove ready now if I want to. It's okay, I'll just capture it back. Oh, so they're actually treated as commanders. That's interesting. That's very interesting. Alright, there we go. I'm gonna be a little bit careful with my commander right now. Don't want to lose it. I think they're just regular dogs. Well, they get battle animations. Mayhem! Mayhem! Such a fine fellow requires more mayhem! We get it, Oldvad, you're very evil. Can I find... Okay. Ah, the Ballista does pretty shit damage to these guys. But, it's fine. I just wanted to get my commander up into the mountains. You're going down. Now, one thing you have to keep in mind in Wargroove is that the mechanic that reduces uh, terrain stars by HP. Yes, look, you get you get animations with these guys, so they're actually treated as commanders, which is interesting. The game like thinks they are mini commanders at least. But yeah, in Wargroove you do get less terrain per per uh, when you have less HP, so that is something you need to keep in mind when you play. Oldwad is on the move. No. Yeah, they're treated as heroes. But they're no stronger than regular dogs, so it's kind of weird. Oh, he just blew up his ally. That's kind of dark. That is kind of dark. Alright, we're coming for you, Oldwad. You have been terrorizing this nation for far too long. But no more! Oh, I can actually crit this guy from the mountain. There we go. That guy is dealt with, and uh, who knows? Maybe I can kill Oldabot next turn. If he moves into my range. Oh, I can summon Sparrow Bombs. Let's go. Activate Sparrow Bombs! 
There you go. So these guys have more health now. These guys are very scary in multiplayer. I've lost my hero to them a bunch of times. Reset for the doggos, mangs. No. I don't think I will. Oh my god! Oh my goodness! Koji! I almost died! Holy shit, you guys saw that? Woo! Oh my god! He nearly fucking killed me! Damn! He just used his item to blow up my shit. That was super scary, my goodness. Pain, such incredible pain. My beautiful family, I feel closer to you. <coughs> I have Wargrove 1, I haven't made it out of Chapter 1. Worth playing? That's a good game. My family, my beautiful family, I failed. I will claim the Fell Gauntlets, I will become the Fell Lord, and none of you are going to stand in my way. Rip Bozo. Errol! Errol, what's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? That man tried to kill us! That's what's wrong. We almost got turned into skellies, we did. And then I never see Daw or any Daw. Errol, hey. Wanna see something my mom taught me? Close your eyes, take a deep breath, and imagine you're somewhere safe and warm. Aye. Are you there? Aye. Yeah. Great. Where are we? We're in, uh... It's a library! A library. Okay, so you're a nerd. I get it. Huh? With cozy seats. <laughs> and so many books I could never read them all. And pancakes. Lots of pancakes. Hey! Is there anything in this library about Fallow that everyone's talking oh. about? Oh, right. I read about that. The Fell Gauntlet. Usually whoever wields the Fell Gauntlet can control the dead. Mm. But when the gauntlet is lost, when nobody's wielding it, the dead go proper mad. How could Voldra have lost the gauntlet in the first place? It's attached to his hand, is it not? If losing the gauntlet is what causes the fallow, then the last time this happened was when Heavensong killed the last fellow. What? Lord Voldra, we have to hurry. Oh no. Whoa. Alright. Uh, I need to take a piss, guys. Uh, I'll be back momentarily. Ooh.
All right. Ladies and gentlemen, let us continue on our journey, shall we? I've already found several glitches, really. I think I found some glitches uh, um, regarding Fog of War. It seems to be a behaving strangely. Anyway, let's go. Act 1, Mission 2. Or, sorry. Act 1, Mission 3. Felheim Fortress. The rescue squad raced to save Lord Walder, but are they too late? Hmm. Seat of power in the land of the undead. Ah, good old balloon. Major Shulsa, we finished surveilling the fortress. We bring news. Your Majesty, apparently there's no sign of Valder anywhere. His goons appear to be attacking Felheim Fortress itself. Then Valder. I think he's gone, guys. What? Gone? Like dead? I cannot believe it. We should say something to send him off. Oh, there he is. To Lord Valder. <sighs> Aye, to Lord Valder. To Lord Valder. Greetings. Oh, hello, children. Valder! Lord Valder! Valder! You alright? No. No, I'm not. Your gauntlet, so you did lose it. Stolen from me in the dead of night. So that's what caused the fallow. What can we do to help? <coughs> help? We are done helping this place. We may be treaty bound to help the Fell Lord of Felheim, but without the gauntlet, Vulture ain't it. Simple as that. Oh, ya. Ah. You've been trying to stop us from helping Felheim this whole time. What did you do? What did they do to Hola. you? What did they do? They killed Prince Koji's grandparents. That's what. The Fell King and his undead ilk. tragic backstory for a generic soldier man. They attacked without warning. The Imperial City nearly fell. Wait, Davis is not a mod anymore? I didn't demod him. Davis, why you why you ain't mod anymore, man? I didn't demod him. Emperor, what are you hiding? Your wife puts up such a disappointing fight. King Casper? King Casper was a generic cavalier? I was just a kid back then, but the Empire trained me well. When I saw the Fell King charge into the Emperor's chamber... Ah! Isn't this before Valder got the glove? Oh yeah, way before. I did it. I killed the coward. The gauntlet vanished in a veil of darkness. And when the darkness lifted at last, there was only Koji's mom cradling the head of her dying father. You cannot imagine the pain that Gauntlet has no. caused. I have no need to imagine. <laughs> I remember. When the Gauntlet vanished, Felheim erupted into Fallow. Your Imperial City stands strong to this day. My village, it no longer exists. My tragic backstory is more tragic than yours! Do not speak to me of agony. There is enough in Felheim to last eons. When I became Fell Lord, I vowed to prevent the next fallow. Having failed that, I will do anything to stop it now. Help me or do not. I will stand find a way if I must. What do you need? A way to the fortress. I will not fail. I must stop her. You heard the man, let's go. I wish the cutscenes were in full screen. Yeah, it's kind of weird how they're not. We need to find a way to get inside the fortress. But how can we make it across the river? We cannot fit all in one balloon. Take multiple trips, dipshit? Like what? If we close that floodgate, the river should be shallow enough for us to cross. Let's go. Why not just, like, go f back and forth five times? Okay. Nope. 
we know how mages work. They're anti-air units. They can heal. They crit when they're in heavy terrain, which is kind of cool. There you go. I like that it asks me if I know the balloon. Okay, these are new, by the way. It's like ostrich infantry. Flies over units, but must land on solid ground. Crit when second air trooper is the opposite of target. That's cool. That's actually really cool. I like that. Wargroove is still going. How long you think you have left? I don't know. I don't know how long the Undead campaign is compared to the uh, other one. Errol, I had no idea about Koji's family. And his ma seen it all? Must have been awful. Yeah, I mean, Boulder was evil. I mean, just be... I know Sigurdi was, like, the one who did the most damage, but... Walter is no saint either, like, I know that we allied with him to take down Sigurdi, but it doesn't mean Walter's like a good guy. We were just kind of allies by necessity. go. Alright. And now we can, like, where's the... Okay, so that's the lever, so we'll pull that. Close floodgates. Ah, and that turns it into a regular river. Looks like there's a clear path to the fortress now. Not clear, we still got a fight out of us. Move it on the double. Yeah, we still got the ballista at least. Do, 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 do. But we can at the very least take this barrack down. Hold it, soldier. Watch the range of this ballista. They'll rip your wings to shreds. Best to wait for backup if we can. Mm. Alright, let's reinforce. Can the balloon hold two units? Yes, it can, actually. That's pretty cool. I think the wagon can hold two unit, two balloons out too, which is pretty, pretty awesome. Hold up, I just noticed that the enemy has two colors, blue and black. Be careful, mates. Blue and black. We're gonna have such a good story to tell Da when we got home, Errol. Saving Felheim, storming a fortress. Careful, yell Jink. Jinx us. <coughs> I don't see any black units here. Engaging the idol stance. Koji, I must thank you for coming to my aid. Mom says a prince gotta protect his allies. Your mother does, does not look kindly on us, I fear. Yeah, cause you killed their guys. Waldra, are you okay? Yes, it's just difficult to resist the urge to tend to I'm the fallen. Real sorry. Ah, yes, we're really messing up your soldiers, aren't we? Perhaps you do them a mercy today. If I revive them now, they would just succumb to the gauntlet's rage once more. Rest in peace, dear friends. May the follow trouble you no more. I'm good now. Oh, okay, yeah, okay. So the ballista. Got it. So the ballista needs to go elsewhere. Alright, let's start attacking these guys. So for some reason the villagers can attack... But I'm not really sure. The villagers can attack the harpies. I guess it's because they have bows. Uh-oh. I forgot. Careful around those ballista soldiers. That'll cost us. I forgot. I forgot about the ballistas. There we go. So 
I need to be more careful about the- Oh, wow, they really- They do absolutely no damage. What the hell? Okay, we'll run back and reinforce. They should cost you a dragon, at least. I don't think I can get dragons yet, can I? Pretty sure I cannot get dragons yet. Oh, wait, 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 wait. They'll, they can shoot down balloons very effectively, can't they? Do, 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 do. Oh, we got the ballista here. I completely forgot about that guy. Oh, I could have I could have gotten the, the, the village this turn. Almost did it again. The ballistas are missiles, but not quite, because they can attack land units. So they're far better than missiles, really. But they're kinda like missiles? They're better missiles, in my humble opinion. So I want to be a bit careful with Koji, because I don't want him to die here. Oh, we can use our super groove now to heal our armies. That's actually pretty cool. We have a lot of injured units, so I'm actually okay with this. So I think this is actually Koji's new theme. I think all the commanders have new th themes. Who is more waifu material, Missile-chan or Ballista-chan? Hmm. Good question. I actually don't know. All right, we'll put down the healing field over here and move our units forward. Orla, ready. This yeah. is a cool new groove, I will admit. Like, I really like the combined healing in AOE. It's it's nice. We'll use the ballista to siege this tower, and we'll take it down. One of the, I really enjoy the attacking and damaging building aspects of Wargru. And I'll put Koja here to heal him as well. And then I can kill this archer. As long as I stay within the uh, healing aura. Oh, let's consume this as well. Oh, hi Vesper. Where is that girl? The nerve of her leaving me with all these undead. Enough, they're everywhere. Ah, you get away from me, get back. Vesper? Oh no, I forgot she was here. I should have known that cowback was behind this. All the trouble she caused us. Guess three years of banishment and isolation didn't calm her down. We're coming for you, Vesper. Do you hear me? Oh, Vesper is here. Approaching enemy base. Heaven speed, soldiers. Yeah, this commander right here. I tried her out a couple times. <coughs> let's see, let's see. Uh, oh, I can't even view her groove. Why not? That's dumb. Why won't you let me view her groove? That's not very pog of you. God, I love balloons. You're not supposed to know about enemy groups yet. What are you talking about? This is the second campaign. What's going on out here? An army now of all times? Sick up. Hopefully I can hold them off until that moron Ragnar gets back. Smoke and shadows. Shadow sisters? What? What's that? Can she stop on clones of herself now? That's new? Huh? That is definitely new. So how- Major, we neutralized all enemy structures in the area. Prepare for the final push. Huh. 
An imperfect copy of Whisper, able to cause considerable damage and to use smoke crowd shroud, but extremely fragile. Oh, okay. She's using a campaign groove, okay. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, I thought that was my ballista. Feels bad, man. Mm -mm. One ballista down. Let's make sure we're prepared before moving ahead. Alright, let's try not to mo lose any units needlessly here. Alright, we've dealt with them. Now let's get this barrack right here. I gotta say, I really like using these balloons. It feels good. The blue area, though, makes it hell to actually see where every... Like, I feel like once the blue flame comes down, like, it's impossible to really see anything anymore. I don't know if it's my color blindness or what Hi, it is. Mom. Watch out for Whisper's Shadow Sister. They deal nasty damage. Incredibly fragile, though. One hit from anything and that's enough to take them out. Okay. Whew. Okay. They're bringing in the big guns here. Thank God for this healing aura, Thanks, though. Manx, the blue flame makes it hard to see. It's not just you. Okay. Damn you. Right, it's us. Come on. Why don't you? We just want to wee chat. Oh, you're old enough to talk now. Heavens, help us all. I didn't really play much of the DLC, so I don't really know much about these characters. I don't remember Vesper from... I, I played a little bit of the co-op campaign with Ponsigadov. That's pretty much about it. But yeah, okay, it's, it's good to hear that it's not just me. Ugh, I pressed wait. I pressed wait. I pressed wait. I think this blue fire lasts for three turns. It should be up for a little bit longer. All right, let's get two sparrow bombs in here. I think we're gonna use them to kill the golem, honestly. Yeah. We're almost there, guys. Ragna. There you go. They're really powerful, actually. Oh my god, I got the groove ready again? Are you shitting me? What happens if I cast it again? Do we do we get two flames at once? Holy shit, we do! Oh my god. Uh that's kinda busted. Holy shit. Wow. Okay. Damn. Double Black Storm, yeah. Oh, it can be attacked. It actually has HP. That's cool. Ah, it can be attacked. Ah. Okay. Well, that actually makes sense. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, so that's how it works. But yeah, it's even harder to see shit now. My goodness, I can't see shit. Maybe I can get a dragon out? No, not yet. Can get a trebuchet out, though. Red of the Trebuchet, our siege begins now! 
Yeah, this is just a giant clusterfuck. Oh my goodness. This entire battle is just one big clusterfuck. I think the, the most annoying part is that I'm not able to see the terrain at all. Like, it's just blue. I have no idea. I mean, I could read it, of course, but that's boring. There we go. She's dead. Ain't nobody got time for that. They should blue fire as part of the animation, then tone it down after- Yeah, I agree. This day keeps getting worse. What are you brats even doing here? Don't your urchins have school or something? Nap time? Part-time jobs at a factory? Part-time jobs at a factory. Ha, <laughs> the golem suicided. Oh, looks like it finally vanished. There we go. This seems pretty easy. I mean, the campaign has been pretty easy so far. I failed on a couple of missions, but that's mostly due to my own stupidity. I wouldn't say any of the missions have felt, like, super threatening or anything. It's mostly just been move units for- oh. Smoke and shadows! <coughs> So is this Vesper's new groove, or is it just for this campaign? Because this isn't how she used to work. That's Tenko, Mr. Furia. Wait, no insults from me now? Nah, I'll let Errol get this one. Let her have it, Errol. That uh, wasn't very nice how you kidnapped our cat. We really need to work on your trash talk. And Dasis, he feels sorry oh. for you. Wolfar, sorry for me? He's the one who lost your mother. I'll surround her with the balloon. Ah, shit, the balloon can't go inside. Ah, that's kind of sad. Wait, can I detonate? Ah, that would have been a fun way to kill her. Build an Oni. Wow, Koji, are those... <laughs> you remembered, finally worked out those production kinks. This thing's unstoppable. It is kind of cute how they have little dialogue when you build random units. Pikemen are so OP! Nerf Pikemen. Don't let the Mark Gang bring you down. Mr. Four sounds way better. Alright. I'm gonna kill her with bombs. Let's hope this works! <laughs> pan, pan, pan. Wait, can't we talk this out? A lock bot. Everyone after her! What do you brats want? Fork over the fell gauntlet. You think I stole it? Okay, yes, reasonable assumption. But it wasn't me this time. I haven't stolen a thing since I was banished to this miserable... Vesper? Lord Valder? I mean, <laughs> how wonderful to see you again here in your own home. Ragnar. Where is Ragnar? <sighs> if I knew that, you'd think I'd still be here? Oh, there she is. Hmm? 
Vesper, was it? You're still here? What? Why, of course. I've been looking for you everywhere. Well then. If you wish to accompany this vessel, we depart at once. I have found the answers I seek. Huh? Why is her hair on fire? What? Ah, friends of Ragnar. yours? Ragna. Oh, it's you. Yes, I'm very familiar with you. I suppose I must thank you for this vessel. It doesn't fall apart like the other undead. Yet, unlike the living, this one obeys. You have done me an incredible service, however unintended. Ragna. And here I thought you smarter than the other fell lords. Do you truly not recognize my voice? Doesn't matter. Stand in my way and I shall cut you down. Ragnar! The voice on the gauntlet. You must shut it out. Come, Vesper. We leave, Anon. Anon? If indeed, it shall be we. Okay, that was weird. <laughs> we have to go after them. Prince, shush! Not another word from you unless it's how can I help or yes can do. Do you hear me, Shonsa? Prince Koji, sir. We just saw the balloon take off from the fortress tower. They're headed south. You will not escape. We must take them down. I cannot allow the fellow to persist. We can do it. My airship's more than fast enough. Baldur, can you show me the ma to your map room? Yes. Absolutely. This way. Prince Koji, wait. What's not Koji so cool now? <laughs> I he really showed that Koa back who's boss. Yeah! And that way he just leaped into action like that. So amazing. And he's so smart. Aye, um, I, I suppose. What? What, you suppose? He's brilliant. He's brilliant. Oh. Yeah, I mean, you're pretty smart too. Koji. He's always thinking of other people even when he's... Yeah, we get it. Suck Koji's dick. Uh, he's so thoughtful. Uh, aye, but... Hmm. Wait, he's handsome too, right? Oh, I never really thought about it, but that's so true. You've um, got a class. Shut the... What? Shut the I fuck up! Sorry, sorry, I, I hit, I hit my, I hit my cringe meter. I, I hit my fucking cringe cap. So the gauntlet p flies south for the winter, eh? And so shall I. Foo ha ha. Oh fuck, Odvar. My favorite villain. Alright. Act 2, Mission 1. While traveling with Ragnar, Vesper thinks back on how all this begun. Felheim Fortress. Fast library. Several days <coughs> earlier. No, not this. Not this one, no. Max, what are your thoughts on the game so far? It's fun to play. The story is horrible. Um, The story is, like, actively making me care less about the characters. I, I don't know if it's just... It's not really just the... Like, the first game was kind of quirky, too, but... I feel like the structure is just a mess. Like, the structure is just a mess. There's no scope. There's no sense of what's happening, where we're going, or nothing. Like, the story just feels like a jumbled mess of words. It's not even like Engage. It's not, like... I can't really put it into words. Like, I need to think a little bit on it. There's just something about the way this story is presented that just makes it all over the place. No, nothing. How is that none of these books mention the Fell Gauntlet? At this rate, I'll never escape Fellheim. Huh? Vesper, is that you? Huh? Lord Balder? Did he just turn on the light? Is this... What? Does this world have electricity? What? Can you explain yourself, game? Did you just turn on the lights? In a medieval world? Maybe they're magical lights, I don't know. Fucking hell if I know. I was just reading. Reading perfectly ordinary books about, uh... <laughs> the charming culture you have here in Felheim. After three years of servitude, the place has just grown on me, you see. Yes. yes, the day you leave us will be a sad one indeed. 
Ragna has such wonderful things to say about your teaching. How are Ragna's firm fur no mancy lessons developing? Yeah. Ah, you see, it's just Wonderful. <laughs> She's a perfect petite prodigy. I really must show you her progress. Eventually. At some point. Why not tonight? <gasps> tonight? I mean so soon? Surely three years is long enough to see something impressive? Besides, the kitchen is serving smoked blow blobfish tonight. Smoke magic would be quite the compliment, wouldn't you say? <laughs> ah, yes. Well, I do say many things I regret. Excellent. I look forward to the performance. Farewell. Farewell. Ah, hold on. How do you put it? Oh, oh, the voyeur? <laughs> <gasps> oh, the voyeur, indeed. Is that is this supposed to say, like, this is supposed to be like an R of R? Kind of thing. Where is that girl? It's nearly time. Politely ask to be like. <laughs> what? <laughs> Knock quiet. What the fuck is this? <laughs> what the fuck is this? Am I supposed to role play now? Like, what this game doesn't know what it wants. Politely ask to be let in. Not. What? Why? Get out of my way! Scared. Oh, I Get see. Good. Later, losers. Okay. I don't care about the story. Alright, my protege, just like yeah! you practiced. Yeah! Wait, no, much better than your practice, please. Ha, <laughs> sure thing, big sis. What? Big what? <laughs> so, uh, before I crush this test, I just wanted to say, even though I totally could have learned smoke magic on my own, thanks for sticking around and not giving up on me. Ragna, I am like quite literally being held here against my yeah! will. Yeah, it's like destiny, I feel it too. The talk time is over. Time to show you what I got. Mon dieu. You're ready. Is she French? Hang on. Should probably talk to old, old Valdi first. Greetings. Good evening, Ragna. Jeez, Valder, did you have to invite the whole fortress? This is so embarrassing. Embarrassing? My apologies. I merely thought. <laughs> For you, now everyone's gonna see I'm stronger than you. Um, uh, yes, good one. Good evening, Fellheim. Sounds like we have a dead audience in the hall tonight, eh? <laughs> Get it? Cause they're dead. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. This game. This fucking game. Yes, we love a good jest every now and then. Yes. But tonight is no laughing matter. I have an announcement. I am dying. Oh no. What? What? Eventually. As a mortal man, my time in this world. Oh, that's right. He is a human. I keep forgetting he's not a skeleton. He's just a human wearing a skeleton mask. As such, someday I must leave you. Rattle not, for I... <laughs> okay, that's kind of a funny line. Rattle not, for when I am gone from this world, Ragnar shall lead you in my stead. Yes. She will need to be strong, stronger than any leader in Felheim's history. Ragnar is well on her way, mastering Phronomancy's just in just three years. <coughs> uh, perhaps mastery isn't quite the term? Ragna may be unable to control the Fell Gauntlet, under as she no. is. But is that a weakness? Nay. Given time, Ragna shall usher in a new era. In an era where Undead govern themselves! Oh! Oh, that's Baldur's politics. He doesn't like it that Undeads are slaves! And he wants to free the- Oh, wow. Political commentary. Ha <laughs> No more shall you live in fear of losing your will to the fell gauntlet. No more shall cowardly fell lords force you to do their bidding. Tonight, your future leader shows us her strength and courage. Ragna, whenever you're ready. Uh, okay. New objective. Crush these losers. What? Uh. Huh? I don't get it. It's what? over, loser! See yes. that, Valder? Yes, I am well aware of your ability to smash things. I want to see Furnomancy. I'm just warming up. You guys aren't ready for... Special move! 
darkest nightmare of the solar sumber void. Ragnar's smoke show spectacular. Oh. Moron's never been able to do it. Special move. I'm unstoppable! Okay, that's actually really funny. It doesn't fit on screen. That's actually really funny. I like how it doesn't Ragnar. fit on the screen. Ragnar, you. <laughs> you actually did it. I mean, it was tremendously sloppy, but still, you conjured smoke for the first time. What? First time? What kind of idiot do you think I am? <laughs> it was... Finally nailed it last I'm night. I'm unstoppable! Women can do anything. What do you think, Voldork? How's that for a smoke show? Ha! Ha, what do you know? He's speechless. <sighs> I must say, I am surprised. <laughs> Three years of work and this is all there is to show? <sighs> what? Listen, Walder, I tried. I really did. Hmm. That's not your fault, Vesper. Clearly, the fault lies elsewhere. Yes. yes, I have been far too permissive of your behavior. How are you su to succeed me at Felheim's ruler without sufficient dedication? Should I fail to break out the gauntless curse before I die? How is an innocent child like you going to prevent the next fellow? <laughs> I'm trying! Who oh, are you? Then act like it. Honestly, Ragnar, you have embarrassed me tonight. Go to your room. We shall discuss this in the no! morning. What? What What did you say to me? I said I'm not going anywhere. Remember who made you. Yes, Lord Valder. <laughs> what happened? My head! Something was inside my head! You... Ragnar? You used the gauntlet on me? You said you'd never... It was a mistake, Ragnar. Ugh, shut up! I ought to use it on you, see how you like it. Ugh. Ragnar, you mustn't! You can't! You don't tell me what to do anymore. Ah, so that's how it happened. Wait, so she caused it? Present day, somewhere over the South Sea. Hmm. Uh, Ragna, now that you're the Fell Lord, we, uh... We really ought to tell the other leaders of Arunia. Yes, but... Don't you think? Hmm. We could stop by Cherry Stone, the Gloomwoods, Heaven Song. Ragna? I have told you before. I am not Ragna. <gasps> then who? Where are we not? When my business It's Sigri. It's fu she's fucking Sigri. No, she's not fucking Sigri. She is Sigri. Your friend shall remember. Oh. It's so obvious <gasps> she's Sigri. She's not my friend. A student, surely. Hmm. Housemates, perhaps, but friends? No. I have no use for friends. I do not care. Neither do I. Okay. <laughs> and just where are you taking us anyhow? South. The further south we can go. He is there. He is watching. The prince. Okay. So Ragna just took the gauntlet and now she's the fell lord. Got it. Wesper and not Ragnar make an ancient discovery near the South Pole. Hold on. Down below is that. Land the ship now. We caught so many fish today. A good omen for the winter to come. If it was somewhere here, I could have sworn. Outsiders? What should we do? Go warn the elders. I'll activate the guardian. But I thought that old weapon stuff was a myth. Doesn't matter if it is, we have jobs to do now. Will it ever work? Will it even work anymore? It's so old. There, I see it. You're quite a ways from home, aren't you? Someone's using mother's old toys to deter us. From what exactly? Ragna, stop right there. Criminals come. My, you are a persistent bunch. Very well, shall we? Oh, so I actually play as them now. Defeat those who stand in your way. 
Alright, so. Let's take a look at uh, Vesper. Alright, so here she is. Vesper. Summons a smoke claw that shields units from damage. Yeah, that's how her groove used to work. Oh, and now if she uses her super grove, she also gets two shadow sisters. Ah, okay. I see. So she gets double the range and two minions. That's really good. So this 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 is a very strong groove. Whenever she summons it, every unit that enters this AoE cannot be damaged, which is ridiculously good. That's way better than, than like, healing auras and whatnot. Is she the only one? Oh, we got Ragnar here, too. Let's see what she does now. So, uh, yeah. Shield jump. Jumps to target position. Pushing back enemies. Oh, it pushes back now. Interesting. And whenever she uses her big charge, it does more damage and pushes enemy back two tiles. Ah, okay. Alright. That's cool. Alright, let's open the treasure. Necrotic Arm. Whilst unit summon uh, summons a Felheim Sword Summon, it can act immediately. Cost 50 gold per... Oh, that's cool. Let's equip it. That is cool. So what is this? Guardian. Ancient Sentinel forged of stone and crystal. After it attacks, it must rest for one turn. So it's like a black cannon? Seems to be like something black cannon-y. So it's a it's a pre invincible. You cannot beat us, Ragnar. We got unbreakable bonds. Yes, you're twins, I get it. Not you? just us. You and Errol are pretty close too, hey Koji? Uh, what? Oh hey. uh, yeah? We can't beat them with the power of friendship though. Come on. <laughs> can't beat them with the power of friendship. That's actually pretty funny. They're making fun of Oh, what the fuck? What? Careless. What? Vesper. We do well to avail ourselves with that guardian. Defeat and capture it, and this battle will be over in short order. Oh, okay. So we just we just hit it with everything we got, I guess. Okay. Hmm. Bonk. Oh, Ray Skelly, let's go. That's cool, I like that. Hmm. 14, okay, so he doesn't hit back. So if we can just kill it, we should be able to... It can take a lot of punishment, though, my goodness. That is a lot of damage. Okay, but we can score a critical strike right here. That's nice. Can you turn on animations when the Guardian attacks Manx? Uh, sure. Hello. Let's go! Manx will never... Okay, that's right. We can, uh... Right. We can see the ostriches, I guess. Huh? Well, let's go fight my Moji. <laughs> I bet he'd be so impressed if he saw us smashing up a Skelly. Oh, I shut it. Well, this battle's in the bag. I'm just trying to help you out. Are they trying to turn a child gay? Is that is that what they're doing? Because fuck that. Stop. It's a child. Seriously. Go fuck yourself, Gorbu. Like, like, seriously. That pisses me off. He's a kid. Like, Jesus Christ, Gorbu. Actually, actually annoyed. Haha! Alright, let's uh, go always 
Don't tell them to fuck themselves, they're into that. Yeah, good point. Alright, you guys wanna see ostriches? Uh let's see. Ah, here's the guardian. That's what it looks like, and now you get to see the ostriches as well. It looks like it heals itself. Do, 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 do. Let's see. There you go. You got to see them. Mm, mm, mm. It's back to full HP, so you gotta. I guess you gotta, like, just focus it? Yeah, you gotta focus it. Hmm. Let's see, what should we do here? What's this? This is an... Did I attack with this thing already? I guess not. Man, this is a clusterfuck, isn't it? So I still have my skeleton, actually. So I think I'll just move... Actually, no, this is... Is this an allied skeleton? No, I'll move Ragnar in here. Boosh. You are wasting my time. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. What are we going to do here? Just... Oh, it's not mine. Never mind. That explains it. Okay, we've gotten it down to five. This is taking far too long. I have waited centuries. Surely you can understand. Yeah, th she's Sigiri. She's 100% Sigiri. She is 100% Sigiri. Koji. Koji, a little busy here. What's <laughs> up? Does my arrow look a bit cold? I better ride with Tenko because shut Oral. the fuck Ugh. up. Oh my god. Okay, it does heal, not to full though. I don't know what's what what is smarter to uh, to try and burst it down. It took out all our aeronauts. We got to get serious here. Hmm, it might be easier to just try and defeat Koji at this point. Shouldn't be that hard. Your children, you couldn't be older than what 14, 15. Try 13. Goodness, you should be at home. We're playing out outside somewhere. Why pick up a blade? Walder needed us. Nobody else wanted to come. Ah, so the adults failed, and now you're stuck with the mess. Century saw it, and the world has yet to change. Ooh, that's not gonna be enough, is it? Ugh. Maybe? Ah, oh, I killed him. Nice. Koji, oh, oh no, me. didn't have fret, Koji. Errol can tend to your wounds. <laughs> He's got a healing. Orla. Can you shut the fuck up about this already? Yeah, what's with you guys today? There we go, 2 HP. So it's not enough to just kill one. I think it might be easier to just rout the enemy than to kill this guardian. There's a ballista right there. Oh, we can use the shield jump now. Um, I d I, does this thing deal fi friendly fire damage? I actually don't remember. I think it does? If we do this. I'm gonna break you! No, the spirit inhabiting the gauntlet is 100% Sigiri. It's so obvious. She speaks just like Sigiri used to do. It's like so obvious. That thing hits rather hard. 
naturally, but it does have a weakness. It takes so long to charge that it cannot counterattack. Okay, I just hope I don't have to kill it. Alright, you're dead. Everyone, get back to the ship now, Errol. I'll let you... Please stop. Just fucking stop, work group. Stop it. Stop this bullshit. Hey! Hey, Koji. <laughs> Errol's got... Okay, repeating a joke five times kinda makes it not funny anymore. I told you before, stay out of my way. Oh shit, it can shoot now? Arrow! Orla! Ah, hang on! No means no, Wargroove. Yeah, I know, right? Take no for an answer. Oh, Act 2, Mission 3, da da da. It'll... Harold, there you are. Oh. Thank goodness. We fell an awful long way. Um, well, anyway, hmm. we should probably see if we can dig our stuff out of the crash, eh? Let's go. Oh, it's another guidance chapter? Orla found. Spar <laughs> Sparrow bomb. One of Corley's splody birds. That's gotta be useful, eh? Okay. Right? I'll just hold on to it, then. Orla puts the dangerous explosive bird, bird into her back pocket. Orla found a chest of 100,000 gold coins. What? Oh. Arrow, I've never seen so much gold in my oh. life. We're rich. Oh. You're right. Guess gold's pretty useless here. Still gonna keep it, just in case. Orla put the hundreds of thousands of metal coins into her back pocket. That's kind of funny. Discord moderators wrote this script. Orla found a pair of wet wooden now planks. We're talking. Bet she could use this wood to get a fire Arrow? going. What you think, Arrow? Oh. I guess might need to dry off a bit first, eh? Orla put the giant wooden <laughs> planks into her back pocket. <sighs> Ouch! We sh probably should have sta shouldn't stay here. Smoke's getting in my eyes. Arrow. Look, Arrow. A house. Let's try to find a way over there. Make your way to the old house. Use bomb. Arrow? Hey, Earl, think you could use your magic to help me get rid of this boulder? Why oh. isn't he speaking? I guess I could just use the sparrow bomb, I guess. <laughs> oh. I, I don't... These, like, missions... I don't know, man. It's, like... It's not why I want to play War Group. I'm gonna be completely honest. Hey, Earl, up for a snow fight? I'll let you have the first throw. You're right. We should save our energy. Alright, let's go over here. Why can't I go this way? What? I don't get it. Huh? Why can't I not... What? I don't get it. Even Errol is tired of her bullshit. Yeah, I guess. Huh? Invisible wall? Okay. Um, okay. Um. Ah. Uh, okay. So what am I supposed to do? I don't, this doesn't make a lot of sense to me, but okay. What is that? Hmm. How far down did you reckon it goes? Okay, we're dead. Orla found a nest of giant rabbit fell bats. Hero, uh, what do we do? You got a plan, eh? Wait! Wait a second. Dragons like gold, eh? Take the lock. Just let us go. Orla found minus 100,000 gold. Oh. Okay. 
That was close. What, what, what is this? Hey! What is this shit? Can I, can I play a mission? Like, what is this shit? What is this fucking cringe point and click bullshit? Let me play some war group. The game is actually really fun. The game is actually really fun. Like the base game is actually really fun. Why do you shove this bullshit in there? This isn't fun. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, but unlike Andaran Saga, you could skip those Gaiden chapters. Well, I used one half of the wooden plank. talking. Wait. But there's no, like, there's no, there's no thinking involved. I'm just moving from one area to the next and watching yeah, cringy cutscenes. Like, uh. like, there's nothing to this. It's not charming. It's not fun. It's just stupid. It's like a little mini game that they decided to put in there that has absolutely nothing to do with the re like just stop. This is so dumb. What's that? Let the game cook. Hate it later. No, I'm going to hate it right Beetle. now. Oh, he doesn't want to talk to us. Yeah, maybe That's because you kept trying to ship him with every guy on the ship. Huh. Very sad. Terribly sad. It Sorry. Great. Now we're done with that. We can maybe play a mission. So dumb. This stuff kills replay value. You better be able to skip these. Wake up, wake up. Your father says we have to leave now. Oh dear, is it too late? Valder dare, listen. I'm going to help your father downstairs. Mommy needs you to get your coat and run. Whatever you hear, you keep running, okay? You just keep running. Valder, you have to keep going, okay? Don't stop, don't ever stop. Don't stop, don't stop. Gah! Does he sleep with the bone mask on? What happened? What is this place? Oh good, you're awake. Oh, you're finally awake. Now that we've saved your life. Tell us why you've come here, or I'll end it. I mean you no harm. Oh yeah? Then take your red-headed friend who tore us tore through her yesterday. Red-haired. Ragna? Where did she go? So you are working with them. I must tell the elders. This is out of hand. Voldra, get your boat out of here. There's trouble outside. Who let you out of your cell? I did. These men mean us no harm. Besides, there's an emergency. What? Major, what's going on? Where are the twins, Prince Moji? Hmm, haven't been able to find them, but look. Oh no, it's Oldvad again! Good children, wonderful children. The frail gauntlet is near. I shall claim it to the name of our family. I fucking love Odvar. He's the best villain. More outsiders. It is as we fared. It's worse than we fared. Is that? No, it couldn't be. Valder, when the fallow began, I assumed you died. How unfortunate. Am I supposed to know you? This fight shall be. I don't fucking. I don't give a shit about the story anymore. No. Like, I swear. I am just completely detached from the story at this point. I don't care about the story. It is so disjointed and bad. Like, it's just such a jumbled mess. Like, the game is fun. I like the game a lot. But the story is so bad, it's not even funny. There hasn't been a single point in the story where I've actually, like, been enticed. Oh, cool, we got a dragon. I like these guys.
Oh, there's a chest here, too. Do, do, do. Check of Alder Super. After about seven hours of gameplay, understandable, Minx. Well, if if a story is good, I can I can read it for seven hours. I don't even need the story to be good. I just need it to be decent. But this story is just like it's so all over the place. It's like the developers had no idea what they wanted to do with it. This feels like a story that was improvised. Like they wrote it as they went. You may not believe me, but that little boy of a man over there—he was once part of my family before he abandoned us. Good riddance. What? Watch. I have no family. I was orphaned at the dawn of the last fellow. I am all that remain. <laughs> Is it worse than Engage Story? I don't really know if you can compare the two. I'm hurt. I really am. After all we did for you, little brother How Vivi. Did you? Hold the bud. The whelp remembers. All that's missing from this touching reunion is for you to die on your knees. Oh no, old divide is our family. <sighs> decades when the fallow decades ago when the fallow came, Old War was one of the old old other children I escaped with. Six of us traveled together for a <laughs> time, but never mind it matters not. How terrible. Old Dwad. Ooh, let's get an umpire unit. But I'll- oh, we, we need to check his super. Wait, I'm not allowed to do that for some reason. Maybe because he already moved? First story had a consistent team about reclaiming cherry stones, so it was easier to write. Yeah, I mean, the story of the first Wargroove game was... It wasn't like a masterpiece or anything, but it was very simple and easy to follow. It was basically just Mercia reclaiming her kingdom. It flowed nicely from start to finish. It was, it was cohesive. It was like, you always knew in which direction you were going. This game has absolutely zero direction. None. The game, it's just all over the place, story-wise. story, story -wise. Time was, you couldn't even look at a skull without bursting into tears. Okay, we gotta be careful. Besides, I was the one with real leadership experience. Wasn't it your leadership that got two of our... I don't give a shit about these two's backstory. Like, I don't. Like, you can exposition as much as you want. I, I don't care. Alright, let's see. Can I deal with these guys? My dragon is kind of in danger now, which is not great. So I gotta get him out of there. I love dragons, though. They're great. We gotta get some more entire units to deal with these guys. Capture some more villages, like so. <coughs> Ooh. Okay, the witches are going for my dragons. Not cool. You were always such a scared Leah. Blah, blah, blah. I don't care. No. So, is there a... Can I just snipe old Ah, oh, that sucks. Ah, he gets extra defense. It would be fun if I could just one-shot Oldvad with the dragon. That'd be hilarious. Okay, we gotta get out of range of this guy, so I say we just go... Like so. Boulder can kill the skeleton right here. Let's capture this air tower. There we go. And then we can reinforce. There's a lot of villages to capture here. But yeah, let's get the dragon away from that witch.
I like the game. The gameplay is really fun. What? The gameplay is really fun. I just don't give a shit about the story. So, uh, let's see. We got... Volter's not getting groove. Why not? Oh, is it because he doesn't have the Foul Gauntlet anymore? I guess that kind of makes sense, actually. Ah, okay, so Volder just cannot... He's just a walking... He can just attack people now. He actually can't rescue... That, you know what? That's a neat little touch, actually. I like that. It, I guess it wouldn't really make a lot of sense if he could just continue racing undead. So yeah, I actually like that. That's that's too, that's too bad. I really like Walter's groove. Walter, don't raise your skeletons, Walter. Doo, doo, doo. I do like these new like ostrich riders. They're pretty cool. It's gonna be interesting trying to use them in uh, a PvP format. Oh shit, he's blowing up people. Be careful, old Vod. Uh, let's see, can we just move in with the dragon? Yes, we can. Mm hmm. We have this entire unit who I think, yeah, they one shot harpies. That's great. These ballistas are actually surprisingly hard to kill, but the ostriches deal really well with them. And this dragon is just being chased by this witch. It's not really doing anything. Maybe we can kill it next turn. Open the dang chests? What chests? Hold the water, no! How dare he? Wait, can I... Can I kill this guy now? I don't think so, maybe? What if I use the hex? Let's get another dragon going. Pressed wait by accident again. What else is new? <coughs> the chest loot box next to the capital below the barracks. Oh, that one! I completely forgot about that guy. Huh. Ah, who needs the who needs the chest anyway? It sucks. All right, I think I can kill Old Bud now. I got two dragons in range. All right, let's kill Old Bud. Old Bud, you've Old Bud, you've Old Bud, your last Bud. No, I cannot fall here. What will become of my? I don't give a shit, dude. Die. There you go. Come, children, help your father. <coughs> they won't listen to you, they never did. But I don't understand, how have you traveled with them this far? Even now, why don't they devour you? After you all left me, I learned a simple trick. Old Dwight's patented method for blending in with the undead. All you need is a few good memories. Making pot pies with your parents, sitting by the hearth with your dog, fishing with grandma. Take all your memories from before the fallow and burn them. 
Holy yourself out. After that, nobody can tell you're alive at all. Not the dead, not even you. Oh, isn't that beautiful, being free of all feeling? What a c -c clever child I was to figure that out all by myself. Old what? Vivi, that dead look in your eyes, did you learn my trick too? Oh, you're much better at it than me, so that's how you come to be the Fell Lord. Where do you think you're going? Perhaps it's only right you take the gauntlet for yourself. I care too much for my family to abandon them now. Come, children, it's time to go home. Victory! <coughs> the tone is all over the- Yeah, this game doesn't have a theme at all. It's all over the place. There you are. I'm looking all over. Um, you alright there? No. No, I suspect not. I thought I had escaped the fallow as a child. Has it been with me all this time? When I saw Aldvar's army chasing villagers burning homes, I was a child again. I couldn't breathe. I had to fight myself to move. Yeah, I get it. Back at the Cherrystone Castle, when I saw your bonehead sh soldiers coming up the hill, I went back too, to the invasion at Heavensong Palace years ago. I don't even remember the fight. Seeing Koji snap me out of it, I'd do anything for that kid. Maybe someday. The world will be safe enough that we don't have to go back all the time. Even if I never see that world, I hope Prince Koji does. Hmm? Ah, our dear friends. How are we? Nice and warm, enjoying the mushroom soup? It was a little bitter, to tell the truth. Wonderful. Alright, we got another job for you. Let's go. What? We just saved all your butts! Look, I realize it isn't fair, but we are all in grave danger. Did a nine-year-old write this?! <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just... It's just dialogue, it's just so bad. A nation of cacophony and Sylmore were to be united with blood. All seemed well. Fucking Shadows of Etheria has a better story than this. But before the wedding, the countries were embroiled in a bitter war. To win the war, Cacophony's queen forged an abominable weapon. A weapon that corrupts life and death itself. The queen's son was horrified. How could his mother use such a power against their neighbors? In protest of the war, Cacophony's prince stole his mother's weapon and ran off with the heir of Silmore. The pair resolved to take the gauntlet as far away from humanity as possible. To the very end of the world. But their packed path was fraught with danger. And one of them would not survive to journey's end. Come on, Tanko. We can't stop now. Everyone, they're counting. Counting on me. Come on, Koji. What did mom teach you? Imagine. Someplace safe. And warm. It's not a good idea to do that when you're freezing to death. You should probably just focus on getting to a warm place rather than dreaming yourself over, o on, over to one. Oh, hey, Errol's here. Of course, he is dummy. It's his house. Hey, you're leaving. Don't... I haven't even told you. Told you. Koji! What's he saying? What's he saying? What's going on? I fell asleep? I died? Koji! You're alive, idiot. <laughs> You're alive. Where is everyone? Uncle Shosa? Volder? Done again. It's just us. We saw some balloons heading south a few hours ago. We was going that way till Errol took off in the blizzard like a loony. Said he said something. I don't know how he know he noticed you. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. Uh, Are you okay to walk? Uh, or do you need more? He's sitting on top of a golem. I don't... He's not walking. Yeah. I feel great. We still gotta stop Ragnar, right? What are you talk waiting for? Hop on. According to and it goes back to narration again. This game is like I I can't follow. It's so fragmented. 
it go it, it jumps from cutscene to vision to dream and then back to narration again. Like you got you can't Oh my goodness. Half the weapon is buried somewhere in Earth where the prince perished, but the other half, the more dangerous half, the one we fear the most of all. Oh wow, the Gauntlet of Destiny, okay. Oh my goodness. Things head south, people too. Is this it? Are we finally here? I swear, if you tell me just a bit further one more time... Jasper, we can't go any further. It's just impossible. This is as far south as it gets. He's here. Just a bit further, my love. Uh, what? Might I direct your attention to the army headed our way? There's always one final trial, isn't there? Vesper, wait for me inside. Don't touch anything. I'll tend to our guests myself. Ah, I thought the villagers had returned, but it's only you. Moved from using children to fight your battles, I see. Or have they already perished, sacrificed for your selfish pursuits? Ragna. Ragna. How many times must I repeat myself? Ragna is no longer here. You've lost her by your own hand. Tonight, you deal with another child of a worthless ruler. Harmon, Prince of Cacophony. Huh? Uh, okay there, Walder. Ragna, you must be in there somewhere. What? I will not give up on you, not again. Who? What? Oh, okay, so she's... She's... A, she, okay. Alright. When did that happen? Also, like, why... I gotta be honest, like, this, this controlling multiple armies kind of thing... I find it a little unnecessary. It's just confusing. Like, just make them all one color. Also, Volger still can't use his groove, so... I guess there's that. Alright, let's get a dragon out. I like dragons. Oh, there's a guardian, for some reason. It's another one of those. Can we kill it? We can. Easily enough. Oh, shit. Uh. Hey, we killed it. It's done, it's down. Useless toys. I shouldn't be surprised they couldn't save Mother's Kingdom either. Take the lot, I don't need their help. I don't need anyone's help. Ooh, edgy. Alright, we got a lot of dragons. use this harpies. Uh, I gotta say, though, it's a little boring how Valder doesn't have his groove. It makes him very boring to play as. From a story perspective, it makes sense for him not to be able to use it, but it's like... I don't know, I also miss racing skeletons, you know? That's kind of what made Valder fun. Alright, Barracus is down. Oh shit, that's an entire unit, I just realized. Let's see. Mangs, at the very least you're having fun. The gameplay is great. But I will be honest, the, the just disjointed story does detract from the experience. Like, the fact that I just don't give a shit about the characters or any of the story it does... It does make it harder to enjoy the story, sadly. Or to enjoy the game. But yeah, the game is fun. I mean, there's there's nothing wrong with the gameplay. The game... The Wargroove is a fun game to play. Ragna! Ragna, please listen to me. 
capture the Guardian? I could actually explain the story and why it's kind of messy, but they had a clear idea for it. Okay. Don't forget to explain it. You're just like Mother, feigning concern for her children only after they're long gone. Here in this body, I feel all the pain you caused in this vessel. She's better off without you. Go home. Ragna, what is this? I have cared. I have always cared. What? What were your words again? You embarrass me? You disgrace yourself? You disappoint me? Yeah, you failed at the mission, so... Yeah? You kinda sucked, Ragna, so... Of course. Well, these dragons are kind of fucking everything up. Enemy recruitment structures down. Commencing siege. Show them the strength of the heavens. Alright, still got a lot of villages to capture over here. I say we just save the money. Build some more dragons. Arr, kill him, throw him in the river, off a cliff, I don't care, just make him stop! Nothing to say no. for yourself? It is as you say, I am a coward. Yes, well, congratulations, you're not as stupid as you look. Now go home and shame and leave me be. Oh shit, we got more guardians. Wait, they ambush us? Really? Who set Ragna on fire again? Who knows? Alright, can we kill her now? Ragna, I hadn't realized, but every moment of every day I had lived a fairer that the fellow would return. I cannot escape it. I built my entire life around that fair. Okay, cool. Uh, why can't I fly over the walls? Why not? Is it because the dragon is in the way? Let's get some Storm Owls. Maybe even a, maybe a Ballista. Oh, we can't afford that, sadly. Some Antire, then. Alright, we got all the villages here. That's good. Ah, these villages need to be taken down first. Yeah, the walls, they prevent you from, like, they prevent flyers for some reason. I'm not entirely sure why. I guess they just reach to the roof or something? I don't know. The corpse of a giant siege machine is green. You can probably do something with it. That night at the fortress, I was blinded. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Forgiven us, he asks. Oh no, my dragon! Alright, let's see yes. if I can do something here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very... Very, 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 very sad. Very sad. Kill this guy. This guy. Mm -mm. Do we have anywhere to heal? Doesn't look like it. We can heal this guy up to 5 HP. Activate? Ah, oh, cool. 
I have a guardian now. Sweet. <laughs> I guess it's my guardian now. Is half of your head green or why does it cut off? Because that's where my webcam ends. They're like Super Famicom Wars proto tanks. Okay, that's kind of cool. Okay, alright. So, does this thing do a lot of damage? I guess it does. Nice. 85 damage right here. Should be easy enough to kill. It is a little annoying, I gotta be honest. That I can't... F I don't understand. I mean, I guess they're like pipelines in, in Advanced Wars. You just can't fly over them for whatever reasons. It just feels a little cheap, is all. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's do the ballista, I guess, so we can shoot from a distance. Kill this village. Let's attack these villagers, take them over. Why is the story of this game is this bad? I guess people can't write. Oh, cool. Is she gonna use her power now? Nah, she's just gonna raise skeletons. Oh, they actually used the hex? That's interesting. Okay, how do I kill this thing? Um, I do have a ballista. There we go. And then I guess we'll build another ballista because there's a lot of air units. Let's capture it. Mm, I pressed wait by accident, but I don't really give a shit anymore. Taking the story would be a great reason to promote Andran Saga. Why? They're two different games. Thing is, I do get the sense that they're trying to develop the characters, it's just... It's not working for some reason. I don't think I'm unreasonable. It doesn't take a lot to make me endeared to a character, but for some reason it just... They're not able to quite do it, it just feels weird. Let's move the ballista forward a little bit here. Kill this archer. Let's move in Valder. Nothing on the step. I'll take you myself. Stay back. We get it. You're mad. I should probably get some more anti air units out. Oh, I didn't capture this village yet. Should probably do that. More like war grooming. <coughs> oh my god. <coughs> <coughs> oh. oh fuck it, Annika, you killed me. Oh my god, Hanukkah, you fucking killed me. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my goodness. Oh. <coughs> oh. Holy shit, Hanukkah. Oh, that got me. 
Ugh. Arg. Arg, arg. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow. Huh? Wow, wow. Uh, let's see. Let's just focus her down. While trying to keep Mulder alive. No, they took our tower. Let's just get more ballistas out. We'll kill them next turn. It's fine. This lung sound pretty wet. Yeah, I. <coughs> yeah, I'm. I'm. I'm still pretty sick, which may factor into my inability to pay attention to the story. Maybe. Where'd she go? Oh, there she is. Kill her. Kill her. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Got her. Ragna. Ragna, my child. Stop it. Not another word. That I've hurt you so carelessly it is unforgivable. Stop it. Don't come any closer. I want to be here in the present with you. So please come back. I can't take this. Aw, Yogder. Tears? Why now? Curse it all. He cured her with a hog. Ah! The gauntlet. Not yet. The last of my strength. I will not fail you, Sardino. Sardino? <laughs> Who the fuck is Sardino? Fucking Sardino, what is he like the Lord of Fish? No, Sardino. Please! I haven't eaten last. <laughs> Just steal the foul gauntlet, they say. How hard could it be? <laughs> Sardino. I doubt I'll ever get my hands to it at this rate. So why am I still here? That girl. Ten more minutes, then I'm leaving. This time I'm serious. Ragna. Oh. Call well, Sunrise. Give it up, Wesper. What are you and Ragna oh. planning? Oh, my plans got ruined. I'm just as lost as you, brats. What was that? Oh no, we're too late. He's awake. What have you done? Why? How did you get sick? I don't know. Probably got infected by someone. <coughs> there's a hand sticking out of that. What? It's another gauntlet? Look, there's a person inside. No. No, 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 no. I'm out of here. Hag. You'll just leave Ragna behind then. You really are a heartless hag. That thing is dangerous, right? How can we stop it? We don't know. Even our ancestors could not imagine what to do if he awakened. Who? Sardino? We gotta try something. What? Custom? Me? What are you talking about? Hey. Oh, they killed Koji. Koji! That's, that's a shame. Oh, never mind. He's back. Children behind us. It's preparing another attack. Chatter, chatter. The villagers, you can still speak? Will they help us? Aye. If we can destroy whatever that thing is, we should be able to save Koji. I can handle that. Koji, please be okay. Okay. Oh no. We gotta defeat Sardino. There he is. It's okay, Sardino, we're coming for you. Can you load knight? No, you can't load knights into balloons, sadly. Makes sense.
final boss was Sue's tremming all along. Hmm? I guess they're like going through gates. Okay, interesting. Oh, okay. Alright, so these are like teleportation tiles then. Got it. Can I damage them? Yes, I can. So, we can just destroy them. And that'll shut them down. Okay. Makes sense. Let's go and reinforce a little bit. Okay, so it hits back pretty hard. So if we want to attack it, we probably want to... We'll need to choose our units carefully. We have not much gold. I don't know how we'll get more. <laughs> you handle the money. I'm bad at that. Okay, so we don't we don't have a lot of money. Zero income, actually. Defeat Prince Sardine of Silmar. Win with 12 or few more turns. Repeat. Defeat the an enemy commander with a bird. So we don't have any money at all, then. I guess we'll just get a vampire. Stop. I don't understand. What did I do? What? What that? I don't understand. I don't understand the plot either, Koji. It's fine. I have no idea what's going on. Um. Alright, let's smash this thing, I guess. Whatever it is. Oh. Oh, it teleported away. What? What is it doing now? It's shielding itself. We'll not be able to attack it until we break the spell somehow. Hold on, hold on. How do we do that? That weird growth seems like a good place to start. Okay. Destroy the weird growth. I can do that. Are we war- we're war grooming. Tentacle attack animations? Hey, I found money. Nice. Shields down, looks like. Aye, we're coming, Koji. Orla! We can cross the ch chasm faster if we capture one of those portals they've been using. I mean, we could just fly over, too, right? Alright, I want a dragon. Or, sorry, a fell bat. No! Oh! Look at that, I pressed wait again. Oh, so if you capture the portals, they become yours. Okay, that's pretty cool. I like that. That's actually pretty cool. Sup, Mangs? Sup, Monster Chief? So once we capture them, we can use them at our will. If you're hurting, tell me how to help. Wait, is the gauntlet hurting you? We can take it off. Ko Koji, didn't I make it? Don't make it angry. If I lost you, I mean, if Ma lost you. Ha ha ha. Funny. Who are you playing as? Uh, the good guys. Oh, it's, it's killing Koji. What the hell? I don't know your mom. So where does this go? Oh, I need. I, do I need to capture the other portal first, maybe? That could be the case. Yeah, I might. I might need to capture both of the portals. Now that you have multiple portals, your units may teleport between. Them. Ah, okay. So you can actually choose which portal you go to entirely. Ah, okay. I see. Yeah, that makes more sense. Do, 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 do. So 
was Pistillo villain after all? We don't know yet. Maybe. It's difficult to know for sure. Maybe she was, maybe she wasn't. These things are not so easy to know. Oh, we have our healing aura. Let's use that. Cooling water! So once we take that portal... Ah, oh, shit. That's not good. So the game has healing water and healing fire? Yes. Alright, let's uh, capture the portal. There we go. And now we can use everyone. Wait, what? Oh, do I have to wait a turn? It might be that I have to wait a turn before I can use it. Maybe. I'm not sure. Yeah, I think it takes a turn for the portals to become active. So, that makes sense. Ah, cool. You can lo load these ostrich riders into the... I uh... actually didn't know that. You can... How long is this game? It's pretty long, apparently. But I want to finish this campaign at last, at least. Okay, now! Now I can use the portal, right? No? But it's right! I captured it! What? I don't get it. Huh? Oh, okay, never mind. I can use it. Never mind, I absolutely can use it. Okay, there we go. That's much better. There we go. And we can do the same thing here, honestly. What are we going to do with this dragon? I don't know. Let's just keep it here. Actually, no, we don't want to get shot at. Actually, we can probably use... Oh, what's this? Oh, let's heal our army. There we go. I... Oh, shit. Did I... Oh, for fuck's sake. I literally just placed it in range. What the fuck? There you go. That's better. I think I'm actually... I want to redo my turn anyway, because I want to use this portal to get my hero over. Oh, you can use both of the portals. So oh, that that works, I guess. Oldwad is the best villain in this game, yeah, for sure. He has such a deep character growth. It's not my fault that you guys can't comprehend the majesty that is Oldwad. What a what a what a great character. I will I will I will tolerate no slander of Oldwad in this in this uh, stream. Like, how could you possibly shit-talk Oldvar? Hmm? What? Oh, there we go. For some reason, sometimes when you click on the portals, they don't work. And I'm not entirely sure what causes this to happen. It's really weird. Alright, I think we got most of the units over to the other side now. Just a few more units left. 
Odor is the key to the story, indeed. Alright, let's kill this uh, vampire right here. The only real growth in this game is the brain tumors caused by experiencing the story. That's funny. Alright, well, I've killed the portals. Don't know if these units are enough to kill this, but uh, I guess we'll just have to find out. Not quite. Do, 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 do. Wow, even the AI is pikeman spamming. How stupid. Alright, there we go. The portal fights back for some reason. Yeah, it does. I don't know why. Alright, let's put down another healing tile. Cooling water! Cooling water! <laughs> so, I'm guessing when we attack this guy again, he's gonna retreat once again. Feels like a three-time kind of thing, you know? I'm just expecting it to happen, you know? Okay, I'm attacking with the golem. No? Okay, he didn't run away. He did not run away. How surprising. Yeah, there we go. He's gonna retreat back to that location now. Okay, another shield. Okay, so how are we gonna get by this one? Okay, we have to kill those guys now. Hey. These guys move in the same turn they spawn? Are you serious? You fucking ambush spawning me, game? That is not cool. Wargroove 2, now with ambush pawns. Great. I right, get some gold at least, that's good. Uh, He's not gonna die, uh, guys. Ooh, ah, ah, ooh, ah, 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 oh, 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 Best story. It is kind of nice how the music changes. It's a nice tonal shift. I'm getting another dragon out of here. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -da -ba. We finally get another Mengs NPC stream. Fuck yeah! Oh, ah, oh, ah, ah. Oh, oh, oh. The healing aura is actually pretty nice here, not gonna lie. Oh, ah, oh, oh, ah. Oh, oh. Alright, we got another dragon out here. That's great. Let's go kill this fucker once and for all. I'm just gonna heal up a little bit more before, before I do. Ah, this healing is nice. Alright, let's bring in the dragons. They do 63 damage. Nice. And some more money. For some more dragons. So I think I can just rush that thing now. Oh, the bridges are coming up. That's nice. Orla, we've got the 
Gonna build another dragon. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Ba 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 of course Koji's not gonna die. Makes sense that Koji's not gonna die. Alright, so I think if I just charge in and kill the shield with the dragon, right? I'll just win, surely. What? Why did that dragon die? What? Why did my dragon die? Huh? Why did my dragon die? What bullshittery is this? What happened? Wait, wait. Huh? W what was that? Something in the fog? Ran out of fuel? <laughs> My dragon ran out of fuel? Run out of fuel! <laughs> this stupid game! What the fuck is wrong with this game? <coughs> I hate it when my dragon runs out of fuel, yeah, it, it's the worst. Alright, finally. There you go. Oh no. Would you recommend this for the Switch? I don't think Wargroove is out for the Switch. I think it's PC exclusive. I haven't heard anything about it being available on the Switch. I think it's Lich I think Wargroove 2 is PC only. Oh what? no. I thought we beat it, Feral. What's going on? Oh, you got to be fucking shitting me. Really? Sordino, where there you are. Sordino, I found you at last. It's no trick, it really is me. I've been searching for you all this time. Life is harrowing without a body. Are you not pleased to see me? Oh, is it on Switch? Oh, okay. I didn't I didn't realize. A cousin, that kid in the battle mech, Sordino? Even if that's true, it's been thousands of years. Cacophony and Silmar are no more. We're free. It's not our duty to stay behind. It never was. If the people of this world crave weapons so badly, well then. Mess around or find out, I always say. Is there anything else you were concerned about, my love? So why can one hand speak, but the other not? What's next? To be honest, I'm not a clue. But we'll go there together. Here, I'll hold your hand. Oh, nice. <laughs> Lord Valder uh, and Ragna. Is she, uh, you know. Uh, I'm I what? Me. Say it to my face, loser. <laughs> oh, nice. She's back. Oh, yeah. That's her, all right. Ragna. Ragna. You look tired. Perhaps a rest would do some good? Rest? Yeah. I don't need a rest. I'm unstoppable. I missed the rats. <gasps> She's undead. Why does she sleep? Now that you mention it. <sighs> we've had a long one, eh, Errol? I... We could probably... Guys, come on. Vesper's still out there. We gotta... Prince Koji. Children need rests, including yourself. Yeah, you're not the first person to say that to get a... What was that sound? Yeah, it sounded like someone squirted paint or something. But it feels like if we don't do something, I'll let everyone down. You, my friends, my family, the whole empire. <laughs> the 
oral, the world asks a lot of children, if I remember, but for today... You've done more than enough. Please rest. The sound of children falling down, according to Chucklefish. Mm. Huh? Huh? Curious. <laughs> Interesting. The fell gauntlet, it's, uh... Quiet for the first time. Alright! So that was the second campaign. Uh, story was a lot worse this time. Gameplay fun, though. I, I just... So, it's not bad in the same way Engage was bad, it's just... It feels like the plot lacks direction, that's all. It's like all over the place. It doesn't know how to set a tone. Like, I don't understand if I'm supposed to laugh, or be afraid, or take it seriously, or... Like, it just goes from one mood to the other without any forewarning at all. It's very difficult to kind of get invested in the story when the tonal shifts are so random. So, it's weird. But yeah. Children need not be soldiers, that's what they need. Laugh until cry, I guess. Okay, yeah, the game is on the Switch. It's kind of weird how you get credits after every campaign. I don't really know why. Ah, uh, Recommend. Um... So, there is one thing that really worries me about this game, if you go to multiplayer and then online. It's the exact same system as Warcrew 1. You have quick play, host game, and join by code. Um, uh, this is a terrible system. Why can't we have a matchmaking system? Or a rating? Like, you need to differentiate players by skill, otherwise you can get matched up with complete noobs, noobs or grandmasters. That's... terrible. Like, why is this such a hard thing to do? Like, if you want to have a good multiplayer experience, you can't just do this. This game's gonna get played for a month, and then the servers are just gonna die. You need to actually, like, incentivize people to play online to be able to improve their skill and whatnot. I really don't know. So, uh, War Group 2, it's a mixed bag. Uh, I'll probably put out a video talking more extensively about it. Uh, I don't want to get too negative, but it's... It's a fun game, and I like the new additions a lot. The new units seem like a fun addition. But man, the story is terrible. Much worse than the first one. So, um... Yeah. It's fun, though. Would I recommend? Not sure yet. Not sure. But, uh, yeah, I... I, I can't go on for any longer. I'm sick, so... Seven-hour stream is more than enough for me, guys. But I hope you guys got something out of it. Um, sorry if I was a little too negative towards the end there. I think the fact that I'm sick and cranky probably adds to that. Uh, but I just, at some point, I just had enough of the story and I just skipped through it. There's only so much cringe I can take. Anyway, guys, I'm heading off. Hope you guys enjoyed. Sunday, we're gonna be streaming Awakening again, so look forward to that. Bye-bye, everyone!